Okay, hello. Wow, okay, so my, my toggle, my push to talk button toggle does not work anymore. 
Oh, snap. Okay, I don't know what that's about. Wow, it does work. It just wasn't wanting to work for me in that moment. I fixed it. Well, I told you guys that I would have a new chair, right? Dead 21, what's up, man? And guys, there has been a massive update to last night. The wife found the fucking phone. She found it. It was apparently in my son's room, underneath a cushion, covered in toys, and a whole bunch of other stuff. And she found it. We tore apart the whole house last night. After the stream was over, we tore up the whole house. We even woke our kids up and everything and checked their rooms. She found it today when she got him out of his room this morning and actually, you know, changed his diaper and stuff. Like, it was just like, it was there. So, that's, like, huge. That's a big deal. Her iPhone is fucking expensive. I am not buying a new one. Hell no. Hell, and if I would have gone and reported it today, we could have gotten somebody fired. That's my other main concern. Like, we've had issues in the past at our local grocery store where a guy came up and put his arms around her and everything in the grocery store, and that dude got fired on the spot. Like, that shit does n is not cool. So, holy fuck. Um, however, my chair is broken, and yes, I told you I'd be using a replacement chair. This is what I got. The coffee table! Yay! Let's make sure that's... Uh-oh. There we go. Oh, that ain't working. There we go. Ta-da! <sighs> okay. I don't know why these earbuds make my one ear so itchy. All right. <sighs> Man, I'm actually that's like the biggest thing, and I saw the donation. Um. For the twenty dollars, thank you, Fud Cannon, my friend. I, I, it was the middle of the night, and you donated at some point before I started streaming today, and I saw it. So thank you guys so much. Um, this section, is, like this video, is also going to go up on YouTube after the stream. Uh, I'm going to put in update and stream of Albion. You know, update to phone or whatever. That's what I'll title it as because you guys were so freaking awesome. And Deceptive Cobra, thank you for reaching out with the community. Uh, Thorlar, uh, Deceptive Cobra, all of you regulars here in the stream, all of you guys, Spiritual Jedi, and you folks with Spiritual Jedi's crew and their Jedi Dojo, thank you for all the crazy-ass support you guys have been giving me as well. It was actually extremely appreciated yesterday. Um, you know, if I missed a name or something, please let me know in the comments. Uh, you know, on on YouTube, or you know, send me a uh, a YouTube video and like bash me or something. I don't care. Uh, a tweet. I, I, you know, it's it is it is what it is. Social media. I, I kind of just have fun with all this, guys, and. I was so frustrated. I wanted to let you guys know what the hell, like, why I was so pissed. And it was like a, a combination of things. And, you know, we had just gotten my son, you know, to the hospital and back. And uh, the wife let me know it wasn't his shoulder that was messed up. It was actually uh, his elbow here. Um, basically, his forearm had come out of socket from the the joint here in the elbow and basically the doctors had uh, her grandparents hold his arm the doctor grabbed his his arm and went twist and it went back into place like that was it so that's how that went I was totally giving you guys the wrong information when I said shoulder it was his elbow and apparently it's so common it happens all the time and that it's a simple uh, procedure and that it, it 
it's quite literally, it's nothing. You go in, you see the doctor, they take care of you, and they send you home in a matter of minutes. That's that. They were back in like an hour. You guys saw that on stream. So, <sighs> man, enough with that. Let's get back up in the channels. We are playing more Albion because I know you guys don't want to see the Fallout 4 stuff, so I am actually going to record that and upload it to YouTube uh, as a side game. Like, I, I, I know you guys don't really care. Like, I... I want to play it live, but just there is no one there to watch it. <laughs> Everyone hates Fallout 4 already. On Twitch, anyway. On Twitch. Doesn't mean YouTube doesn't love it. Does not mean YouTube doesn't love it. YouTube folks are eating it up like crazy. Wow, I, I even misspelled. <laughs> Alright, let's jump over to our stream so you guys can see everything I see. Boom! Yep, there was that $20 that came in. I have to... Wait, no. There. Um, I have to change our donation campaign. I'm sorry I didn't actually change that sooner. Um, I'm going to be do I'm gonna, literally going to be searching for a chair. Um, I also wanted to let you guys know I completely revamped our Patreon. This is what our Patreon looks like. You know, the plan here, you know, it's simple. I, first and foremost, I want to tell you guys about funding, how to support me as a full-time content creator and producer, and I also want to clearly explain you to you guys what to expect from your support. Uh, you know, and the absolute last thing, I want to continue making the best content possible and start improving whenever possible. I, you know, this is this is what I love doing. You know, streaming full time is my passion, as I state. And I hope you, you know, with your guys's with your guys' support, I can do this for a very very long time. I hope to be able to, you know, keep creating content and collaborate with other streamers and eventually, you know, start saying, hey. Moderators, we're all going to PAX East, PAX South, PAX Prime. We're all going to TwitchCon. We're all going to BlizzCon. We're all going, like, you know, basically through the, the, the work of the community, I want to be able to say that, hey, the, the, the mod team that makes this Twitch possible, you guys are all coming with me, and we're all going to get dinner, and we're all going to do stuff. Like, I want to be able to do that. And I can't do that without you guys, the community, the viewers, all of you fans. I can't do it without you guys. Um, essentially, you know, creating the content you love seeing every day is a goal that I strive to improve daily. I try to learn something new, even if it's not shown on stream or the stream isn't improved by it or the YouTube isn't improved by it. I try to learn something about streaming or YouTube, or creating content daily. I try. I thank you for your time to read and support us here on the channel, here in Patreon, here on YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, uh, Facebook, wherever you guys find me. Thank you for taking the time to chill with us and hang out with us. Essentially, here's how it works on Patreon. Uh, sign up to contribute today. You'll have access to all of our activity feed and all posted rewards at your tier right away. So, you know, whether you put in a dollar, five, ten, twenty-five, thirty, or, or not twenty-five, fifty, hundred, whatever. Uh, if you have any, you know, you'll have the rewards that come in with that. Um, if you have any questions, post them to the activity feed in Patreon. If you have any questions about Patreon, post them in the Patreon, okay? Um, that's what it's for. I'll be actually looking at it every day, and I'll answer those questions as fast as I can. But by the latest, I'll probably start in AMA uh, Fridays because we're going to implement a question uh, system into our Twitch feed. It's going to be, uh, you know, exclamation anonymous. That's what I'm going to make it. Uh, essentially, I'll have it as a timed message, and I'll have it as a command, so you can bring it up and use it. Um, basically, if you have a question about the stream, or a question uh, on how to stream, questions on what I do, what I like, any 
any random questions whatsoever that I have not answered during the stream just by my own omission, uh, we'll essentially be having like a huge AMA, ask me anything type of deal on Fridays. This Friday coming up, though, is essentially like our first and biggest one. So I'm excited. I'm, I'm super excited. Um, as you see here, the different tiers, you have uh, $1, 5 10 I thank you guys for the support. At $25, you get named in any games where we can name NPCs or any characters for that matter. All names are in order of Patreon signups. All orders are in the name of Patreon signups. So they'll be at random as they come through. And then you, uh, you, again, continue to pledge support and stuff. We are uh, essentially coming up uh, with the rewards. We also have a goal uh, right here, these milestones. If we can produce these milestones, like uh, here, for $1,000 each month of making the goal, we'll make a video based around streaming and anything you find folks have questions about pertaining to streaming. You want to know how to start up a stream, you want to know how to get viewers, you want to know how to grow a community, you want to know how to get certain games to work, or you have technical issues, or hell, you might be like Spiritual Jedi, the guy with low-end equipment, and you want to know how to make that equipment work. Well, guess what? We'll make a YouTube video just for you guys, and that will go up into our YouTube. You know, that'll be uh, in our... Uh, technical question, technical difficulties, questions, you know, stuff like that, or streaming questions. Playlist. We'll actually make a playlist completely centered around streaming questions. Um, you know, this investing, it, it you know, making two thousand is completely a full time goal. Two thousand uh, dollars is essentially where I can sit down and say. Okay, we. I don't have to worry about my bills. I don't have to worry about electricity, gas. I don't have to worry about food or clothes for my kids. I don't have to worry about my family. This is essentially that full-time goal at two thousand um, dollars. You know, investing. It's time. You know, invest to impress. It's time to kick things up a notch, guys. Essentially, I'll even be able to buy the streaming equipment, have a studio, and do everything we have always been looking forward to. On top of that, at $2,500 a month, guys, it's literally, I have giveaway content, I have merchandise, I will have all sorts of stuff. Not to mention, we'll be opening up a store at that kind of uh, money a month. At $2,500 a month, we'll have an entire clothing line, an entire stream store for you guys. So it's all about that support. We're still attempting to get our first shirt uh, underway because I've, I've been looking into like Teespring and uh, like f there's like four or five other shirt companies out there but I want to get a shirt ready so that way when you guys are able to you know get a shirt we have it within reason it's not like 35 or 40 dollars to purchase that shirt you know it can be uh, you know maybe 25 or hell as low as 20 based on all the stipulations on even putting our shirt up there through Teespring and stuff like that. Because I want to be able to get a shirt where we can actually uh, use the revenue from that to continue to create more. I want to be able to start, you know, cups, mugs, you know, our ridiculous mug here. You guys want to be able to purchase this just like I got mine. You know, you don't have to go to some carnival. You can have this big ass mug available for you guys. Ice Cube, I was a little parched, guys. And essentially, you know, you'll be able to, to, to click and see what our most popular video is on Patreon as well. What our most popular video on YouTube is at the time. I will be adjusting this accordingly. This is uh, one of our arc streams. Essentially, it's just yeah, like this. The hosted ones. I actually had to fix OBS and everything yeah, it's like a on the fly. Kind of, like 30. It was really cool to do this, show you guys, get into playing the game. And then I was like, hey, whatever, and we, we just went with it. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun playing um, ARC when I had the time to do it. And, like, 
you'll see here's what my old desktop looked like back in June. And I just bought it earlier. And That's I our friend Doja, if you guys don't know who he is. We'll skip through it. It's like, ah, character creation. Do I really want to do anything? This game will be fun. Probably and not. I, I just wanted to get in and play it. Where you start at. Not to mention come January, if if uh, the timing is right, we'll start having our own servers to play on, guys. We'll start having our own servers to play on for, for games like Ark. For Hurt World, for you know, all this kind of stuff, and I can't wait to start playing with you guys when we do it. So, this is what Patreon is like, and again, contributing today, even if it's one dollar, that just that starts off our Patreon. So, I wanted to show you guys and show you that the Patreon link in our Twitch channel it does work down below by clicking it. It takes you to this amazing place, and I'll be posting every day all sorts of cool stuff about our YouTube, about our Twitch, about our everything. And remember to come back this Friday, guys. This Friday is our one-year Twitch anniversary. It's definitely going to be a fun place to go to. Now let's get our Albion stream on. Alright, Blood Crow. Um, I know... I got in here and I made adjustments already to my Destiny board. Could you tell us uh, what has recently happened with the new update today? Stuff changed. Well, we know a lot of stuff changed, Blood Crow. <laughs> um, to be honest with you, uh, they've kind of reverted back to the old system where fame was just set to a certain amount. And I gotta fucking run. Hold on a second. I'm in an area of farming, and seven hostiles just came in here, and I have no fucking idea where they're at. They just appeared out of nowhere. <laughs> I have the best title ever. Searching for a chair replacement. Alright, hold on. Let me get to, to these guards or something real quick, dude, and I'll, I'll, I'll go over what they've changed. At least the main ones, the important stuff. Pretty cool, but okay, I'll go ahead and start doing it now because I'm close enough to the thing. I'm good. Hold on a second. Okay. Not to mention, guys, we are... Still harvesting materials and always willing to run dungeons. I still don't understand why they didn't change the uh, mechanic in green zones for, for the fiber farms to be cotton balls and, instead of pine because it is extremely misleading. All right, so pretty much what they've done is they've went to the old style for uh, the fame uh, to where you kill a mob, you don't have to wait for it to go. The longer it's alive, the more fame you get. It's set to a certain amount of fame, so you can literally just go around killing the same thing repeatedly. Um, silver is still the exact same. Silver is still, the, more, the longer they're alive, the more you get. Um... Uh, let me see. They also changed, the biggest one was they changed the Destiny board. So they removed, since they had to remove the scaling fame with the length of life of mobs, they also had to go and revert back to the original style, which, you know, made it to where, 
pretty much if you'd been farming already pretty a pretty good amount you're going to actually end up getting like a lot of your abilities learned either automatically or up high enough where you should be able to learn with learning points like i pretty much was able to learn like all of my tier six stuff and leather and a lot of it in cloth and a lot of uh, t4.3 items and a couple of 5.2 items so a lot of people got a power boost out of that um, but since they lowered the fame that you gain they had to lower the overall fame that was required which was pretty cool so wow they Those made it really good. so it's like it's tough but it's not tough yeah so if you've been playing for a while like i have whoa this is pretty this is pretty much how it was before ouch i guess no, it's actually good. It's more familiar, it's easier, all that kind of good stuff. I don't know about you, but I like seeing like ridiculous numbers when I was getting <laughs> materials and getting high. Oh yeah. It made me feel like I was actually moving up because of it being scaled. And it seemed like it would be a lot easier to get. And now I'm not so sure. Let's try and go kill some of these guys. Yeah, not exactly the greatest amount of fame. Bye, mate and TV. See you in a minute. <laughs> the monsters are all. <laughs> Alright, Travertine used to give me like 300. And it's giving me like 200. Uh... I think I found your new chair. Uh-oh, let's see what Walmart has to say. What up, Fud Cannon? House Tricks? What you talking about, House Tricks? What do you mean? I don't know. I'm Like, it's weird. I'd love to get a DX Racer, but it's like that's out of my price range for like a good six months next year. I'd have to save a hundred dollars a month. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm doing really good, Fud Cannon. Fud Cannon, I wanted to thank you, my friend. That twenty dollar donation was extremely appreciated. Very much, man. Thank you so much. Because I'm gonna use that towards getting a new chair. We found the phone though, guys. We found the phone. Even though we flipped the house upside down last night. I went to bed, pissed off. Woke up today. Wife was all excited. Uh, when she'd gotten the kids up, she had checked our son's room again. And essentially went through all his toys again. Lifted up cushions, moved some other toys out of the way, and found her phone buried. Her iPhone. Yeah, yeah. She she found the phone. It. That's, that's like, iPhones are not cheap. iPhones are not cheap. So this video is essentially going to be an update going up to YouTube tonight. Uh, I'm going to have to work on it. Chairs are expensive. Hell, I might have to buy one of those plastic fucking lawn chairs just to, you know, sit here and stream with you guys. I just won't be able to be all wild and crazy. You know what I mean? As long as... A this kid in school is having the same problem. Like, oh my goodness. Yes, so chair searching and big Albion updates. Like, uh, where was it? Like, here's the chair. You know, if you guys are seeing it, here's the chair that Mate and TV found. It looks nice, but, it, I mean, it's 50 fucking dollars. 
if I was to get something like this, I you know, I'd rather have like a full on like comfortable chair, but I I don't do leather very well. So I mean, hence why I'm like really I'm like DX racer or or not. <laughs> I'd rather just have like a cheapy chair at this moment. Mate and TV, we have no service, so we can't use Find My Phone. We don't, we don't have service to her iPhone, so the Find My Phone app is worthless if you do not have service. You know, we're using the Wi-Fi from our, our home, but the phone's not connected to Wi-Fi all the time, so that's the problem. Then how does she call on her phone? We use the Wi-Fi. She uses a Wi-Fi app. Ah, oh, slowed me down. Why is Hammer and Sickle all the way down here? That's got to be like a farm account right there. Got to be a farm character. What up, A-Rod? How you doing, man? Oh my god! What? Are you serious? Are you kidding me right now? A $200 donation from Anonymous! What? No fucking way! Oh my god, are you kidding me? Babe! I got two hundred dollars from somebody. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> Thank you. Oh my goodness, we're we're getting a chair. We are getting a chair. That's oh my goodness. Uh, let me pull up Twitch alerts so I can actually read that whole message. I mean, I try and read all these messages. Holy crap! Oh my god. Um, alright, we're making sure the alert system is up. Oh my goodness. It's, it's sitting there. I hope this will help out. Take care. Well, whoever donated, Anonymous, whoever you are here in the Twitch, thank you. Oh my goodness. That is, uh, our biggest donation that we've ever received here in the channel. To the channel, like, <laughs> oh my goodness, wow. Yeah, they they weren't named. It's just anonymous. I don't know. Oh my goodness, thank you so much, guys. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. Um. <laughs> wow. Uh, wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. That's. Uh, that is insane. That is crazy. Whoever that was, thank you. Thank you so much. Um. Uh, not $200. It is $200. It's two hundred dollars. Like, let me show you guys. I'm looking at my Twitch alerts. There's the twenty from Fud Cannon, and there's two hundred from Anonymous. Yeah, that like that's insane. That is insane, guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um. Uh, <sighs> Hell yeah, it calls for a giveaway. I'll do a giveaway right now. Let me pull up Humble Bundle. I know we've got some cool games up in there. Actually, uh, yeah, Humble Bundle. 
Let's hope we don't die. Oh my goodness. From an unfamiliar browser? Are you kidding me? Okay. Wow. I just looked at Humble Bundle yesterday. There. Are you going to be able to order one now? I'm um, checking. I have to get this giveaway set up. Thank you to whoever that was. Let's look. Um, there's a lot of these. Yeah, we're going to put this in alphabet. Wait, where's the... Keys, here we go. Hide, redeemed. Let's go alphabetical. All right. This is going to be a giveaway. For Company of Heroes. Put this in for five minutes. This is Company of Heroes, my friends. This will be this will be a Steam key because I have the little like gift thing. Oh my god! What? Oh, they changed the thing back. Definitely changed it back like it used to be. This is awesome. Wait, how bad is my? Oh, they did. I was seeing right, like the so, higher tiered stuff, like the stuff I was able to get, like Pine and Travertine, is only giving like 200. Dude, no, no, no. You don't need to be worrying about that. You need to be worrying like the 4.2, 4.3 stuff, like, like you know, whatever, you know, you, you're farming. Like just now, like 4.2. 4. 4. Let's listen, 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 listen. The 4.0 hides, like off a of boar, right? Like level 4, plain 4, level 4 hide, right? T4 hides. Okay. Out, out, of a, out of a stack of three, I just got like maybe 200, you know, total. But there was a there was a boar. He was, you know, he was a 4.3 boar. I went ahead, skinned him, like whatever, you know, it's a little bit of fame, right? Another 200 fame. Nope, they've changed it back like it used to be. I got like 2,000 fame off three hides just now. What? So it's higher? Yeah, the essentially, higher the, tier, the higher the tier, the mob that you're farming or wood or whatever, the better that you're going to get. So, yes. So, this is good because we have lower, but it's going to be, it's going to scale higher in the end. Right. So, the, the better the boar or, or wood or stone that you get... The, the more fame you're going to get from it. So that they went directly back to how it used to be. Because that, that's how it used to be. You know, the, now the only thing they, they didn't do was make it to where um, the, like, like if you went to like farm, like a, say a 4.3 log, right? A 4.3 okay. log. I, I, I forgot what it would be called, but 4.3 log. Um, Get those tickets in, guys. Take, it would used to eat the durability up on your weapon or your axe or whatever. 
Like it would use up a lot of durability. I'm not talking about a little bit, I'm talking about a lot of durability. Like it'd usually eat up like 20% of your freaking durability in one go. Um, but wow. it looks like it don't do that no more. You get the fame like you should, but you don't have to do that. So yeah, hunting uncommon and rare boars and for me is going to be great. So yeah. Yes, it's Company of Heroes, Mate and TV, Company of Heroes, my friend. And by the way, Anthony, you need to be looking for relic lockers around your zones. Those are always lockers. in yellow. Yeah, but guess what? Guess what? You do realize they've got like 40, 50, 60, up to a couple hundred thousand silver potentially in them, right? When you when you do it. I'm never close to one, and if I get to it, it's always empty. Yeah, but these are about to pop here in like 10 minutes, 8 to 10 minutes. So I'm actually like scouring around random areas. Trying to see if I can find one that's not being watched by like no shit. There's a bazooka. Yeah, like there's there was hammer and sickle camped. players doing stuff. Ooh, here's some pine. Let's see what this gives me. If it doesn't have whoa, six hundred. Are you serious? Jeez. Did it have a little ring around it? Yeah, it was a green. Wow. Yeah. See how wow. much more pine you get. Hell yeah, I see how much more fame I get. Wait till that you get the blue, awesome. one. the blue one. Wait till you get a blue one. The blue one is the uncommon. That's the one above it, dude. That would be Is it more than 1100 now? Or no, that went it? to 17. That's right. It went to 1700. And this does count toward your fame too. So think about this. This actually for when you get up to tier 4 and higher, actually being able to farm the rare materials like this, whether it be ore or whatever, think about it, dude. You're going to end up getting freaking massive, massive fame now. I just want to get out of here alive right now. I'm kind of stuck. All right, that ticket raffle is over. Let me finish this battle and draw the winner. So bear with me here. Oh, my goodness. It, this is a Steam Key giveaway, so definitely be watching, my friends. If you've entered, definitely watch to see that your name is picked. The winner is... Fun Cannon! Say something in chat. You have two minutes, my friend. Say something in chat to claim. Again, all raffles, you must be a follower to claim your raffle winnings. You must be a follower to claim all of your raffle winnings. Alright, I'm going to a known iron spot. Because it's, it's on the map. There's a relic locker as well, but I, I'm pretty sure if I go to it, it's already gone. Oh, here, hold on, hold on. Anything. I'm getting five 4.3 hides. Let's see what I get. For fame. Hold on. 2,000 regular and an extra 1,000 fame on top of that. I got 3,000 fame from five hides. So is that a boar? A boar. That's a 4.3 boar, dude. 5,000 fame right there. Or No, 3,000 fame. Sorry. Wow. Oh, here's some four point here's four point two three. Nice FUD Cannon has claimed. I'm gonna throw this in a whisper, my friend. I'm gonna throw the key out there in a whisper for to you. <laughs> Mate and TV, you can't just like keep asking for giveaways because you didn't win this one. Like, you know, I, I was, you know, either I was going to do one, which I did a giveaway right away for the $200 donation, but you can't just jump in and ask just because 
Like it, it, yeah, but it, I'm just gonna it defeats you know, the purpose. You know what I mean? To. Most of them are popping in you five know. minutes. Um, probably worth at least trying. Like, get a crappy horse, go naked, whatever you got to do. All you got to do, it's, a, it's like a 30 second channel. After 30 seconds, if no one's flagged up, because it takes longer than 30 seconds to flag up, um, you could probably get it. If you're naked, you can just suicide and bam, dude, you're lots, lots of silver, dude. It's it's more than what you can get probably dungeon running unless you're in a high dungeon group. Yeah, so. Oh my god, dude, this has got me excited again now for farming these higher tier materials. Because see, before, you pretty much already got thousands of fame just because, like, how they had the scaling. Oh, this is so much better now, dude. Imagine getting a 5.2 log or a 5.5 log. Or something like that. You know how much fame you're going to get? Ridiculous. Yeah, I mean, I'm already getting this. Is, this is awesome. I'm hanging around this one relic waiting for it to pop. And then as soon as this one pops, I'm going to get it and try to go north and get another one in another zone. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to start streaming again, Anthony, I think, on weekends. Yeah? So I don't have to worry about... Yeah, I think I'm going to... Um, starting next week, I'm actually going to literally start, honestly, doing my damn um, uh, YouTube videos. I'm going to start with some Albion Online updates and shit, because uh, mine are outdated right now, and that's one of the main games I play. Yeah. Oh, you seen Cameron's excited about the game, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, he hit me up on Facebook. He was like, is this free to play yet? I was like, not yet. It's, you know, supposed to come out in January and whatnot. This is going to be awesome. Yeah. He was talking to me like, dude, should I get it? And I was like, yeah, you can use my referral. I was like, wait, better yet use Anthony because he don't have any. <laughs> He's like, okay. That is awesome. I'm actually glad he's getting online with us. This is a game he could play that is not stressful on his computer. Yeah. But yeah, guys, this is such an amazing day. This is insane. Big Gorilla Mike, my friend, thank you for the follow and the support. It is greatly appreciated. Welcome to the arcade, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All of you new folks, all of you regulars, all of you, you know, old timers. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, if you guys know Dumb and Dumber, hey, Fud Cannon, you want it fair and square, my friend. You want it fair and square. Uh, exclamation Discord app. Uh, your mom says hi. Exclamation Discord app. We have a Discord set up for all of you folks here in Twitch. All of you folks in the arcade. We have it designed just for you guys. Oh, I see you followed me on, uh, uh, you know, Twitter. That thing, yes. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Seems you found my bearded twin. Really? Do you stream as well, uh, Big Gorilla Mike? Oh, it's all one word. What? Is Nightbot not wanting to work? No, Nightbot left. What the hell? Nightbot, what the hell are you doing, Dude, he's man? He's got 50,000 silver from it. What, from the uh, locker? Yes. Was it over there in, um, um, Not same where. Weed River? Because I saw Damn the one man. on the map there. Dude, that is, that was great, man. That is, that was, that was awesome. That may be how some of these people have been getting rich and people that I know. I think that's what they've been doing is that like early in the mornings, like, you know, one, two, three o'clock in the mornings, that's when it starts dying down because oh, most Americans like are in, 
yeah, you gotta think, man, most Americans are in bed and most Europeans are at work. You know, you still got the people that are on because they're either off vacation, unemployed, whatever, too young to get a job. Um, so they just like hit up all these damn chests when they pop and, and uh, dude, that's that's awesome. That so, is yeah, that, ridiculous. That and just think about it, if you can get into like one of these high, like red zone areas ones, Dude, those give you more. Those get like there's some chests that go up to a couple hundred thousand silver. Just yeah, and that you don't have to be contested for that. Oh, that'd be ridiculous, man. I'm seriously trying to get over there to that ore, but I don't want to run all the way around the map just to get to it. Damn it! There we go. There we go. Good thing I got like 2,000 health. Fortunately, I'm going to be followed by like two people, all, you know, five right now, but two to four people the whole way in there. That's that. Oh, okay. I see why I'm being followed. Are you on your ox? That's a dead giveaway. No, I I went to the. Damn it! I went one way over. I'm in green, so it's no big deal. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Let me just run all the way back over here. Run back into the town. I actually have to go back a map and go southwest. That sucks. Dude, that chest is awesome. You could literally just get rich, just like farm all the time and get those occasionally. That's all you'd have to do. Oh, jeez. What up, Buddha? Hey. Buddha, 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 Buddha everywhere. Hey, Dr. Yeah, Marshy, what happened, bro? What's up? I wanted, um, who's the ARC server, like, account on? Who's... Oh, it's under mine, I think. Yeah, it's under mine. So if I throw you the money to keep it up, like how much more months does it have on it? It's, I'm not even it's sure. It's actually got a few months. It's been scaled down to, I think, 30 players. And we have like uh, like 95. You can actually click the ARC server link. Um, we have exclamation ARC server on my channel as well, Buddha, to, yeah. to click the link for that. Yeah, I'm, I've been playing on it. And it's uh, got like uh, it's got like $90 yeah. in it. Uh, yeah, uh, if you want to throw some money to it, dude, that's fine. And you know, uh, I've known you long enough; I can give you the login. Because I don't know who all's been. I don't even. Um, I don't even know Scott who's been Plants, keeping up to date. Scott with it. Plants has been keeping it up to date. Oh, um, he has. There's a okay. bunch of randoms that still come to the server. Um, there's a lot of people from the Teamspeak community here that also play as well. But Borderlands community pretty much left. I think there's like maybe onesies and twosies that come in from time to time, but hardly anyone. Mm -hmm. Same with your community, Blood Crow, and the community here. It's it's essentially just all from uh, the Wikipedia uh, arc stuff. So, which yeah, that was that was awesome. Yeah. That was awesome to see our stuff on Wikipedia. Yeah. So half the island, like the whole right side, I haven't seen anyone on it at all. Um, I mean, like from the top to the bottom. If you remember Hidden Cove, 
uh, yeah. you know, Hidden Cove Lake. Uh, Scott Plants yeah. has his base completely set up there, and he literally runs around Ark just doing stuff, or he'll, like, go and raid a random group that's somewhere. Like, he'll go raid a base, or he'll go, like, help out and do, like, a humanitarian effort. It's it's kind of funny uh, hearing his uh, uh, adventures in Ark right now. Like, he just... Me and Swoozy are on it. Oh, nice. Nice. I gotta say, it's it's definitely uh, a lot of fun. So if you guys are interested in the ARC server, exclamation ARC server to bring up that info. Pull up the, the community name, or the server, you know, the name for the server, and not to mention where to donate. It is highly appreciated because it is all based in a community effort. We have a few regulars that are still playing it every, you know, every week who maintain the updates in order to keep the server active, live, with all the new content. So, definitely join in, guys. It's, it's a lot of fun. I'm waiting for the streamer optimization to set in before I actually get back into ARC, because there, it's... It runs so intensively on my CPU that it, even with a liquid cooling system on it, my CPU still hey, game hits key. 70 Celsius. Game key. Um, I was having CPU problems with it, and then I did a, a, a reset, and everything went away. Like, I haven't had a problem, and I've been playing on Epic. A reset? What do you mean? Like, I, I did, like, a backup for my PC. Like, I reinstalled everything. Like, it said... Um, I I, can't, I started getting this um thing whenever I played it, something about a overclock or some shit. And then I restarted my whole pe like I just did a reset, and, like kept my files, but like, got rid of all the programs. And then, okay. Like, and then um I started playing, and so far there hasn't been any errors, and I've been playing on like max. Like I even did. Like, I tried everything to make it crash. The hunting crash. Yeah, that, and I'm sure they've been working their ass off on optimizing, so I think it's a mixture. Maybe you have to reinstall again. Okay, yeah. I'll have to uninstall it and reinstall it again then. Like, right now, I have it installed, and that's, that's I mean, I'm still seeing, like, 400 megabyte updates and th stuff. Uh, a list of Nightbot commands? Um... Essentially, it's all the same commands that are in here um, on uh, our Nostalgia Arcade bot. Um, the only difference is, like, we have exclamation uh, time up, X, uh, which works through Nightbot. We have uh, our exclamation follow command when you for, for the hosts that come in. We have, uh, like, you can check the command list. Um, yeah, I have to start doing all those commands and everything for Deepbot again. Deepbot hasn't made me pay for Deepbot in the past, like, month. Like, two months or three months. I haven't paid. And it still works. Well, deep yeah, battle works. You only get yeah. certain features. Yeah, it still works, but there's a certain features you don't get access to no more. Um, like there's a follower donation. Uh, there's certain like at commands, like the you know how you can at target at and stuff like that. Oh, like some of those, those, some of those. Yeah, not all of them work though. Oh, yeah, there's a, there's a list of them though. Yeah, Deepbot still has the basic functionality of it, and some of the other like, yeah, but it's not it's not gonna be everything. Um, it should be exclamation commands. There we go. That should show everything, but we aren't, uh, we aren't using a uh, song request or any of that here. Because he's a stickler. No, we've just we've had issues with it in the past. It's been a severe troll thing. And the moment oh, yeah. the one time the one time I was like, Alright, fine, we'll do song request and have people that's all it took. That one person ruined song request for everyone. 
I know what you're talking about. <laughs> Weren't you here for that, Buddha? No, but like there's always that douchebag who plays like like that. You know those songs. It'll be like a regular Every song, time. and like a minute in, it was nothing but screaming and and yelling and like and sex. Yeah. Yeah, I was <laughs> like, really? And it, this was like a YouTube yeah. video, apparently. So yeah, yeah, there's a bunch of those songs. Like the people who actually have like famous YouTube channels because of that. Yeah, like you know a famous YouTube channel. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. You know, you see me screaming my own channel. Is that copyrighted on somebody else's? Fuck no. I'd be pissed if me hollering and yelling was copyrighted on somebody else's channel. I would be very angry as a as a streamer, as a content creator of my own stuff. Like if I was if me personally was copyrighted onto another YouTube channel, oh my god, that would be detrimental to, to Twitch actually. Because then that would essentially be saying that me, the content creator, is copyrighted by somebody else, which would make no sense. Yeah, and I'd be suing them too. Huh? I'd be suing them too. Be like, uh, you can't copyright myself. We are not legally bound to each other. Yeah, you know. There's no contract involved. You know, you're going to be removing it or paying a penalty. Oh, man, that hemp. That hemp is nice. Nice to see you're back, uh, Mating TV. Yep, people are killing foxes. Foxes are important to do the hide crafting. So you're just gonna kill that fox, that poor little fox. What did he ever do to you, you dumb witch? You know what? Bing, ding, 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 ding. Oh, what did the fox say? Yep. What did the fox say? That one part was so crazy, dude. Yep, 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 yep. That little grandpa all sitting there reading. It's like, what the fuck? Yo, I'm hooked on Hearthstone. It's actually pretty fun. I don't know why. Oh my goodness. Dude, I don't know why it never popped up, but Thorlar, thank you for the host, my friend. Let's throw him. Let's throw up a follow command for Thorlar. Uh, I don't even know if you were hosting me before, beforehand. That's cool, Thorlar. You and your host, man. It really is. Does anyone else here play Hearthstone? I play it with my balls. Uh, thank like, you, it's, it's, Thorlar. Yeah. I didn't even know you were in here, man. Oh my goodness. Thank you for the support. It is appreciated. Holy cow. I'm he will be at your house later tonight I'm... with some lotion. <laughs> 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 oh my god. Oh man. Don't worry, that lotion's gluten free. <laughs> I don't know why you're eating it, but that's just okay. <laughs> oh, some boar hide. Whoa. So, yeah, Thorlar, man. Is, is if Thorlar you're in here, in Thorlar's community, if you guys are here, Welcome to the arcade. Oh, what the hell was that? Wait, are dire wolves here now? There's a pentagram on the ground. What? What, what game are you playing now? Well, I'm playing Albion, but I don't want to go. There should be like iron, like iron here, not that thing. Go, go pet it. Go pet it. Hell no, I don't want to touch it. Touch it. Dude, go take a poop on it. I bet Aww, it Aw, Mate and TV, you need to tell her you like her, man. <laughs> don't. Don't be bitch. Tell her you love her. Well, he's in, you know, he's in uh, middle school. He's uh, trying mm. to tell the girl he likes that uh, he likes her. And, and maybe, maybe they're going to go out. Hopefully. That'd be really cool. I know you've been meaning to, man. You've been letting us know, and you know I, I hope it works out soon, because you've been trying and 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 not being successful. 
crap. All of this iron is gone. Damn it. Yes, we've got iron. Oh, shit. Iron is heavy. Iron is really heavy now. Wow. Well, if you're like me and you got a, you know, awesome backpack, Legendary T5, you're not heavy. All right, so they must have come up here and taken away a lot of stuff. Yeah, give me that special iron. Give me the 600 fame. I'll worry about the other iron in a minute. Nope. Wow. 1800? Are you kidding me? Wow, I picked up 3600 just in two things of iron. Holy Don't you. crap. Say so Anthony, the new way to farm is you need to wait for something to turn like uncommon, the blue. That's where you get your fame now. Well, yeah, that's where I'm sitting right now. I'm in a uh, iron deposit. I'm in a okay, uh, boar cave. Nothing but boars in it. Mostly rare and uncommon. Yeah. Wow, this is nuts. I really don't need this crap, but I know it's used in a lot of uh, other gear, so at least I can sell it probably. Oh, yeah, you'll be able to sell easy. Anything? And me and her might walk to my place because I walk home every day and it would work out good. Nice! That'd be cool. Damn it! Yeah, I'm going back to the other side. Holy cow, guys. This is ridiculous. This fame is... The the, the old system is amazing. No. I ain't like scroll now. Buddha, you and your family need to come over to my place and roast a pig, dude. <laughs> I'm down. Dude, like, just hearing about your party was awesome. Like, that, that pig had to have been real good. Pretty big. <laughs> That's what she said. Well, they fucking smoked a pig at his graduation party, and like that's like an all-day kind of thing. So, you know, buying a pig is expensive. Having the equipment to smoke the pig can get expensive. But yeah, and then having someone there who knows what they're doing. Thank you, mods. I did read your message, mate and TV. You guys are going to try and walk home together. That would be kind of cool. Alright, so I'm at <laughs> double my ore mining experience. Holy cow. Dude, I've already gotten like 40,000 fame for my uh, dagging. Er, God damn. Yeah, I. This is yeah. insane. And animal skinning, everything is at 105,000. That ain't nothing compared to having to grind out for 380,000 uh, fame. Like, 100 is nothing. I promise you guys, nothing. Hard part is keeping it lit. What? I'm so lost. Like, what? I, this has got to be something else in chat. <laughs> That's what she said. Don't be surprised to have to walk a mile to my place. Oh my goodness. 
I know, you're gonna ask her to walk home with you, and it's like a mile away. Quirk, dude! I hope I can craft the map. I need to look at the destiny board again. Here we go. 202,000? Well, I'm almost there anyway, so... What is it? Requirements, titanium steel bars, uncommon steel, and steel bars. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We can do that. Uncommon steel. Doable. Yeah, the one good thing though, Anthony, about this whole little patch they did, yeah, is I skipped I skipped an entire session. Like I was on two of six, right? Like where I get like the extra yield, gathering yield, and uh, I completely skipped by that and instantly jumped up like pretty damn high on the uh, tier five skinning tool. So if I can just find a Dina or something that's got like just oh, here's another Dina right here. I just need a bunch of a bunch of damn. T4.3 spores. Dude, if I could find a full one, dude, it'd be crazy. Yeah, like a full bore? Oh my god. Yeah, that thing would probably give me like 15,000 or something. 15 hides on it? That would be nuts. Yes! They're coming back right now. Yes! Again, welcome folks to the arcade. I can't say it enough. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Have fun. We've been doing this for almost a full year now. Come Friday will be the party. This will be the place to be, my friends. We're playing anything and everything under the sun, but with two to three hours in between games so you know if you guys are avid CSGO players come join me if you guys are avid Rainbow Six Siege I'm players come join me in Terrorist Hunt if you guys play Albion Look Online cool. come come join me if so, you guys play you uh you know good bro force or any other games that you've seen me uh, play I will gladly sit down and play account? games with you folks what account on your blood crow account what do you mean? Like, you be specific. What game are you talking about? I'm waiting because I'm, I'm pretty sure there's one, someone on the team who has a son that plays on their account. Oh, that's my kid. Yeah. Oh, I was just wondering. Yeah, he gets on Steam, and plays a lot of games and crap, and yeah. Yes, we do. Don't bother me. He knows not to touch this game though, Albion. He knows I'll beat his butt. I whoop that ass. What's worse is when you got home, you're like, wait, did he exit me out of the clan? No, he didn't. I found out. So what they uh, what what did they, they kick every, anybody that was in an Auss Aussie guild or related to an Australian guild? They kicked out. So apparently, you were related to an Australian guild. Yeah. What guild? <sighs> Cloak and dagger. Oh, like your your friends of theirs? Yeah. Uh, so they don't like Australians? No, just most of them wouldn't do anything. Like they wouldn't log it in no more after the first or second week. Dude, the famous one Dan I found is awesome. For boars. Well, Dexy himself here has uh, switched over and started using Hitbox. He wants to make it on Hitbox. Well, honestly, dude, to be honest with you, hey, hey, Buddha, if you can, thanks, if you can get some viewers over there, it's awesome. You never know, Hitbox may take off more than Twitch once people figure it out. 
I mean, Twitch is going to be hard to overcome because it's kind of like the the stature, you know, it's like where you need to be at, but you know what I'm saying, right? A lot of people, um, actually, um, a lot of people used to stream on Hitbox for CSGO, switched back to, uh, oh, uh, to Twitch because they were just not getting any viewers on there. Like, they were, like, they were getting them all the viewers for Counter-Strike, not getting anything, like, they were, when they went back, they got a double or triple them viewers, you know what I'm saying? Oh, here on, uh, Twitch? Yeah. Yeah, and, uh, what's crazy is games are being made around Twitch now. So I feel like Twitch is the place to be because games are coming out to utilize Twitch chat. Not Hitbox chat, not Beam.pro chat, not Restream chat. No, it's Twitch chat. Games are coming out. I mean, hell, folks, for Quiplash and Choice Chamber, you guys can actually... You know, and party hard. You guys can interact with the game just from Twitch chat. That's kind of a big, big deal. So, I mean, and then they had Tomb Raider. But you had to stream Tomb Raider from the Xbox One using the Twitch application on the console, not the PC. So they've kind of, like, ruined Tomb Raider on that aspect for Twitch streamers. Because a lot of folks got it for the PC. And then it was like, oh, well, we only got that feature if it was on an Xbox One. Ah, well, so what? Now, uh, they might be changing things up when the game comes out for PC. It's it's not, the new Tomb Raider hasn't released just yet for the PC yeah. users. That's going to be exciting to see this next year. I kind of like it, but I know, like, sometimes games come out late for us, but, like, I like the fact that they take their time for it. Oh, for the PC players? Yes. I like the fact that games don't always get put at that 30 frames uh, per second lock. So, when it comes out to PC, everything looks a lot more crisp. It looks smooth. Um, there might be new features for the PC that were never available for the console. That's what I like. And essentially, uh, if the game came out on the console and had all this DLC, well, when you get it on Steam, all that DLC usually is, comes with it. Like the Final Fantasy 13, 13, 2, and 13, 3. By buying the game on Steam, you get all the DLC. I found that out. So, if you guys want the full game and DLC, get it on the PC. It's so worth it. Plus, there's blur, mo uh, blur motion or motion blur functions and stuff for a lot of games now that are coming out. That's pretty cool, in my opinion. Motion blur. Yeah, like having yes. like Mr. actual Pyramid blur left the server. for oh, for yes. things. Oh has that, in you, but you can move it also. You know, Counter Strike it has that, but you can move it. Yeah, but no if like if it. if you play if you get on Counter Strike Go and you put everything on minimalist settings, then yeah, you're gonna play the game the best possible for yourself. Hey, but it's not a certain, um, you kind of want like a, it's like a happy medium, you know what I'm saying? I know, and I figured if a game has all those features, why not use all of them on the like on the PC especially? Just because I mean. Oh, your, your KD ratio is going to suffer now? Why not play the game the way it was intended? Yeah, that's yeah, that's yeah. the way that's the way I look at it. I mean, you don't you don't play uh, you know, you're not playing Albion online to just see uh, blocks on the screen. Hey, we're harvesting uh, this is supposed to be iron, right? Yeah. You know, and you're not getting the effects of like actual iron. Uh -huh. Or like, hey, we got a gun and it shoots like blocks, you know, like essentially you're not turning the graphics back to Minecraft and saying, well, we're playing, you know, uh -huh. the new Tomb Raider, but it looks like this on all the low graphics. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Huh? The new one? You're going to play it? The new one when it actually comes out on the PC. <laughs> My wife tried to play the, uh, the first Tomb Raider, and uh, she got stuck. 
I was reminded of the PlayStation version, uh, PlayStation games. It's like I got stuck. I need help. No, I'm not playing anymore. I got mad. <laughs> and then she got mad. <laughs> All right, so we're at thirty-five thousand uh, fame to our one hundred thousand and five fame. That's that's crazy. We're just over here in an iron ore pocket. Now I'm curious, if I go to a farming spot for fiber, what, what will uh, that do for us? You guys know me and fiber are like real good friends. I'm over here just picking that stuff daily. Alright. Just coming around, making my laps. My ping has been reaching some pretty high numbers, though, too, Blood Pro. Have you noticed that? Yeah. You'll reach like the 130s, 140s, and then it'll drop back down to 60, 50, and then it'll shoot real high again. Yo, um, one of the famous um, streamers for Runescape, right? He, um, he kept getting killed on his own of Batman mode, right? Okay. To the point that he's upstreaming for a whole week just to make his player, like, really, like, hard to kill. <laughs> no, he's streaming. He's like, alright, you guys can come and kill me now. Try. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. What? Oh, he made it really tough just to kill him. Yeah, because he knows that everyone, everyone hates him now. It's like, for fun. Yeah. Like, everyone thinks it's hilarious. Except him, obviously. And he's just like, ah, oh, fuck that! Ah. This guy keeps coming out with these beautiful cards that are like perfect. He came out with a card that destroys everything. Huh? Right. Yeah, so I'll be online back to question like this. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. If I was gonna. Alright, what's your favorite part of being online? My favorite part? Yeah. I really, really like the progression system of the destiny board and i really like that like crafting is a big uh, it's it's half the destiny board crafting is yeah. half the game so i i like that aspect because i feel like a lot of players come in and just start going into the pvp aspect without really thinking about the crafting that's involved so they'll just you know buy from the from the marketplace whenever and i think to myself why build or buy from the marketplace if I can craft it all. That's, I mean, and that, and that's the way I've always looked at it. If I can harvest the materials, why buy it? Mr. Pyromich has connected. So it's it's a yeah. lot of fun. Plus, it's an adventure in itself to sometimes get the crafting materials. Like as you guys yeah. saw here in the beginning, I was actually going against somebody to try and gather these these rare and uncommon iron. And I was like, oh shit, it's like kind of like a race, you know? You, if you're both like having to jump onto mounts to move in order to get to that blue that blue iron or that green green iron, uh, you you want to like rush to it because it gives you more fame and. Uh, Sometimes you have to step into a yellow zone or a red zone to get 
the higher end materials, you know, the tier 6, tier 7 materials you need. And, uh, it's essentially like, well, uh, is, it, is it a risk? Yes. Do I take it? If you're solo, maybe. But if you're in a if you're in a group and they know you're a crafter, hell yeah, go for it. You know those folks sometimes will leave you to skin the hides, leave you to gather the resources in the area, and they'll sit there and protect your back. It's it's always an adventure. Yeah. Now now if you get into the armor and weapons aspect, <laughs> I think Blood Crow would be the one best to answer that one. Yep. So, Blood Crow, uh, do you have any answers for that one? What's like? What's your favorite thing about uh, Albion Online? Well, I still like the PVE and all, but yeah, the crafting is really fun. I just tried to give it up for one time, and hell, I'm already getting back into it now because, you know, well, yeah, guild disbanded and. <laughs> Kind of have to think for myself now. Do the leveling? Does the leveling feel fast or not? It does, yeah. Alright. Wow, we're almost halfway there, guys. I know it's just like the kind of boring part, and I wouldn't mind getting with Blood Crow and, and Dr. Marshy and anybody else playing to form a party and go dungeon running. Because usually the better, the more your numbers, the better, usually. And, you know, some people might be underleveled, others might be overleveled. I don't care either way, it's just the fact that we can actually do it is what I'm looking for. So let us know if you guys have Albion online. Definitely party up with us any given time. I'm, I'm all for it. I will gladly go dungeon running. I can always use materials. I can always... Uh, you know, use silver and the fame for my equipment. I'll be more than happy to sit down and dungeon run all day long if, if that's what we're going to do. I'm about to fall asleep. Need to really get my head down. All right, Fud Cannon, you have yourself a good night, my friend. Glad to hear from you. See you. And thanks again for all of your support, my friend. Uh, we wouldn't, right now, we would not be able to get a chair without you guys. That's that's freaking awesome. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, guys. You know, even if it's not the chair that I want, it, I, I can get a decent chair. That's that's what matters. Yeah. That's the biggest thing, is just getting the, the most comfortable chair you can get doing this kind of stuff. Because you're going to be sitting down for a while. You know, at least three or four hours at a time. Yeah, and like when I do my 24-hour events, I really, really want to be comfortable. See you when you play Fallout 4. Uh, all right, I'll probably be doing, I'll probably literally be doing that on like Saturdays now. I'll be setting up like Fallout 4 because it, as it stands now, it, I'm not tired of it by any means, but <laughs> no one wants to see Fallout 4 anymore. So many people have played it. And uh, I'm, I'm a lot of big people play it too. Yeah, and that's that's why I'm taking like a back seat. I'm not even getting. A, it's it's the hardest thing to like play that game and stay interactive when there's no one in chat talking. <laughs> uh, you know, I'd like to sit down for like twelve or, or or you know sixteen hours and smash out on some Fallout Four. I'd love to. I always forget to mute my mic whenever I say something. Has <laughs> so many streamers played it? Definitely, man. Definitely, Flood Cannon. Hey, Strav9, what's up, man? How are you? Yeah, essentially, I'm just playing it for myself. Is what I'm doing, and uh, I'm gonna set up like Saturdays. We're gonna play Fallout 4. We're gonna get done with that, and then I still have Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas to get through. So I would like to set those up to, like, be our Fallout Saturday. You know, Fallout Shelter Saturday or something. So we get through and see how far we've gotten into the Fallout games. And, you know, play around with builds. Um, I think I may want to play Fallout 3 as a melee character, if that's even possible. I think it is. 
and uh, just sit and melee that whole playthrough because that's something that I've not normally done yet. I've always gone guns or power weapons or energy weapons. He's got his pew pew gun. His pew 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 pew. pew, pew, pew. And also, folks, we are going to uh, definitely have a, a bunch of new sounds. So uh, all of our sounds through our donations and alert system and stuff, we're going to add lots of sounds. And tomorrow may be us on uh, creative, literally uh, talking about sounds and adding sounds to our entire system so we can just queue up sounds during our stream for for friday you know what i just thought of the greatest thing ever for a uh you know how like there's creative i got the yeah. one that would be perfect and get like probably tons of viewers instantly. yeah game title porn <laughs> Just call it or porn. Babes. Exclamation babes. All right, I'm at fifty, pretty much fifty-four thousand fame. I know this is this looks super boring. Is I know, I know, it, it's gotta be. But I'm having fun. This fame is ridiculous. I know that, and I'm getting a lot of iron. I'm getting a lot of iron out of here. I don't even know if I can craft uncommon iron yet. Uh, no, we're doing... Actually, we're doing steel. Have you seen the movie Ridiculous 6 yet? Oh, I'll be making steel bars and uncommon steel. Anthony. Huh? Have you seen the uh, that movie yet? Ridiculous 6? Ridiculous 6? No. It's got Adam Sandler and that dude from Twilight, the wolf dude, and uh, it's got that dude like, you can do it, you know, from Waterboy. You can do it! Dude, it's it's such a funny mug. Look, I got three nipples. <laughs> <laughs> Doing good. Exams finally done. Time to grind some Albion. What do you think of new update, dude? I actually like this. Um, for a minute, it like I actually had to sit and talk to Blood Crow before we were streaming. I I saw it and I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. I lost out on all these learning points, and he made a big point that you've saved a lot more on learning points, too. They've kind of, like, queued everything in together, so now you're not, like, uh, you know, going into tiers to try and learn how to craft each individual thing again. You're, like, essentially still tearing up in your Destiny board through, uh, like, 1 through 10, but now, like, in our... In our masteries, it's just one through six for tools. In our uh, refining, uh, you know, you have ten out of ten masteries, but the last one is giving you the ability to craft the highest end item plus five crafting to your, uh, you know, bronze bars. In this case, on the ore. Uh, again, like, look at this one. We can make neat cloth uh, with a plenty tw uh, plus 20 crafting focus, and we have ornate cloth. Tier 5 cloth is now craftable for us, but we're working towards lavish cloth, which is on a, high, a higher end. It's tier 6 material. So you can, you can go farm. When we go farm, we can actually farm tier 5 materials. Let's actually double check that. Yeah, we can grab Skyflower. Yes, we can. Sweet. So, I mean, that that just goes to show our, our cloth refining is going to be huge because I found f three different fiber farms, and that's, that's ridiculous for us. So, I'm excited. 
I checked today. I have so many 4.2s. I have so many 4.2s and one 4.3 that I got for free. It was amazing. Yeah, I know Blood Crow over here went up uh, like a whole tier in all of your stuff. Yep. So you're on what, five? Six. You're on 6.0? Yeah. And 5.2. Oh. oh my goodness. You hear that, guys? Ridiculous levels. <laughs> you said ridic. Ridiculous. All right, let's see. Get over here. Farm some more iron. Yeah, the blue iron. That's what matters. That is what matters. We can make so much of that now, I think. I think if I go back to town and I start crafting, I think I can make a lot of it. So we'll see what happens. Also, does anyone have a good video editing software where I can just literally break apart my videos into hour-long segments easily? Because it would be super appreciated. I'm grabbing so much iron blood pro. Man, nice. look at that GC. Look at that GC. Not to mention, guys, we now have a quote system. If you guys have heard stuff, mods included, viewers and mods, you guys have a whole new system to add quotes. If you guys want to add a quote, something that you've heard here, you can essentially use your GC. And since we get so much of it here, we can now add the quotes. Um into the system whether you want to add a quote or you've heard me say something uh, ridiculously here on stream and you want to capture it forever it now uh, literally uses your GC to do so um, again that system is exclamation add quote space the name of the person who said the quote and then what space whatever the quote is so that way it's saved in the system forever I believe it's 3,000 for viewers, 3,500 for mods, since you guys are at a higher uh, rate, barely. There it is, yeah. 3,000 for viewers, 5,000 for mods. Some of you mods are ridiculous ridiculously high in GC well now we have a use for you for you know the high GC uh, viewers and mods as well but five times the GC that's you know 300 an hour and if we go for you know 10 hour streams that's quite literally that's uh you know that's 3,000 uh, G game cartridges so that's 3,000 we go for 24 hours, that's six, uh, six, 7,200 GC. I lost all mine! Don't! I know, right? Damn it, I got another competitor now. I'm at 63,000 out of the 105 I need for iron. Dang it! Go away, competitor. Go away. Their iron's all mine. The grand autismo has connected. Uh oh! Someone's bank heisting for all their GC right now. Oh man! almost have a full load of iron, guys. That's essentially what I've been doing here, is trying to get a full load of iron before I go back to town. So sorry for the inconvenience of all the excitement. I just want to be able to have some iron. Lots and lots of iron. Ah. 
I'll take that. Taking it! He is taking all of our resources! Grrr. Oh, this guy needs everything, apparently. Tin, iron, you name it. I just need iron right now. Go. Oh! Your mom says hi. Comes out with the victory of GC. Congrats, my friend. Congrats. Those bank heists can be pretty brutal. <laughs> He's like, ah! I hear you, Strav9. Over there just laying it down in front of the wall. Taking that dirt nap. I lost almost 100,000. Oh my goodness. Wow. That is serious. Damn, dude. Great axes are beast. Great axes. Are you going the great axe route? Yep, yeah, gotta wait a few minutes. <laughs> These folks keep leaving. Leaving me with all the great uh, spots to pick up. Getting this is ridiculous. I'm at like 70,000 now, Blood Crow. Also, guys, come our one-year mark, I pledge to stream every day, even if it's only one hour, to keep our everyday stream active. You know, every holiday, every stream, every birthday, every everything. We'll at least have one hour in, guys. So... I'm pledging to do our two years, and our new one-year command will be streaming every day from 5 p.m. to such and such, you know, even if it's just an hour, we're getting our streams in, and that's what matters. 
playing games, hanging out, and streaming with you guys here in the arcade. Starting Friday. I would love, love, love to get my next uh, ore miner, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Not with three people being up here. Yeah, these guys are going to run me out of all the ore possible, so I might leave. Come back at another time. Alright, time to go back to town. But what's really nice is I can get the, the pine that's here. Yeah, buddy. You know what's going to be really funny, though? Huh. Here's something, here's something I want you to think about. The basic weapons, like bows and daggers and crap like that, you know? Yeah. Eventually what's going to happen is that whenever you level these things up, like the sword and things like that, if you actually have just tier two armor on, yeah. because like, the higher up you get, right, you keep giving the those items more ability power. So you're going to in, initially make the, the the weaker ones even stronger and stronger. So eventually, you're if you got your max level, like you've got all the way up to like tier eight gear or whatever, right? Yeah. And you've gotten all the unlocks. You've gotten all those ability powers, like your trickling tier two down. Your stuff's gonna be just as strong. It's it's gonna be just as strong as probably tier four, and you'll be able to duel people and like throw them off. Like, how are you beating me? How are you doing so much damage with a tier two bow? Be like, bitch, please. Leveled everything up. I'm just a champion. That's what. Get all up our resources. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and get off for a little bit. Oh, you're gonna leave? No, yeah. you always leave. Yeah, I'm about to get on some league. I think, or see at least what's going on in league. Let me see him. Yeah, you always leave. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at this! Look at this! Look at this! Scheduled, scheduled delivery date. I got my scheduled delivery date for my uh, Loot Creek. By the way, Anthony, Loot Crate so, now so always comes with a t-shirt now. I subscribed for one year. It's going to be awesome. Because my anaconda don't. My anaconda don't. My anaconda don't want none unless he got some. Finally, the loot crate shipping. It should be here. When's our next unboxing? Well, supposedly soon. But the anticipated ship date was the. 12th or the 8th of this month from Bell Gardens, California, and they don't even have a, like, estimated. We might not have it by Christmas. It'd be really cool if we do, though. I would love to unbox this before Christmas or on Christmas. That would be kind of cool. Yeah. 
how long you streaming in uh, till? Uh, I'm gonna go to like 1 p.m. our time. That's the goal. So roughly five more hours should do us some good. Yeah, 1 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So that's, you know, five more hours, guys. Five more hours. I know, sweet, says Strav, sweet. Hey, Blood Crow, you gonna stay up till 1 a.m.? When? Huh? When? Tonight. Dude, I got work, no. <laughs> also, the semester is over. The grind of finals and all of that is over, so good luck everyone from college. Or university um, definitely have fun for your winter break stay safe all of that good stuff because we are doing it here too as well ah, I found some iron out in the middle of nowhere Take out a couple of these foxes here. There we go. Just think, there's going to be so much more Albion when it comes out, when it fully releases. I'm, I'm going to be. She said. I'm kind of going to be afraid, like, how much Zerg is going to happen. That's what she said. How bad do you think it's going to get, Blood Crow? Very bad. It's it's going to be probably... I know at one point it's going to get to a point where it's unplayable. So like a lot of folks said, this no. is the golden age of Albion, technically. Pretty much what's going to happen is you're going to have a lot of people maybe coming in that are newbies or something, and they're probably going to be stupid enough to attack someone in like T4, T5 gear, and they're going to get wrecked depending on what gear those people have. Like I'm in T5, T4, or I'm in T5 and T4.2 gear right now, and uh, a dude with the great axe is pretty much just about two shot me with 1600 health. So. People in tier two or something, you're going to have these groups that are going to come in just to troll. They're going to make an account and get a bunch of them together, get a bunch of T2 gear, and just start going around saying, we're going to kill everybody. And they're going yeah. to end up getting wrecked. Like, it's going to be funny. It's going to be, like, really funny to watch. But they probably could actually, you know, damage someone enough to kill them. With a party of 20, yeah. they're going to come after one person. It's going to get ridiculous. But it's going to be funny to watch them get wrecked, too, because if they don't know how the game works and they're just like, you know, numbers matter, well, numbers and gear matter in this game, and uh, I would laugh so hard if, uh, like, all those 20 people, like, all have swords or something and maybe a healer, and, and they all get charging wrecked. people, like, yeah, it's like one dude with a, technically one guy could kill all of them if that happened, like, he could get a battle axe and do his little spin to win. And probably could actually kill them all. It would be funny as shit. And then he could root them, wait for his cooldowns, and then do it again. <laughs> that would be oh, so geez. funny to watch. Ah, 
Uh, give me, give me, give me the cotton. Browse your snow down shop. What? Ask your friend what he thinks. Blood Crow in your channel timed out. Oh, well, Blood Crow timed out. I can't ask him what he thinks about the war bow. He has one. Blood Crow joined your channel. Hey, Blood Crow. Blood Crow. You there, man? My bad, I accidentally hit the damn. Told you I hit the damn button on here. Um, and it turns all the volume down. Strav9 actually wants to know your thoughts on the Warbo. You have one, I know you do. Warbo? Yeah, I've got a 5.2 Warbo. What do you, uh, what do you think about it? It's great for CC and it's good for group PvP. Primarily. I mean, I, I do use it to farm with and stuff, and it does work really well. The 5.2 bow does a lot more damage. It's, it's great. Um, the 4.2 is kind of like the it's okay mode. 5.2 does a lot, and I've seen somebody dueling somebody else with a 6.2 one, and that thing is ridiculous. 6.2 is really good, but uh, 5.2 is it, it's really fun, man. Like I think it's I think it's definitely worth going, but it's probably best in group fights because you're able to. Um, there he goes, and uh, you're pretty much able to like mass AOE stun people. And if you have leather armor um, and you're trying to be primarily just like a, a a jackass, like you're just trying to stun people for the longest duration possible, then leather's the way to go because, uh, well, not leather, but uh, um, cloth chest and leather boots and helmet. Because you can get like 50, you know, yeah, 50% CC duration with the cloth. And then if you get the... Uh, you can get 5% CC duration on the boots and helmet. Works really well for, like, just being a stun person. It's really detrimental. But from what I've seen here lately, dude, from what I've seen here lately, honestly, Anthony, Great Axe is freaking tremendous damage. I like, I just watched a guy beat people, like, including me, um, even though I had the war bow, he was like literally just like doing one. I don't know what the spells were. I haven't used a great axe yet, but uh, that looks like it's going to be a great weapon in PvP because it does like he took half my health in one shot. He did over 800 damage in one shot, wow. and then did his little Garen spin to win and just like whittled me down and then charged and hit me one more time and I was done. It was wow. it was crazy. It was like I couldn't do anything to him. I, got, I maybe took about half his health with my war bow. But he did have a T four point two or yeah he had a four point two. It wasn't even a good. It wasn't even a five point two. It was a freaking. No, it was a five point two. My bad. It was a five point two. But still, even with my five point two bow, if I had it, it was in another town. I don't think I'd have been able to beat him either way. He did that damn great axe. Crazy damage, man. That's insane. Yeah, it is. That's why I'm actually trying to work towards it now. I'm gonna. Cause I got a 4.2 legendary when I killed and took off somebody a while, like a couple weeks ago. I think I want to try to use it and try it out a little bit on some mobs and see how it works. Do with some people. See um, what it does. Do you know anything about the Great Hammer as well, Blood Crow? Cause uh, Strav Nine's also asking. Uh, he unlocked the Great Hammer today and wants to know how it compares to the Great Axe. Great Axe is better for straight damage. The Great Hammer is kind of like the Warbow. It's like great for now. That's the two-hander. I think what he's talking about is it the two-hander. You're talking about the pole arm, or is he talking about just like the one-hander mace thing? If it's the pole arm, it's mediocre uh, the damage. The great but hammer it's great today. For uh, let's see, it's two hander, four point three. 
Oh, I've not seen no one use that yet, actually. I haven't seen anyone use that. I don't, I don't even know how good it would be, actually. I haven't seen anyone use it. No one in my guild was going for it. Most everybody went for mage staffs because they're broken right now for the most part, especially the curse staffs. Curse and fire is what everybody in my guild was just about using. Hey, there was a helicopter just above my house. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, jeez. You could be, uh, you could probably go outside and see yourself on, uh, the news for whatever the current chase is. <laughs> Dude, how funny that would be. Lid Justice, thank you for the host, my friend. Thank you. Someone throw up that follow one of the mods, please. Throw up that follow for Leah Justice. We're trying to make our trip oh, back into town. How are you, Leah Justice? How are you folks? How is, how's the fam? I'm pretty sure Food Grim Reapers uh, got his... Uh, mod abilities over on Burke Black's channel. Oh wait, it's not 10 yet. That's right, not 10 yet. <laughs> hope everyone's feeling okay. I hope everyone's better from being sick. Hey Blood Crow, you said you put everything on to be geared up for carrying? Yeah, if you're going to be crafting a lot and doing that kind of stuff, dude. Because um, I'm at 141%, and I'm barely moving in my ox right now. And you're, you said yours is at 1,500? Uh, it's actually 1,800. Jesus Christ. Yeah, T5 legendary bag. Um, and I got a T6 ox, I think, is a master masterpiece. So if I can get it up more, I'll probably get over 2,000. So, yeah. I'll be right back. Organizing this. Uh, why don't you spend your books to learn that refining stuff? I. I can't use my books to, to refine. I can't use these books to refine stuff. So what is this one? That's stone cutting. What's this one? Lumberjacking. We are going to be going and getting some wood and some stone here in a bit. We were doing iron. What books you talking about? Blood Crow, are there books for learning? The ones, oh, I am. I can't. I have nothing else I can learn right now. I've I've got to get thirty thousand uh, in wood planner here to to get to that learning point. I need to get uh, one hundred and fifty one ore or one hundred fifty one thousand eight hundred seventy five fame in ore smelter before I can use my learning. I need to get. 67,500 in hide tanner before I can learn the next ability. That's how that works. You're already on the second part of it? Yeah, I'm on the second part. <laughs> Which one are you talking about? This one? I didn't realize I was on fiber.
Well, I got my expert <laughs> sickle. Yeah, I know about quick learning. I'm, uh, let's see, skinning. Not there. I did a lot of the quick learning, but not for that sickle. I didn't realize I already could do that. These, I know I'm at like one of them. Yeah, like, see, I'm not going to use 14 points when I'm only 30,000 away. I'll get this and <laughs> easy when I start making bars. And 90,000, learn tw cost to learn, 22. I'm almost there at 90,000, so why not? You know, I'm, I'm just going to wait. Because I don't want to waste 22 points either. Because I only have 111 left. Organizing right now. So sorry about all of this. Come back. Nice, nice. Blood crow's back, everybody. Good news. You touch my tra la la. My ding ding dong. Oh. My ding ding dong. Anthony, I might actually go over to uh, Hitbox for a little while again. Give it a try again. See what happens. Oh, yeah? No, nah, not many people use it and all, but whatever. Have fun. We'll see. I don't know. Hell, it may just dual stream. <laughs> get to use my one free weapon craft coupon from you. What? <laughs> Strav9, are you trolling over here? My one free weapon craft coupon? <laughs> you hear this? People are already wanting coupons for the crafters guild. Wow. Oh my goodness. Coupons. Nonsense. What nonsense is this coupons, guys? Huh. Alright, I'm gonna play the like, game and probably get off. So I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here for a while. Oh, you're leaving Blood I'll see you tomorrow. Oh. Yeah. Alright, Blood I gotta Crow. This game. <laughs> good night, man. Everyone else, let Later. it know. Have a good night. We'll Blood catch Crow you again. Your channel. Blood Crow's cool people. He left. Damn it. Thought we'd organized. We didn't finish. Oops.
skink. There we go. <sighs> Finally. Finally. <sighs> Alright, so we're going to go mount. Tier 6. Slightly. Slightly. Three kilograms, right? Max load forty one kilograms. Let's see that. Accessories. Bag. Max load one hundred and twenty five kilograms. Legendary. Epic. Buy. Yes. Take item. And let's see. You. 65, 67.5. Well, uh... the highest mount that I can use. Let's look at that destiny board. Ah, I can just go here. Let's see, Grandmaster mounts, huh? That's tier 7. Oh, that carry weight! Wow! Let's see, this business calls for mounts, huh? What's the highest tier we can even use? Or buy? Expansio. Grim Reaper has connected. Let's see. We carry a lot now. Ah, oh, Strav taking a hit, man. Ouch. Let's 
let's go to the guild and let's actually get ready to craft. Go to the guild island. Uh, no, no, not upgrade. I meant travel there. Bye. Hmm. Let's see about that. Let's see about these. Let's see about this. Stone. I can make the stone here, huh? Yes, I can. What about our smelter? Can we make it here? We can make all them copper bars. What's he take for an upgrade? That block. Well, we'll make that block. We'll make it. Yes, we will. <sighs> Time to find a stone spot. Okay, let's make... There we go. We got all that. Let's let's go to town. Let's let's make some stuff. Damn it. Let's come over to our woodworker here. We can only make birch. What will you take in upgrades? 150, eh? 150, eh? We're at tier 3. the same go for you my friend yes it does damn everybody wants tier three uh, block see about buying some just to pass the time take our journey back to smoky bay let's actually go look it's probably gonna be a waste of money Tier 3, resources, stone block, 170, 71,000 for 400, oh crap, whoa, that's like, youch. oh wait, Up, upstairs, upstairs is the iron. So we might be doing a lot of guild stuff. Check King's Market and Queen's Market. Will do. Let me come over here to this lady. And see about making some uncommon. So 479, right? Let's see. Let me grab a drink. They're worth checking out. Will do. Be right back, guys. Grabbing some drink. Pizza? I had two good pizzas. Holy crap, there's like a half a pizza in one slice there. Ridiculous. I did get extra large. Oh. It was only $14. Plus my brownie. <laughs> and, and Pepsi. Oh, yeah, the kids got. I didn't tell you, huh? Oh. Kyle jumped over the thing and got the pizza and brought it in the living room. I caught him just in time when he had two pieces in her hand, and Kyle did too. I took one away from both because that's too much. 
Mooney was like this the whole time, and Kyle was like this, and I'm like, no! <laughs> oh my god. It got done. Woo! Look at that. I'm like a third of the way done. Holy cow. That is some serious crafting right there. I need to unlock the recipe in my destiny board. Are you kidding me? Uh, we're pretty close. I'll wait. You know, I don't want to spend 42. Because we're over halfway. We're over halfway. We got a chunk of, uh, of learning right there. Yeah, we got it. Okay, 723. 108, huh? Whoa! There we go. Some serious experience grind right there. Yeah! I'm loving that. That was a nice pickup. go holy crap and and then oh goodness yeah before the stream ends like wow we're gonna look at chairs guys we will look at chairs because even if it's just like a little cheapy chair that we get to hold us off to that DX racer goal Oh my goodness, even DX racers aren't really that expensive. Yeah, it's like a $600 chair, but then it'll be the only chair I'll ever need for a very, very long time. And, you know, I would like one that suits me. I'm a big guy, so I'm going to have to get the big chair. But that's, that's like, wow. Um, <laughs> I, I can't, I can't believe it. Like, that was... That was serious. I still thank whoever whoever donated the two hundred dollars. That's that's crazy. 
Whoever that was is nuts. to go grab metal, aren't I? I think I'm going to have to go grab some metal. Guild Island, right? Or my island. Travel to my island. Let's go. We're going to check. I think I think I have metal here. Oh, snap. That big pot. Also, guys, if you ever manage to cap the 5 million marker there on the bank heist, that means all money brought into the bank heist. If that's ever hit, then uh, we will definitely be uh, taking care of that. We will get rid of that. Take all... Upgrade our place is going to take some tier 4 materials and always tier 1. We got bone! Oh, rip, rip, folks, in the bank heist. Ouch. That bank heist took you all out. Stormed the bank and killed the entire crew. Not a single soul survived. Rip, 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 my friends. I got me a slice of pizza here. <laughs> huh. Hmm. Also, look at that. One, one, one. I, I've got serious materials at some town, somewhere. <laughs> I have some serious equipment drop. Copper bars. Here we go. Getting that copper. Making them bars. We are getting our hands dirty in the smelter, my friends. Dirty. Here we go. We're we're doing this guys because we're almost there to the next tiers. I would like to get the next smelter. Because we're like just shy of it. And uh, I would like to get the experience. 
you know, the fame for it. And be able to start, like, crafting, like, the next materials. Let's see, 138, huh? I need what? Craft, 50 bars, huh? Let's see, does that get us there? Does that get us all the way? So 50 bars. Yeah! Runite Steel Bar, craftable. It's a 270. I am so sorry. Excuse me for that. Holy cow. We're about to get some serious crafting on into the marketplace. And we're going to start dropping some serious uh, expenses. We are also going to go out and grind for our stone blocks to get all our materials to make tier 3 stone block. You know, it's just the smelter, but still... What? Can I still not make this? Uh, let me look at the destiny board. Damn it. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. I need uh, a total of 455,000, right? But at 113, I can have this. I can bump up the learning. Hmm. But that's making all those bars. I'm having a feeling that because uh, I, I don't think I can craft it. Is that really? Okay. Hmm. We're looking. Uh, for some reason, I can't craft the uncommon steel bar. Oh, it's steel. Okay, let's look at the this guy. There, oh, there it goes. There it goes. Damn. Okay. I can do this. Empress has connected. Hundred and sixty eight bars. Can't do it there. Steel. Hmm. I don't have tier 5 steel yet. Though we can make runite. Runite. We can't make these here. Rare titanium. Legendary titanium. 
Legendary Runite Mythical Runite Steel Bars. Woo! Mythic, man. Mythic. That's a big deal. There. Ah, let's repair our goods before we go out and grab a bunch of that wood we need, or wood, a bunch of that stone we need. Let's repair. Not to mention, I need to start repairing, or uh, making tools, so that way we can repair, prepare ourselves for when we have uh, tool breakage or we need tools. I'll be able to make tools. So I'm going to sit down and actually craft a whole bunch of tools as well. So I'm going to see what the cost of that is and go from there. <laughs> Let's see. Destiny board. Isn't there a queue for destiny board? We learned this. Let's go here. Now you should be able to like craft for like a hundred and something through. Cause like wow. We'll see. Man, there's a fight going on. I don't know, that seems like it might actually be wood this time. Go south, see what we got. Gotta come over here to do that. Again, if you guys want to join me, feel free to do so. Find me in Albion Online, add me as a friend. I'll gladly do all this stuff with you guys. Thank you. 
Here we go. Take that hide. Run, 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 run. Oh, come on, I'm bleeding. There we go. Limestone. Was that sandstone? Yeah, we're going to need that too. Untouched spot of limestone. Whoever knew limestone would be, it's so important. materials. I mean, we can always use hide, guys. Essentially, you're gonna go from that low end here, you're gonna work your way up in the hides, and then start crafting materials based on what you need. So never be afraid to grab materials, guys. I know it seems like it's a lot, it seems like it's gonna suck, but doing it now versus waiting is actually a lot better. Damn it. Killing some uh, wolves and foxes. Wow, we're working towards Claymore Fighter, apparently. That's kind of cool. Hey, what's up? First time? Uh, tuning ah, CG Airedale. What's up, man? Welcome to the arcade, as always. We are getting our Albion online gameplay going. We can always use... Uh, essentially, I'm a crafter by trade, so welcome, my friend. 
If you play Albion online as well, CG Airedale, feel free to join me in game if you like. So again, have fun here as always, and definitely have fun with the community members here. We're always striving to do our best to have a good time. And you know, who knows? You might make new friends, you might meet new streamers, you might just all around have a better time playing some games. Some reason in chat it says no no hosting game. Yeah, I didn't see it. Thank you much. Uh, I do play, and I also am going the crafting route mainly. Nice. Then join us in the crafter society, my friend. Feel free to join us in the crafter society. Would love to have new members. Um, we only started it. Tuesday last week. And since you can't see hosted streams on mobile, I can't see the stream. Ah. Oh, that's right, because he had killed it. He killed it. Alright, we're going down. We're going south. I'm just going to run through it. Screw it. There's supposed to be pine down here now. They're supposed to be real pine trees. I'd like to work on our uh, lumberjack skill, if possible. Get some more of our lumberjack trade in. Meanwhile, I will always fix or fix. I'll always pick up free hide when available, like this boar. Wow. Ooh, 600 fame in our lumberjack skill. The stream works! Nice, nice! Glad to see you can join us, Mate and TV. Here we go. Me that give me that pond. Give me, give me, give me that. Give me, give me, give me that. I want it. I want it all. Gathering up some of that pine tree wood. We'll get some chestnut too. Why not? Because we can always use it all. I don't know why the uh, sound clips out like that. Nice. Twenty-five percent, huh? Wow. Huh? Yeah. All right, guys. I'm gonna go grab my son. I will be right back. Let's see if we can grab uh, another tree before we end up uh, going upstairs. Yep. Here we go. All right, I'm going to grab this tree and be right back, guys. You might want to move that Christmas tree. Yeah, right.
Yeah, you better not throw them at me this time, or I am going to throw them away. Alright. Because if you don't throw them, you can play with them. So, don't throw them. Just play with them. Oh, man, all the folks came down to take out all the trees. Dang. It's because there's finally pine down here and stuff, you know? Damn it. Taking all the trees! Taking all our derbs! They're taking all our derbs! There we go. Will you be playing Terraria on Friday at some point? No. Will not. I mean, it's probably something we're going to work towards later, but... Oh, you mean this... Yeah, this Friday? Yeah, I can do that. Ah. Uh. Mm-hmm. Rar Dragon has connected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This Friday is our one year party, so yes, yeah, I'll be playing Terraria. At some point in there. We'll get some Terraria fun in. Yeah, I I, I, I totally forgot what you were referring to. I just said you could have this piece in secret. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah! There we go. Come down, run over this way. I don't see anything. Really not seeing anything. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, for the uh Yeah, for the party, yeah, we're gonna play. Definitely. go. Do a little bit of running around. For what? 15,000? That ain't bad. I found this stream because of Ferrari. I know. Hmm? Oh, I'm all up in the way then. <sighs> Give me them hides, yes. Oh yeah, the good times, definitely. But yeah, we're putting a uh, password on that on that multiplayer. So yeah. Here we go. Dagnabbit boar. Dagnabbit. Yeah, 
sorry, dude. Are Oh, what a D-bag. So he's got, he's like higher tier stuff, and he's just like, he came into a green zone to do all this? That's pretty fucked up, man. Taking all our derbs. Though we can always use this stuff, limestone and sandstone. We're going to be needing it. We're going to need all of this. I don't see anything on Twitter. Ah, there it is. Yep, I see it. I actually had to refresh the page to see a lot of it. Ah, there we go. Do you use... Wheat deck, I look at it at times. Um, I like it, but it's it's just weird for me. Like I, I like I like the idea of tweet deck. Like uh mm, excuse me. Yes, log in as me. And let me see everything. The Grand Autismo has left the server. It just looks so weird because the activity and my home are always, always going with like 2,000 people being followed. Like I follow over 2,000 people, so like it's just constantly scrolling. So it does catch my eye. Oh, just that little bit. Come on. There we go. Yeah! Tweet deck can be really helpful though when you're sending out your tweets. So it is it is really cool to see that. Like I can see all the activity that comes in onto my Twitter. Huh. Mm -hmm. Well, I had some much, much bigger streamers in here, babe. Huh? Really? Now my mute button doesn't want to work again. Huh. All right. Oh, yeah. I'm like, why can't I move? Oh, I haven't picked up my, you know, my thingamajigger. Take all the regular rock and stone, because we need that and limestone to make tier 2 block. <laughs> you hit your funny bone. Oh, I've hit her funny bone. It's hilarious. Um, let's see, tomorrow is going to be fun. Tomorrow is going to be uh, an awkward stream. I say awkward, it's going to be different. We're essentially going to be streaming, at, uh, basically attaching sounds to all of our, our system here. Uh, so I'm going to have to make room on my computer. I'm going to download probably 
like 200 sounds. I'm going to have like 200 sound clips uh, attached to our alert system. So like we'll have commands for sounds. We'll have commands for uh, all sorts of goofiness. We'll have like a ridiculous amount of specialty alert sounds. We'll have secret sounds in our donations. Um, we're going to have a lot of craziness. I'm trying to put up 100 different sounds for every single dollar amount, all in video game references. So if you played Streets of Rage, like you saw our $200 amount, you know, it was boss fight time, you know, that's, that's surprising in my opinion. That's unbelievably amazing. That was crazy today, and I, I, I still can't, can't, but thank you so much, whoever that was, for their $200 donation. Thank you. It is unbelievable. So, it was gifted to us by Anonymous. And again, thank you so much. That's helping us get a chair uh, until we can save up for a DX racer as well. We would like one. What does he matter about? <laughs> Because he wants, he wants O-A-T right now, and P-I-G-G-A, and I don't want to do some more today. Ah. What crafting are you focused? I'm actually in all the tiers right now. I can, I can, uh, harvest all tier four. Um, I can harvest tier five, um, fibers. So all the tier five fiber materials. I can harvest all those. I'm attempting to be a crafter of all things crafting. So essentially, to get good, you need to be able to craft all of the uh, refined resources. And I need to upgrade my guild hall buildings, or our guild island buildings, for crafter society. Uh, that is going to be our crafter's guild, if you will. I would love to have crafters of all varying degrees and all specialties because without without specialties we aren't going to be able to have high tiered armors or high tiered weapons, bows, axes, halberds, you name it. We won't be able to have that stuff unless someone specializes in it. So we're going to work really hard and as me being the guild leader um, if you play Terraria towards the beginning or middle of the stream and host a game, then I might be able to join. Yeah, we'll be hosting a game, but essentially I would rather not host if I could, if I could uh, get away with it. Just because the last time I hosted a game, we were DDoS really bad. I figured it would be a, a fun, a celebration of all games we've played here on... The, uh, in the arcade. Here we go. Let's see. Oh, my son's getting cranky. You hear him in the background. He's upset. He's getting cranky. He's like, I don't want to play no more, Ma. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> But our lumbering skill was actually our lowest skill by far, and I am trying to get a little into it before, uh, you know, it's time to, like, learn the next one. I would like to have uh, our next tier. I'd actually like to have our next tier in all uh, tools, or at least learning for, for harvesting purposes. 54%. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to uh, carry. Hmm. Okay, we're over here. Anything? Dang, nothing? Whew. Those guys might still be here roaming. 
taking out all the trees. Um, let's see. Where only Steam friends can join, then no DDoS will happen. Yeah, yeah. A game where all Steam friends can join, yeah. But then I'm also leaving out the Game Key Games Steam group, and that's a problem. That's why I tell everyone to join the Game Key Games Steam group. Because it's, it's like having the friends list, and they can join your game off of you. So. We'll have a password, and, and those who want in will get it. That's what we'll do. That'll be cool. Let's see, is friends list on here yet? Nope. Plus, since the 1.3 update, that can be a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I understand that. We can make it a thing, but... 1.3 is nice. That patch makes all bosses, like, essentially uh, have a different pattern. They have a different play pattern, which is really nice. Yeah, I'll let you in, Mate and TV. No biggie. Grab all this. Limestone, sandstone... We'll get our craft on. Our guild island actually looks pretty good, though. Jim. It's it's doing really good. We only we really need tier three block to do anything on the island as far as upgrades are concerned, because we're we put all the wood down. We just need uh, tier three block, like you know rock block. Was it? That's a sandstone block. Yeah, we need tier three sandstone block. So sandstone, limestone, and rough stone are all going to be needed. We need rough stone and limestone to make a uh, limestone block. Then you need limestone block to go with uh, tier three sandstone to make the sandstone block. Yeah. What do you know about night? <laughs> there we go. another pine tree. We'll take it. We bumped up to almost uh, a quarter of the way there. That's totally fine by me. We're also going to need tier three or tier four wood for a couple of structures. That's okay. We can use all the birch chestnut that we can get. Chestnut specifically. We have a bunch of wood stocked up back on the base. You know, at the guild guild headquarters so we are uh, stocking up if we can there we go I don't understand why this statue is here I can't do anything with it Um, kind of tad bit noobish when it comes to Terraria. I know how to make the basics, like Anvil and stuff like that. I haven't experienced any events in Terraria. Uh, you actually have to break those orbs, Mate and TV. You have to break the orbs in Terraria in order to start experiencing events, because once you trigger that, you'll be experiencing those uh, at random. So you'll have, like, the... Uh, you won't have the pirate event. That apparently comes with the, the maps. I haven't gotten a map. Yeah, orbs. You have to dig down in those glowing demon orbs. You have to break You have to break those. And that'll actually trigger every night. Uh, I think you'll have like a 4% chance of getting a blood moon. You'll also have 
something like a 10% chance of getting a Goblin Army event. I have, I'd have to look at the Wikipedia for it again, the wiki. Um, basically, it gives the percentages on how the events take place. So, there we go. There we go. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so also this Saturday is also we may not be streaming because we're doing a 24-hour event for our one-year celebration, guys. Um, I know I can do it because we did a lot of 24 hours this past uh, week. We did like 20-plus hour streams. And that was just by chance, you know. It's, it's like celebrating when you're, you know, you're done with classes or, you know, you don't have any homework to do. Or you don't have any work in general. You know, you've been busting your hump and stuff. Well, here we are. Not to mention, uh, I don't know what Operation Supply Drop has planned this weekend, but I'll be checking into that as well to see if there's a game that we have that they're playing for their event. I uh, wouldn't mind getting into it. I know with uh, the donation, we'll be able to get into any game unless, you know, a key is dropped our way of some kind. You know, I thank all the support that people have given us. You know, all these different streams, stuff like that. And all of our different uh, or charity dates that we've done. And you know, fun times that we've had. Thank all you guys. Because it's, it's the community here that makes things possible. Yeah, bud? Yeah, you're eating oatmeal. Yeah. There we go. Ah, oh, we're like right there. It's like, you will not get this limestone. No, sir. Might go to bed. All right, mate and TV, you have yourself a good night. Grab all that limestone, that beautiful, beautiful limestone. Grab me some tin. While I'm at it down here. Another thing to fill up on because we've had so much copper. Copper for days! <laughs> Here we go. It's funny, I essentially came for the limestone and... and, and rough stone, but we're like in a spot where there's supposed to be pine so we can level up our uh, our lumberjack skill, and I'm just, I'm grabbing anything and everything under the sun. Ooh, no one's grabbed it yet. Until I did. Yeah. If anyone is lurking, please come out into chat, say hi. Uh, if you don't have an account, it takes like two seconds and it's free. Ah, don't worry about it, Main TV. Don't call out the lurkers. The lurkers are what make the channel fun. If they just want to hang out and chill and watch some decent gameplay, then they've found the right place. Boy, gotta love all those YouTube videos. The whole 420 blazed BS. I've spoken when I felt like it. <laughs> 
get that boar, come on. I want it hide. Yeah, give me that hide. I've also muted and watched other channels when I felt like it. See? No worries. Hey, Big Gorilla Mike. Uh, Is there like... A, I think I've asked this before about the Twitch uh, Turbo. Is there anything special besides... Uh, like some emotes and having the Twitch Turbo logo? Uh, is there anything else that special about the Twitch Turbo logo? Like having Twitch Turbo? Put up, Soul Stalker. How you doing, buddy? Uh, what mic do I use? I am using the microphone inside our Logitech C920 webcam. There's a microphone in that. It currently picks up everything under the sun. Everything. So we need to we need to definitely work on getting a better mic, but that is gonna take time. And that's time that I currently do not have right now until next year to worry about microphones because I feel like we're good enough with this one for now. It's it's doing it's doing the job. It's it's not too terrible, you know? Um, I know with a better mic and a filter in front of it, uh, the quality will be better. But it's something we're not in a rush to have unless our webcam goes out, unless the Logitech C920 has a problem. Razer will help with cost through their air filtration stuff. Oh, Razer has air filtration for the microphones, like the microphone covers and the little, like, screen pieces. Didn't know they had the little screen pieces. Or is that, like, what... Or is Razer known for, like, their, like, audio stuff now? Um, I've been seeing a lot of their stuff pop up. I know they have mice, key, you know, laptops and stuff, which I would love to have one of their laptops. That would be phenomenal to have. Man, I'm good. About to start buying, modeling, and painting my 40k army. I think I'm gonna buy Arc too. Nice Soul Stalker. They have a decent. Ah, okay. They have a decent mic. Well, I was like, I was looking at the Blue Yeti, and I had a chance to get one this year, but I didn't do it because I felt like we didn't need it. Um, no affiliation to what? I'm kind of confused here. Yeah, it seems everyone has a Yeti. Yeah, like, I wanted to get a Yeti, but I'm also looking at getting a, like, a, a mic, a boom, like, getting an arm for a microphone. Because uh, right in front of me, I have this huge computer desk, and I have shelves. And I figure I can mount the arm under one side, like have a mount for the arm. Or, and then I can just swing it out in front of us. And I could have the filter and the microphone with the gain set to just, like, really low. So it's just me. It's, like, right here. And everything would sound amazing. The arms are, like, 15 bucks. That's not bad. I could get an arm, and I could mount it to our desk. I would love to have this desk. Not to mention, I would love to have, like, four monitors, not three. Just so I could have, like, one with Twitter on it all the time. <laughs> but then that would just be overkill. It, it'd be too ridiculous. Yeah, give me that boar. Boar hide. You know, and I could just, like, leave Twitter up. No, I didn't beat Fallout 4 yet, Soul Stalker. Uh, oh, affiliation, not air filtration. Oh, okay. Got it. Oh, 
Oh, that tree is right here in front of me, not up here. <laughs> Dang it, people are here taking my lumber. My lumbers. Yeah, give it to me. Yeah, 1800. I love seeing that. Love it. It's so good. We don't have anybody. You ate it all. Yeah, you ate it all. Go give it to mommy. What is that? Give it to me. It's that just energy paper. Oh, okay. Throw it away. <laughs> Alright, once we're full on wood here and stone and rough stone, we're going to uh, go back to town. I mean, I'll always take some rough stone if I can get it. Boom. All right, main TV. See you in a little bit. Uh, Razorzone.com slash sponsored streamer. This link will show you about the Razor stuff in case you want to know. If not, just ignore. All right. Here's an inexpensive mic. I I have an inexpensive mic. It's inside my webcam. If I'm going to go main TV, if I'm going to get a better mic, I'm going to actually get an increase to our streaming equipment. I'm going to get, like, upgrades for our streaming equipment. So that way we have better sound quality than what we have already. I can make adjustments and, and block out the background and things like that. You know, it may not be a, like, 100% upgrade, but, you know, for being in a living room, but the fact of the matter is I want to be able to, like, talk and and have the upgrade. So, yeah, Big Gorilla Mike, what's the uh, link? Or are you sending me the link via Twitter or something? Have you ever played Armored Warfare? Um, I've seen it. It looked cool, and then... I tried to get into it on a friend's computer and realized it was a little more complicated than my liking. Like, I was just like, eh. So what you are saying is, with a blue Yeti, we can hear just you and not anything behind you, like the TV, kids and stuff. Yes, mate and TV, that's essentially what I'm striving uh, to go for in sound quality. So, like, you know, it'll be close, it'll be, like, right here, but I'll have the gain turned way down, so that way it does not pick up, you know, more than a couple feet behind me, so the TV won't be grabbed, and then, like, the only way you'd hear the wife and kids is if they're really loud. I wasn't sure if Nightbot was going to be a Nazi bot. Um, I'm saying go for it. Usually just ask for permission. That's that's usually what we do here. Um, I have it set so because mods can drop links, and I didn't want them getting timed out. And then uh, I also have, uh, you know, mods will time folks out if they weren't given permission. So I'm saying go for it, Big Gorilla Mike. You got the permission, bro. As you can see, Mate and TV just drops links all the time. You pull that up. Become a sponsored streamer? Let's see. I didn't know they had a... I think I put in for this. Don't 
don't worry, we got you covered. One time 25% discount code off the Razer Siren Digital Microphone. Level 2 affiliate sponsored Razer Siren Pro Digital Microphone for free. Free Razer headphones or headset. Affiliate links with Razer Store. Collaterals to use on your stream. Subjects to accept of uh, electronic TNCs that you're officially sponsored by Razer. That's cool. Everyone gets that discount off the bat. That's going to be nice. I'll have to check into that. Because if they got something that's really good that works that I can put onto an arm, that's going to be nice. I'm going to have a lot of fun with that. If not, then we're going to have to rig it, and that's still going to be just fine. Get all this stone. We need all the stone that we can carry. And literally, guys, we have a lot. We have a crap ton here. A hundred of each, pretty much. Two hundred of rough stone, 344 of regular stone. We're, we're on our way. We can make 225, or we can currently make 190 tier 3 stone. I'm not accounting for the block that's already back at the guild. Yeah, and you are closer to affiliation sponsorship than I am since I barely started. Ah, I didn't know that. What are the uh, what are the requirements? Uh, if you don't, uh, if you can talk about it, big gorilla Mike. What are the requirements for that affiliation sponsorship? I would love love to know because I saw that TNC uh, condition. I don't know what that is. Is that terms and services condition? After you work up to a better mic, then try to work up to a mixer. Well, that's that's what our soundboard was going to be. We were going to have a we were going to have a mixer, and uh, I'd like to set up like basically next year a donation goal. But I'm going to be working towards our gaming PC all of next year, probably starting on my birthday or as of the first of the year. I haven't decided yet. Not to mention, I hear Albion Online's coming out too in January, but that's just the rumor mill for free to play. Free to play is going to make this game so much easier, but at the same time, so much harder because, like Blood Pro said, folks are going to run around and try and kill people as soon as possible. So. Those of us who who are going to gear up are going to have to use that time wisely. And Albion Online, get the head start to do what we're doing already. Gear up, craft some gear, buy some gear, start your crafting, start your 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 armor, start your weapons, you know, all that good stuff. Because essentially, I'm going to try and build a guild here. We want to build a guild with you guys and have fun. Essentially, if you guys want to be a part... All right, Main TV. You have yourself a good night. Uh, essentially, we are going to work our butt off to have a like. We want to be able to say, "Hey, armors are fifty, or you know, materials are like fifty a pop." We want to be that leading reason why. You know, and I would love to have it set up that way. We're at what? 91%? That ain't nothing. That ain't nothing on here. And as a crafter, you want to be able to hold as much as you possibly can. Hence why I got the bigger 
uh, mount. I got the bigger bags. That's what I spent my money on. Because eventually, we're going to be traveling outside of here. And that's where I'll be losing, using our lower tier mount to get gear and stuff. But we're going to have, for when we need to stock up on low end materials, we're going to have this big mount for that. So we're never just sitting in one place forever. We're always moving, we're always getting gear, we're always harvesting as much as possible. I mean, hell, it is nice when you can look down and be like, I got 114 uh, uncommon pine. That's pretty friggin' awesome. Hell yeah. We haven't made a lap around the entire place in a little while. I will always encourage free hides. Look at that! Yeah! Give me those hides! Give me those hides! Oh yeah! 15 out of 15. Hell to the yeah! We can always use it! Always use it! Here we go. Let's grab these hides. I mean, we're not we're not leaving. It's not permanent. It's it's weird. At this point, I could care less about fame. I just want to grab up all these low tier hides as fast as possible. Because these are never really farmed. Like hardly ever, as you can see, this that's serious. You have to fill out the app and stuff, I think. I don't have much info on it, but they will want to know that you will be a good spokesperson and that they are going to make a more make more from you than you from them, basically. This link is starting place for affiliation. Ah. Play hard, earn big. Join the Razor affiliate program. Earn exciting commissions selling cutting edge gaming products. Ah. Yep. That's that's how it is with commissions. You earn based on how much is bought. So I've I've done commission before. Um, hell, I worked in telemarketing as one of my first jobs coming out of high school, uh, my senior year. Doctor Marshy disconnected from your channel. It was the channel. worst job ever. I got really sick after two weeks and left. I just I could I could do it, but I was always getting people in Spanish uh, neighborhoods. They had me speaking with Spanish folks. I had to transfer always to the bilingual side. And I would sell maybe one a day, maybe one one credit card a day. It, I'm like an insurance salesman. I was the devil for a little bit. It's, you should get this card. You should put yourself with more money in your account. You know, more money, more, 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 more. You should always do this. You should always get one of our cards. So bad. Yeah. I know he's playing. He came over and gave me one of the big blocks and he handed it to me and he wanted to play with it. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Yeah. Yeah, it's cute. Alright, I'll have to fill that out as best I can. I'm terrible when it comes to this stuff. I am terrible. Seriously, like, I, I'm not good with words. It's like. I can tell you when I've got the product and I'm using it and how much I like it and, you know, whether you guys like it or not, you know, it doesn't matter. I love it and I'll use it to the, I'll use those products to the best of my ability, but if it doesn't sell, it doesn't sell and when you sign up for something and you got to write, like, state why you would even use our product or why should we pick you, that kind of stuff, it's like because I stream every day seven days a week. I'm always streaming. I always play games. I'm always looking into new equipment and want to give the best 100% to my community as a streamer. I want to give the best content possible. 
If that means improving my sound equipment, let's go for it. If it means improving my visual and audio equipment, let's go for it. If it means, hey, I'm going to be playing some more expensive games at some point, then fine. Fuck it. Let's go for it. I'll give anything a shot to keep doing better. I'll give anything a shot, guys. And that's what's so cool about it. Oh, we've hit 100%. But, oh, if we just wouldn't get that... Oh, give it to me. Oh, yeah. yeah. 36,000 wood. I'll always do more, guys. I'll always, always go out of my way to try and make things better on the stream. I mean, what more can I say? I, I bought my first computer thinking, hell yeah, I'll be able to stream right away, giving you guys 100% good quality, and I realized I was wrong. When I when I went down for 10 months, 10, you got, those of you who were here knew, know how much that cost. That cost me more than what I paid for my equipment. That cost me a community that we built so much up we worked so hard for it, and I will never forget it and I will use it as a learning tool for how much uh, equipment matters how much having a computer to stream from every day without problems matters because it's it's a really really big deal there's a lot of folks we don't see unless we have giveaway in our title there's a lot of folks we don't see unless it's like Hey, we got, you know, not only do we got games, we got merchandise of some kind. And that's... I don't want to be known for giveaways anymore. I really don't. I loved it for a while. Realized it. It takes a lot of money. I, I put $250 down in giveaways, and I'm almost out. And then you folks have been generous enough to, to donate, you know, random key packages to the stream and to keep giveaways alive. I mean, we always do end of stream giveaways. We try to make sure there are people here for those. So, I always hope that you folks are here long enough to at least get in on some end of stream giveaways. Even if it's a little bit. Even if it's a little bit. Whew! Man, I have... Today, today has been insane. Wow. Just like I got, I'm, I'm a little teary eyed. You know, it, that donation was amazing. That's, it's mind blowing. More, 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 more. Mine, 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 mine. <laughs> mine, 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 mine. <laughs> Dang it, they're taking the pine. They're taking the pine. They're taking our large arms. And all our gerbs. Go, give me that sandstone. Gimme, gimme. Stupid boar, it's gonna get in our way. <laughs> Here we go. Huh. <laughs> get that bird! Get it! Get it! Get that piggy! Get him! Take out that little piggy! Alright! Alright, alright, alright! We're always apparently working towards our next goals. Oh, we're on the tier twos already? Learn? Wow, what is this? 
leather armor, heavy cloth. Whoa, wait a minute. Journeyman's. And then what is this? Journeyman's light? Light cloth. Light plate. Light leather. Medium plate armor. Oh. Also, guys, I want to be that guy who can craft everything on the Destiny board. I want to be like, oh, you need that armor? Oh, you want to wear that? Oh, well, I can make that. And then just go out and have it. That's the kind of guy I want to be. So we're going to work on all of this, guys. All of this stuff on this half here. Give me that boar hide. Here we go. Huh. We're only one down. That's the crazy part. We're 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 down south. Uh, we're down in the southern part of the map. Just, just you know, getting some pine. Getting some pine. Serious amounts of pine, some hides, lots of stone. You name it. I want that pine. Give me my pine. Give me, give me, give me. Gimme. 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 Woo! 1800! Oh my goodness. Here we go. Regular pine gives us 200. That blue pine gives us 1800. Major difference there, players. Major freaking difference. Oh my word. Are they are they taking all the pine again? Ma, they're taking all the pine trees. <laughs> they're taking all our pine trees. They're taking all the red germs. I know I'm slightly over encumbered. I wonder how much I can wear. Apparently a lot. Yeah, we'll move slow, but town is at least only the next map over. Not like the last time where I was traveling two maps away and such. Could they take all my gerbs? Give me that boar hide. Yeah. Stupid pig. Huh? What's up, babe? There. Yes! Yes! The stupid pig got in the way. Wow, my son's made himself a masterpiece. 
of a tower. He's over here into stacking things. You're not special. I don't want you. I don't want you. Boar, get away from me. Limestone. We can always use this limestone. It's a beautiful thing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Fight this boar here. He's gonna give me fame and more fame. That's actually one thing I've noticed. Fighting the uncommon and rare monsters too give you a lot more fame. But then I can skin them and get fame too when available. I mean, it's 40 fame, but still. Hi. 810 fame. I'll take it. We're, what, 115? We ain't even touched the max weight yet. I got nothing, 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 nothing. I've got nothing, nothing. All right, 361, so that's 200. That's 282 stone block. <laughs> At least tier three anyway. <sighs> Get some of our tasty drink out of our ridiculous mug. Grab some birch while I'm at it. Ooh. Look at that. Mm-mm-mm. All right. <laughs> some serious birch action going on.
grab some tree while I'm at it. Stupid pig. Damn it. And because of the pig, I my plans are foiled. You're thoroughly being turned into bacon today. We'll use you man has connected to in our food. That's why they call me the Baconator. Here we go. We'll come down here. Anything? No. All right, we're going to start making our way back, grabbing as much regular tree and stone as we possibly can going to be importante. Because <laughs> when we go back to town, we are essentially dump dropping everything, going into that menu, getting our craft on, and going from there. We want to go and get our skin on. We're going to go to a dungeon, or at least a heavy animal area where there's like a dungeon for boars. So we can get wild boars as well. Craft, get all that skin. That's what we'll do. <laughs> ah, I have to wait like 30 seconds. 69. No. Lol, 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 lol. What up, Buddha? Will you, will you let out that antidote? <laughs> What's up? Not much. Uh, I think Blood Crow had the right idea on getting some of these materials, man. I'm over here carrying, like, a ridiculous amount that I wasn't able to carry before. I'm kind of curious. Oh, my max... My, well, my max weight on my person has been hit. My max carry on my boar, however, is... That's completely different. What you getting into, Mr. Big Bad Buddha? Uh, just relaxing. Getting your chill on. So when yeah. school start back up for you? I know it's January, I know that. I think well for me it's January third. You wanna know why? Why? <laughs> <It's>, um <laughs> I do sports. Oh that's right. Up. You yeah, guys are like so you guys are like a ten days ago. ahead. I know it's like a month over here. That it feels like it, I bet. Like you're like, man, I'm glad I get the holiday. No, you guys are back in our cause they're ready. Um if you're not in sports, you come back the 24th. Okay, anyway, you're in sports, you go back January 3rd. I'm like, what the fuck? Oh my I'm goodness, like, dude. That's like yeah. your training camp. I see. That's like your winter training camp, right? Essentially. Oh my god, so much stuff. Okay. 
Yeah, so we're not just doing, we're, we're just not doing winter this year. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're so just not doing winter. Ditch her quick and hide to voice lawyers. <laughs> That's hilarious. That has got to be the best lawyers ever. The, the names, Ditcher, Quick, and Hide. Uh, let's see, are there any Cards Against Humanity players here? If anyone knows what Cards Against Humanity uh, is, and for those of you who don't know, it's literally an obscene card game where you pick the funniest phrases, can be uh, literally very vulgar uh, for families. Um, I suggest an extremely conservative family sit down and play this card game with uh, their friends and loved ones because it'll give you guys an outlook that, well, anything is doable in the language of words these days. And it'll definitely be tons of fun, and uh, it'll leave a story that none of you will forget. I'm at 2,000 hit points. I don't know what the hell just happened. <laughs> the most awkward thing. All right, here we go. That's it. Music brought to you by the Big Bad Buddha. <laughs> Just so you know, people can hear you on stream. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> He didn't know he was being still being recorded. Life is not strange for him anymore. No, man. <laughs> I heard the song somehow, and I just hear in my head singing over and over on repeat. I'm like, uh. Uh, did you watch Remember the Titans at all? I wish. I know that song is in Remember the Titans. It's one of my favorite football movies. Um, who doesn't love that movie? Come it's on. it's that movie in uh, Rudy. <laughs> uh, Friday Night Lights isn't so bad either. And then uh, what's that other one? Uh, I know it's that story about Michael Orr. I can't remember the name of it. Uh, uh, shoot, it's gonna it's gonna stump me for a little while. It's that one with the, the, the family takes in the homeless kid. Crap. Uh, blindsided. That's it. Blindsided. That's what you doing, Buddha? About to have dinner? I already had dinner. Oh, you already had it. What up, Easy South? I know it's Seuss, but I like South better. I love bad bitches, that's a fucking problem. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> Ooh, man. You are not you like taking bad bitches. Huh? Who likes bad bitches? Do you like bad bitches? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh man. I'm glad this is mature. Uh, well, my girl <laughs> is one, so yeah, I guess. <laughs> you. What do you mean one? Damn you, Buddha. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about bad bitches. I made it awkward. <laughs> Wait, I'm a bad bitch? Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> She's like, <laughs> I know, right? 
that's great. Oh, that's boy. great. All the sass, man. All the sass. Yep. All that sassiness. All that sass. It doesn't go to waste. I'll tell you guys that right now. <laughs> what are you talking about, Fire Gate? She's over here, like, she gets, and, and some days she makes it really hard to stream just because she just goes on a tirade. Like, she'll make it all about her. No. Yeah, and you'll get all lippy with me and sassy and crazy and. And then I just continue to keep streaming anyway. It's great, it's great content. <laughs> Leaves for great highlights. Same. Same. Huh. You said same. You see his little his little uh highway? That looks cool, don't it? Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Here, have an Oreo. Damn it, you're so loud. An Oreo? Wait, wait, Wario? You're Wario now? What? Huh? No, the wife Wario said now? Oreo. Not oh, Wario. I don't look like an Oreo. I got a question. What's your chance on D? Nice! What? Gauges. Um, a lot of my, a lot of my friends have them. I'm not really like into the whole piercing thing um would you let your kids have okay. <laughs> if my kids want to yeah all right like you know if they want it sure i'll and if they're in a sport or something i'll support my kids 100 percent. i'd really love them to get into a sport or some kind of musical like like as a as a like have to it's like a it's like a must i'd say they have to play sports you know, because I, I don't want them Whoa. to, like, not make it into college. So that's that's the way I look at it. Like, if you want to play football, sure, let's do it. If you into BMX, fine, I'll support you 100%. But while in school, like, do something. You know, or, like, have, like, straight A's. You know, if you're not doing a sport, straight A's. So that way you're noticed something for college. Yeah, babe. I'm gonna take him to bed. He's coming with him. Yeah. He's over here throwing blocks at me, so he's going to bed. Yeah, it's that time. He's tired. He's tired on that night, okay? I'll give you some drink and stuff. You gonna help mommy pick up your blocks? No, don't tell him that because he's gonna throw them at me. I don't know why you're gonna throw them at me. Stay over there. Jingle balls, don't jingle tell him what balls, balls, jingle balls, jingle balls, jingle balls. I don't know about jingling all the way with there. those. <laughs> Why are you gonna have such a dirty mind for? You're the one who said balls. Balls of steel. Who do you know so much about those kind of balls? Because we know you, Beta. <laughs> you know me? Balls, oh, balls, you know me. Balls, balls of steel. From the DLD. <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass and chew bubble gum, and I'm all out of gum. <laughs> Yeah, you got that swagger. Swagger. Swagger Jagger. Like Mick Jagger, yeah. Too bad all that swagger in my wallet isn't like matching his. Baby. Ow! Dang, your your viewers are probably like, huh? <laughs> that fucking song, uh. Damn it, I can't think of it right now. Maybe it's a party in the USA? I remember hearing that when I came yeah. home from my deployment back Get in uh, 2010. Down. No, because you threw it. We're going to bed. I remember hearing that as one of the first songs on the radio. Please. Please. Alright. Alright, we're back in town. Yeah. I'm going to take my son to bed and we're going to keep town. back at it. The boys are back in town. Oh, yeah. That song is awesome. I like that one. I like that song. Yeah. There's a song to everything you say. You realize oh, that, right? yeah. Yeah, there is a song to everything. All right, I'll be right back. I'm going to take my son to bed and we will continue our Albion Online stream. Be right back, guys.
The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. <laughs> Please. Please. Boys are back in town. Boys are back in town. Man, oh man, he just didn't want to like go to sleep. Whew. Man. Sorry for taking so long, guys. Taking so long. Let's see. Alright. Man, like the Albion online community has literally died. I wonder what's up with that. Uh, nothing against you guys or Albion Online in general, but holy crap, you know? 
Uh, let's see, tier two skins, tier three skin. Rock. There's all that rock. <laughs> so what you doing, Buddha? <laughs> this guy's live streaming, right? And the game lagged and glitched. So his character is like extremely puny and just walking around. <laughs> On roof. Everyone's confused right now. I'm glad you I'm not changing the I'm glad he's going to stay in the world. This is where I went. Ah. Yeah. Let's uh let's go back. Get all the rocky yes we do. Alright, we're gonna yeah, go back to rocky town. Rocky. I'm gonna say something like stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, people know you're stupid already. God damn it. <laughs> Gotta love Twitch. Wait, did I host you? Yeah you did. <laughs> Stupidity part number one. It's already being aired out on his stream. <laughs> Ooh. Yo, I was farting earlier though. Oof. That was raunchy as hell. <laughs> Again, that sounds like really, really Terra bad. Doing more than Terra. <laughs> Terra bad. Oh, you take tier five stone. Okay, wow. Oh, that's right, because we can make tier four block. So we're gonna make all the tier two limestone block that we can. Which go figure, triple six. Well you use a cutie pie. You're a cutie pie. Here we go. Yeah. Yo, hey, jingle baby girl. Bells, jingle bells, Hi, jingle baby bells. girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, why aren't you playing Christmas music for your stream, man? Uh, that'll be tomorrow. We're we're gonna get into the Christmas music. Well, wait. Friday gives us a week away. So. George. An entire week of Christmas music. That'll be fun. You know how epic that would be? That's like the definition of epic. Do you hear it? It's the music. Music makes you feel good. Ah, here we go. 793. Three limestone block. And we're getting more back. So, yeah. I'm kill this guy. Worth it. So worth it. Rar Dragon has left the server.
Yes, baby. Hmm. BBU cutie pie. <laughs> So much block. Yes. 881 block. All right, I can start upgrading everything here. Even our ore. Upgrade. Here we go, guys. Upgrading all our stuff so we can keep creating more. I love this. Love it, Buddha. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh! Oh, they increased it. Yes, we're not just giving five anymore. We're not just giving five to our upgrades anymore. We're giving 30 at a time. Oh, this is so good. You're such a savage. <laughs> yes, another implementation of the new patch. I can't believe it, man. We're only going to have to do this five times before we can upgrade our friggin' smelter. Yes! Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck this guy. He really did that shit to me. I hate him for doing that shit to me. Who? What happened now? This guy. He like, he hacked. He's a, basically a hacker. Okay, I'll pay it. I'm not saying pay it right now. I'm just saying, okay, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it's like due by the 25th. I'm not worried. I got the bills, babe. Don't worry. Are we going to be able to pay all of those? I know one of them is cheap. Yes. Know. Yes. I don't remember what was the electric or gas. Gas is super cheap. Okay. I think that one was like 40, maybe 60 or something like that. Yeah. Gas is a good go. Let's see, what do we, uh, let's see, repair, upgrade. So you want more tier one wood, but tier four block. Got it. Is that a good old crunchy piece of good money? Here we go. I realize I may need a repair station. We Man, we can finally upgrade all our stuff. Upgrade. We are finally doing it, ladies and gents. Getting these upgrades on. Because we got 99 problems, but the patch ain't one. Welcome any new folks to the stream. Welcome to the arcade. We've been doing this for one year, playing games and hanging out with you guys for one year on Friday. Oh, man. We want to be able to create Tier 4 tools, so we have to upgrade our Journeyman's Toolmaker right now. I don't think I have a blacksmith so I have my, here. Um... My, my freaking, my RA, my residence is like the person who watch, you know, you know what an RA is, right? Yeah. Yeah. Your residence, uh, uh yeah. attendant, attendee or whatever. They're like yeah, your mom or dad. Snapchat, and he's hammered right now. It's so funny. <laughs> really? He's just, because no one's there. So he doesn't have to watch anyone. He's just sitting there drunk. Oh, that's awesome. 
Exactly, that's all I'm saying. He's chilling at his place just fucking hammered. That's so awesome. Not to mention, being an RA, you get like an, an extra $1,000 to go to school, right? Yeah. That's pretty awesome. That's like a, a big privilege, in my opinion. I'd love to be an RA, but I don't live on campus, you know? Now, if I was single and everything, yeah, I'd be an RA in a heartbeat. I would definitely be an RA. Why? I'd live in the dorms, my place would be set up, and I'd be streaming, like, superstar status. I'd have my own internet, though, still. I'd, I'd be bringing in my own internet to stream. You know, screw uh, the universities. You know? All right. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I could do that too. No, no, no. Become a, yeah. If you are, if you're an RA, you get a whole room to yourself, like a full room. Yeah, that and that's a big deal, especially in college. You know, you've got your own place. You paint no, out the butt. Like I think. A, like a, yeah, I you think you isn't isn't your room uh, also free? Like your your living expenses yeah, yeah. free? Yeah. So you're uh, kind of like a. Like a hall monitor, like everyone on the floor, like, hey, if you guys got a problem, call me ASAP. <laughs> and then you're just like in charge of people. Which is totally cool. I would be an RA. I, you know, it's nothing new to me. I did this stuff, kind of stuff in the Marine Corps all the time. You know, I even still do it to this day. Hey, you guys need a place to crash and you're, you're traveling through like from state to state. Hey, I've got a couch. I've got you know, a roof over your head and, you know, a hot meal ready ready to go if you guys need it, but... RAs get free food all the time from their residents, like, yeah. it's like... You know, like yeah, you because the food. RAs keep everything fucking hush-hush under the fucking table. <laughs> fucking R... Being an RA is badass, like, I have a couple of friends who are doing it, and they're like, dude, I, get, I make mad money just, just by being an RA. I was like, what? They're like, yeah, like, you know, throw parties and stuff. We just keep it quiet, keep it maintained, no fights. Like, what? It's like, yeah, we just have a hall party, the whole floor parties. Like, it's just ridiculous. All right. And then you can have it's, some RAs yeah. who are like, you can't do anything, blah, blah, blah. Like, who, uh, yeah, like, I hate when they do that. Like, I'd be like, uh, if we're getting looked at for being too loud from the floor above us and below us, yeah, we need to be on our good behavior this week. But <laughs> until then, nope. <laughs> you know, as long as I don't have any complaints, then we're, we're, we're pretty much golden. But, you know, that doesn't mean you can't stop by. You can't, you know... Fucking, if you're worried about stuff going on, stay at, you know, stay in the spare room or something. Shoot. Yes, we can now make better crafting materials with our weaver. <sighs> Bands and make your dance. It's so it's so nice to have like like I'm now getting my buildings onto the same level that I am. And they're getting a decent look too. They're getting like a new look whenever we do stuff. Alright, they want tier four block. Okay, okay. We can make tier four block. I think I might want a transmuter. That's what I might want. Let's see, I gotta check for a blacksmith. I don't think I have one. Okay, we've got a little bit of a screen glitch there, which I hate that so much. 
All right, what is our place at? I know these guys had to have gone out right now, right? Oh, I didn't even send these guys out. Oh, snap. Alright, there we go. Lumber and stone. Um, lumber, stone, and iron. So if I pick up all of this, this is going to be just fine. Let's make our tier 4 stone. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. <laughs> there we go. Craft it all. Yes. Yeah, you said baby girl's naked. All right. Here we go. Crafting, we're crafting, we're crafting, crafting, crafting. Crafty, 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 craft. Crafty, 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 craft. Crafty, 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 craft. Craft, 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 craft. All right, we got all of that done. Dang it, I should have used that. Upgrade. 150. Here we go. Do this five times fast. Woo! We're upgrading our smelter! I'm wearing ladies' underwear. Hey, Buddha, you remember Shrek, don't yeah. you? Yeah. I'm wearing ladies' underwear. Are you? I yeah, certainly why? am not. Looks like you certainly am not. <laughs> Are you? It's a well, the wife just killed it, so now I can't even go through that. <laughs> Thanks. Sorry. This is why I need my own studio, fuckers. <laughs> wife wants to ruin everything. God damn it! I'm the one that said it first to begin with, so ha ha ha. See, this is what I mean. This isn't her content, it's my content. Sorry doesn't cover it, woman. I tried to make the high chair. I totally missed. No, I tried to make the high chair. I missed. My bad, RIP headphone users. Empress has left the server. Almost there, guys. Almost. We're literally putting down all our block that we can before we move on. Because holy cow. Take 30 from here. Drop another 30. I know I'll put this 100 block in the marketplace to accrue some money. I know this block will be totally worth it. It's a little expensive as well, so we're going to net a nice little penny. I say little, you know, because, well, it is a little penny. Mascor has connected. I get fucked up right here. <laughs> we don't oh, no! Fuck. 
I clicked the wrong. I, I clicked. I clicked on screen. Ugh. All right, we're almost there. Almost there. <laughs> yo, yo. Uh. <laughs> this guy just said, get wrecked, right? That's it. And I wrote, well played, right? And then yeah. I just killed him. <laughs> and then you killed him? Nice. <laughs> Get wrecked. He's pissed. And he's then he pissed. died. He's pissed. I bet he's pissed. Like, god damn it. Oh, it is you. Necromancer. Deckard Cain, my favorite person in all of Diablo. Or not Deckard Cain, but uh, in D2, when you finally get to... Uh, the jungle. I want to say that's Act 3 or 4. And you have the old guy there talking. Oh, it's so freaking funny. Because he's like, damn it! I wish you people would just leave me. Oh, it is you! And it's like, whatever your class is, he says it. <laughs> yeah, baby girl, where the oh my God, I'm about to cry. I'm about to, I can't believe that just happened. That guy is so pissed. Yeah. Like Im imagine thinking you're about to win and just like with like that one hit, you're like, what? <laughs> you're like, like I mean, saw real quick. All right, so Buddha, you got to get Albion online, bro. You got to come help me with my guild. Yo, that's not fair. Why? You, you, do you know what type of you, do you know what type of player I am? I'm the definition of grind. I can't be playing those games. D yeah, you can. It's the whole <laughs> point. You can grind out I'm some playing, resources for us. I'm playing Hearthstone and Blizzard accounts right now. You think I have time? I don't have. <laughs> Bro, I would need it. I would have to invest Bro. in a third monitor. <laughs> you you need to like. Come get this game. I would have to invest into another one. Okay. Yeah, I know. You're fine. You can go get a go get another monitor. Come come grind. I'll wait. <laughs> what? Let's see, how much is this guy going to take? Hmm. Oh wow, not that much, really? And he wants tier... He wants... He wants... Oh, he just wants that block. I think we have enough block. Let's go grab the block. Oh, we only got one sandstone block. Yeah. All right. All right, one sandstone block. Okay, let's go drop 130 into the marketplace under, you know, 10 or 15 under everyone else in game, so we can make some serious money. Serious. Oh, it's going for 153. So tier four is going for one fifty. Yeah, I think I'll just keep my tier three or my tier four sand, you know, travertine block. 
because that seems to be going for really low prices. But if you go tier three or tier five, it's higher prices. No, makes no sense, but. You're a hacker. Who? Yeah. Me, I bust my ass, man. All of my time has quite literally been spent grind, uh, grinding for equipment. You're lying. You're lying. No. Nope. Oh shit, you got really quiet. What happened? <laughs> I'm just chilling, bro. <laughs> you scared me. I was like, huh? Uh, where did you go? Call me a hacker, that's it, I'm done talking to you. Done. Over. Shit. Fuck, I'm sorry, man. He mom! He called me a hacker! Oh, I didn't mean to call you a hacker. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was just imitating how to be a little girl real quick. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Right in time. Right right in time. Uh let's see. Any equipment here? Actually, yeah. We're gonna do this. We're gonna grab these materials. We're gonna grab that block. We're actually wild, gonna go see. back to base. RuneScape still gets a lot of views. That's too far. Yo, RuneScape Classic is too Clans. strong! Clash of Clans has 1,400 viewers? What the fuck? Really? <laughs> That's insanely ridiculous. You know, when I used to... That was when I, I streamed that shit for like Kill a week, has and I got connected. like a hundred dollars. <laughs> That's that's why everyone streams it. You don't do anything. <laughs> ah, that's right. Here we go. Now I can drop a stack and be like, oh god, my carry weight is way too damn high. Let's let's drop this one hundred skins back. <sighs> All right, here we go. Here we here we here we go. Going 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 back. Going 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 back. We're going to drop our miscellaneous resources back into their tier pools. Ninety-seven there. Actually, I want that because I think we can craft that now. Let's put our block in its respective place. There and that there. Right, tier three skin, full hide and leather. All right, and then our block that's left because it's actually worthless compared to tier three or tier five block. Uh, we're gonna go over here to our cloth lady. And make a crap ton of neat cloth. Love you too, babe. I mean, it's better to make it. Uh... Oh, I have to craft the next tier of stuff. Mm. 
Oh my goodness. 99 problems with a patch 81. This patch has brought so many amazingly good things. So many good things, guys. This is so boring. I don't get why Clash of Clans gets these viewers, man. What the fuck? It's mobile games, bro. Mobile games. Hashtag mobile games rule the world. Alright, so we can't make the next tier yet. We have to... Do I gotta grind out for some block? Or some tr oh, trees, trees, trees. That's what I need. That's probably what I should be grinding out while I'm here. Grab all the trees that we can get right here. Why? This the island is full of them. I mean, our weaver is right there. I tried to find your guild and I cannot find it. PM do in game. Could you send me an invite? Sure can. My RA is so drunk. There we go. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I got another member to the Crafters Society. Welcome to the Crafters. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Hello? Yo, I hate Internet Explorer. With, like, a passion. Why isn't my Chrome downloaded? Um, why don't you have Google Chrome downloaded, bro? Why are you being such a noob? Huh? Alright, don't call me a noob, man. I, I don't like that. Don't yeah, call me yeah. Noob. Good noob, sir. I'm not a noob. <laughs> so over there, noob tubing on his his Yo, Internet I'm Explorer. Not a noob. I'm not a noob. Noob tubing it, noob. I'm not a noob. Oh my god, Sales Center, if you have that much to bank heist, that's going to be ridiculous, bro. Holy crap. Holy crap. That's going to be insane. Alright, where do I want to go? I want to go maybe to a Fiverr farm? I'd say maybe, but I also want to come over here, so I'd have to go to Queen's Pool. Um... Uh... Uh... This girl better accept back that I'm actually trying to text her, like, with real words. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, bro. Go for it. I always, I always text like a, like a retard. I'm like, yeah, okay, how about you? Okay, yes, lol, oh my god, cute, okay. And That's this time you're using real words. And she's I'm like, like, hello, how are you doing? And she's like, oh my god, you're using real words, thank you! Like, oh my god, yeah. Like, oh my god! <laughs> like, seriously? It's so serial right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
like for real, like oh my god. No, no. Oh. Surreal. <laughs> like a cereal. Yeah. You it, even though it's literally a change of two letters, yeah. the S for the the C for the S and the I for the A, so you That's can so put real. cereal. Surreal, so bra. Surreal girl. He's a keeper. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I love you, lying. Why the fuck are you lying? Why are you lying? <laughs> Straight up, everyone just left. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Oh man. Don't leave. Don't leave. Baby, come back. Oh my goodness. I'll be on line is awesome, though. Yeah. Baby, come back! <laughs> oh, man. When you see me. This game is so good, though. So good, bro. You need to get this. You need to get this. <laughs> Buddha, they're, they're like, there's no more wasting time. You need to get this in your life. <laughs> Hell yeah, I got a brownie. I'm like a fat kid in a candy store. I just got a brownie. Distal's hey. place. Want to hear the most the annoying world? sound in the world? <laughs> Distal's place. Thank you for the follow and the support. Welcome to the arcade, my friend. It's all much appreciated. Feel free to have fun with us. <laughs> bling bling. Yeah. Hey, want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? <laughs> I love that alert sound right now. <laughs> oh, man. It's so funny every time. Like, folks may not know what's going on for a minute, but it brings a smile to my face. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. I had some uh, happy tears for a minute. Oh man! So, Yo, I can't log so on good. to RuneScape right now. You want to know why? What'd you do? I don't know. Every famous clan is online, and like all the servers are float. Like the servers up at two thousand. Every server is at eight nine hundred, like one thousand five hundred on dead man, which means. I'm at a high risk of dying if I go into like the unsafe zone. Like, there are people with weapons that can run hit me. I'm not going out. I'm not logging on. <laughs> oh jeez. My friend said don't log on either because he's like he's like a high level. He's like, dude, right now is like danger zone. You need a team. Oh, like you need a team to play right now? It's that bad. Yeah, you really do. Everyone's like, everyone's running away. Everyone's like, nah. We're not playing right now. Like, <laughs> like rip. This is the funniest show I've ever seen. Just getting our trees and rocks along the way to our fiber farm. We're not hitting up everything because, well, once we get to the fiber farm, we're gonna be like harvesting hardcore for all that fiber. Because now we have, we also have. Hey, but fiber four. will make you big, man. That's not good. Uh, bro, cotton fiber, cotton. Not oh. that other kind of fiber. Not the fiber you eat. Oh. CG Airedale, don't worry, my friend. the The alert system has a tough time catching up. So our alerts hit anywhere from a, a few seconds to a few minutes. So give it time; it'll pull through. It might even catch on the next follow. <laughs> so we're gonna hear it twice. <laughs> Give me my stone. I need my stone. Or give me death. It's all good. Not worried about it. Also, guys, you catch me uh, playing Diablo, Reaper of Souls. 
Uh, I am on the PTR, so definitely use our battle net tag down below. That is uh, game key, hash mark 1131. You know, G A M E K E Y, you know, because you can't use numbers in Diablo for, for Battle.net for I don't know what reason. We need to keep it uncomplicated. You have so much swag, bro. What, in Battle.net? You have swag. I have some lag? No, oh, you have swag. Oh, swag. Yeah, I, tell me something swagger. I don't know, brother. Swagger. This is all this beard swag going on. That's all this is. Yo, beard swag. So I go on Tinder, right? My friend said, yo, you're about to laugh. I'm like, what? I, he, he told me to go on his Tinder. I'm like, why? And he went on my account and switched it to guys again and freaking liked everyone. Yes! Yes, Sales Center! Hell yeah! Diablo's new season starts January 15th. You guys will see me on there with a Thorn Crusader on the live uh, seasonal patch. I can't wait. Thank you for letting us know, Sayo Center. Hell yeah, I'm excited now. The Thorn Crusader lives. That Thorn Crusader lives. Hey, wanna hear the most annoying sound in the world? What <laughs> did you hear the sound? <laughs> oh, dude, Stale Center, definitely. Definitely. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. We grabbed a whole bunch of basic cotton. We're going to grab all this stone on the way. We need the limestone. We need, we need the limestone. Because we always need stone to go to the next tier. In our tools uh, station, we need all of it. Because, well, let's face it, we're noobs. Noobs! That wolf hide, though. <laughs> Wolfy hide. Rock. <laughs> wait, this guy's about to rage on the street. Hold on. <laughs> here we go. Wait, I can't, yeah. I can't watch this I'm about to cry. Who is it that's raging? Yes. Dude, this dude's like one of the newest RuneScape streamers, and all he does is rage. It's so funny. Oh, that's great. It's all an act, but it's really good acting, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, like, that's this his thing, is he's always raging. Ra <laughs> RuneScape raging, brought to you by that guy. Like, no one's ever done it on RS. I mean, there was a guy on RS, but he got annoyed. But this guy is funny. Oh, is he like typing to them and like raging out in chats and stuff? No, no, no. Like he pr he pretends to care. He plays like the battle music. He gets ready. Then he dies. <laughs> oh. 
Oh god! Then he just goes off. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's cr- that's- <laughs> That's too funny. That's gonna be funny. Oh man. RuneScape's a very old game. Dude, it's filled with college students. That's what the game is filled with. Yeah, but it's been around... Yeah, those college students were the middle schoolers that were playing it to begin with. Yeah. And it's filled with older guys who are like 25. Who are like, like my age. Who's been playing it since... Who's been playing it since the vanilla came out for the first time. Dude, this game is brilliant. If you played it since it came out, you'd be a god. Well, yeah. <laughs> Max 99 fishing and everything. Dude, you'd be a god. Everyone would know who you are in the game. Oh my goodness. This guy's raging pretty hard right now. That's what she said. See what I did there? Hmm? Hmm? All right. Let's see. All right. Got right up on this cotton patch. Oh my God! Yes. Yes. Fiber farm, amazing. Oh my god, wow. Dude, Buddha, I'm back in the business. This fiber farm is gonna be nice. Spaghetti. Sweet. I'm gonna eat it all. Go for it, bro. Freaking hungry. Oh my god, we have 12,000 freaking. Oh, this is so good. I thought you said you had 12,000 viewers. Dude, if I had 12,000 viewers, I, I think I would have made Twitch front page by now. <laughs> oh my goodness. You'd be going crazy, wouldn't you? Oh, dude, it'd be freaking awesome. That would be an insane amount. Pulling in massive amounts of experience right now.
Oh, this is so good. So much experience. Let's just grab all the fibers because we're just that good. This is such a good idea to come here. Xanano has connected. Oh, oh, we got competition. Connected. Here we go. Zeno has left the server. My mic is so sensitive to the car you choose. Xanano has connected. Nice little chunk of experience, by the way. I feel like the crafter society is going to be known for fiber. This guy, Inky, he knows how to entertain people. He yeah. changes the mood. He goes from rager to complainer to story time. <laughs> With some bullshit ass story that everyone knows is bullshit. Hey, some folks love story time. Just be like, story he time said, Friday. He said one day in third grade, when there, there was this one guy. One day in third grade, there's this one guy. Yeah, and then he started giving me kisses. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, I think those guys are here to take everything, and I'm just like, I'm going to take everything I can. Ooh, 
Buddha's over there doing his recon for the monks. Buddha, you reconning other streamers? Is that what you're doing? What? You over there getting your recon on for the for the monks? What do you mean? Buddha's Buddha's getting ideas. He's getting his his recon homework done. <laughs> He's gonna start telling stories and shit. But Hell you yeah. never won a million dollars. No. No, I did win a million dollars. I spent it all on condoms. So then I had to stop AIDS in Africa. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> won a million dollars. Oh, dude, that story, do, you, do you know how many people would laugh at that story? Uh, dude, hundreds of people. Hundreds. Hundreds upon thousands. Dude, like, like, you wanna know what I did with that million dollars? I bought fucking condoms for freaking Africa so then AIDS won't spread. Yeah, free condoms. <laughs> they thought they were water tubes. <laughs> Fucking, you know, clown balloons and shit. Look at a flick in the dick. What? <laughs> that, that would all be Buddha. Nah, oh, that was you, man. There's no one else in this freaking chat other than you. Oh, oh. I know my beard does not speak for me. <laughs> I, hey, I have a beard too. <laughs> a mini beard. It's there. He's got a little baby beard. <laughs> it's a little baby beard. Oh, it's so cute. It's like, it's like, oh, um, at least four centimeters, five centimeters of long of facial hair. That's good enough. He's got two and a half inches, just like he does in real life. Oh! Yeah, facial hair, I know. <laughs> oh, oh, we weren't talking about man parts here. I see my Schwartz is bigger than your Schwartz. Yeah, man parts, beards. <laughs> oh, God. Beards. Beards! Please be something up here. No. up picking up all that cotton up there. I mean, it's easy, easy crafting materials. And we're gonna need them to, to do the progression through tiers thing. Because we need it. We really, really need it. What I'll really need is to start getting that sky leaf. And I only know a few places in yellow zones to get it. And I, I rarely see it, too. That's the terrible thing. All by water. <laughs> that gold border around your portrait from the legendary no pack? Uh, yeah. Yes, it is. There's Easy, no too. <laughs> I actually had to progress into it. I had to progress into it. So there's this one, this I one. I don't know about these. Story as good as this. I would like this one, though. Solkajito07 has left the server. Here we go. Yeah. 
Yeah. Like I said, I'm gathering all of this fiber just because we're gonna need it. Take out the little bunny rabbit because we're just that cool. Dude is gonna have a heart attack over there. Dude, this dude is too funny, Genki. Someone needs to put him on Comedy Central. I will legit watch Comedy Central. Genki. It's like, when I watch you, right, I'm like, I'm calm, peaceful, I'm like, you know, having a good time. I watch him, I'm like, I'm about to have a heart attack because I'm crying. <laughs> but, ob but obviously you can't have that laughter all the time. Like if I'm trying to sleep, I have to watch you, cause like you not like you entertain me, but I can sleep. But I watch him, I can't do shit. <laughs> I hear you, man. I hear you. I try to keep it peaceful, calm, chill. Like I ha I like chilling. It's, it's what I do. On other days, we have our hype moments. You know, it's just how the stream gets. I'm just surprised that people aren't farming here right now. Shh. You can't let people know where I am. You just know I'm at one of the fiber farms. Okay. 600. Nice. Nice. We are a tenth of the way there. Wait, I have to go use the bathroom. Oh, you're laughing so hard? Here we go. Let's do it. Yeah, I got the legendary pack, so I've got this. My house will be a legendary home, which is quite literally an upside-down, uh, like, ship. It's kind of cool. Now I can finally start upgrading the home. I will work on that. Clicked it too soon. Damn. Here we go. Let's get down here. Again, it's it's like a slow process. We are a crafting society, so we've got to get all the resources that we can. Huh? Wrist is starting to kill. Oh man. Like, I don't know if I'm leaning on it or what, but dang.
<sighs> yes, gather all the crafting materials. Also, again, guys, we do have a referral link. It does help out the basically the guild here on Albion Online. If you guys purchase using the referral link a veteran, epic, or legendary pack, I managed to get, uh, you know, like a thousand, two thousand, or four thousand gold uh, based on package for referrals. So definitely come join me, come hang out, and have a good time, guys. I'm just as excited about this game as you folks. I just have a different route. I am going peer crafting, and I'm all about the team play. We just need team players. <laughs> you know, at any given point. But don't everybody jump up at once now. Don't everybody jump up at once. <laughs> you know, I know everyone's excited. Everyone wants to join us. It's all good. Let's come over here. Wow. Yeah. Go here we go, I wouldn't notice. So many people and make their spawn point here for this time of night for when folks come back and like, you know, you can sit here and harvest fiber all night long. It's so good. Have you or do you play WoW at all? No, I am not a World of Warcraft player at all. Um, I, I realized, like, seriously, I sat down and was like, I can't play this game. The game cannot be beaten in one year. So I actually opted to step away from that particular MMO. Um, however, I am also new to MMOs. You know, like, this is my first one that I've been excited about. You know, be an Albion online and all. Let's see, I need to go back through that yellow area. I kind of wish I had two of each tier, or two of uh, each of the harvesting tools. Because I could use them badly. Wow, we picked up a lot. Wow, that is insane, man. Insane. Whew. Um, but yeah, I like watching people play WoW, though. It is exciting. I played a lot of Perfect World um, way back in the day. I no longer have that account, though. That's the terrible part. I played a lot, a lot of Perfect World. That game was actually really cool. Plus, I didn't want to pay for World of, uh, World of Warcraft because I didn't at the time have a computer until literally like two years ago. I didn't have a computer until then. Like my own personal desktop. Um, not to mention, you know, it was my mom's. It finally kaput. And I decided, you know what? I'm going to... Uh, buy my own computer, and this is the first computer I built, uh, then I started streaming, and, you know, we've been here for a year, 
I used to play Perfect World Panda Race, man. Um, I played, like, regular, what, humans, whatever they were. I tried to go as human as possible. I wanted to do the whole, like, wedding ceremony type thing. Like, I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it. Thought it would be hilarious. And a buddy of mine spends lots of time in the game. Besides playing a lot of games on, uh, you know, Steam. He plays a lot, a lot of Perfect World. He's dropped lots of real money on it, too. So... It's always fun. That game, there's so much cool stuff. And the world bosses are probably some of the coolest stuff I've seen to date. Um, which is why I like the idea of World of War, uh, Warcraft, like play, playing WoW. You know, you've got all those world bosses and stuff. Um, but I just, I'm not into it like that. I'm not into that particular MMO. Because everyone wants to see the WoW killer. The, the, the game that destroys WoW. And, well... There is ne if you keep comparing games to WoW, you're never going to see the WoW killer because, well, nothing is out there just like WoW anymore. Nothing is out there. Uh... Here we go. <laughs> like, this expansion was almost going to do it. What do you mean? This expansion was almost going to do what? Kill WoW? Went from 14 million subs to like 6 million. Hey, when you've got a game that's still in the millions, I don't think they're going to like stop. Oh, there's Airedale. There he is. Oh, it's right here. Go. Oh, man. So, like, easy. So what actually happened with uh, this particular patch in WoW? What, like, what was it that was a big deal? What, what killed it? What did I do? What did I do? Get us back to town. They 
basically announced a bunch of stuff to come with Warlords and then didn't release any of it and just released a very lazy expansion. Ho oh, ho ho ho! Like every single expansion has had a new class or race, but this one didn't. Wow, really? So this expansion could have like hurt WoW in that crazy way. I feel like a lot of people go back to subscribing to WoW just to play the expansion and then leave for good. Like they don't play like once they play for two three days and experience everything, they quit. Like that's it. There's nothing that brings people back. You know what I mean? Yo, I'm gonna log off. Oh, alright, Buddha. You have a good night, bro. Yeah. Later. Buddha disconnected from your channel. Prospectors. Here we go. I didn't see that before. Okay. No clue. 
All right. This and this plus this. What did the patch change? Um, basically, the patch changed the destiny board. So now you're not... Uh, essentially, it's not taking so long to reach uh, the next tiers. And they condensed a lot of the tiers together. So like... Uh, refining materials and tools used to be out here on the end of the board as well. They actually used to be here, but uh, tools and stuff used to be here, as, or refining uh, materials. Essentially, they've condensed it. So each tier, you're learning something. But they've also dropped, because they literally had something like 10 billion fame for end game stuff. And it's like, really? 10 billion? Um, I think I'd just rather use my quick learn skills. Well... Quick learning has essentially become easier too. So, you know, you don't have to farm so much. Farming is made easier. Um, upgrading even your equipment has become ton times easier. We've reached this today. Like, this has happened today. We've reached tier two. So, you know, we, we were here, now we're here. Heavy Master's Plate Boots. I can wear those now? What? What is that? Tier 5 materials? What the hell was I wearing before? While wearing Adept's Heavy Plate Armor Boots? Okay. They've... Basically, farming is made easier. Grinding equipment is made 10 times easier. Um, gathering, though, is also set at... Like, fame is, is not scaled anymore. It's actually at a set rate, but it is so much worth because it's actually at a higher rate uh, when you go for the tier 4 materials that are uncommon and rare. It's, it's actually really, really good. Um, it's, it's really, really nice. And look, when you're upgrading your buildings, you're putting 30 down. Not 5, 30. That's a huge, vast improvement. Not to mention they changed, uh, they helped get rid of a lot of the glitches. So, you know, having a legendary home and needing a legendary anchor to use that home it isn't required anymore. So that's also a big, big major improvement. Look at that. Boom! Now let's talk about limestone. Let's go 200. Yeah, 200 limestone. This, the crafting part, is actually a lot easier too. Um, I remember crafting 2 to 500 and it took forever. That's a thing of the past now. Which is really, really cool. Let's come over here to our tool maker and look at upgrading. Okay. He wants tier 4 block as well. Then maybe it's our, um, you know, that one lady, our cotton, our weaver. Our weaver. Soul has We're going to check connected. her right after I deposit this 30 wood in there. I should probably read the patch notes as well. Because um, they're I think they finally made changes to the PvP side of things as well. I do not know those changes. We went through them earlier today. Ah, here we... Wow, really? You only need that little bit of... Stone? Wow! We're going to get you set up right away, lady. Because I've got lots of materials. Do you think that taking away from the necessary grind will make the game dull and potentially just too easy to reach higher tier activities? Or does it take longer the higher you go, etc.? Just curious. Um, It's like a little bit of... It's a mix of both. It's not going to make the game easier by any means. But it's, it's actually a lot 
less grinding. Like, something that could potentially take you a few months now to grind to and be obtainable is now scaled down into, you know, however much time you're going to put into the game. This might take you a couple of weeks to get the end game gear, but it's not going to take you months, okay? That's the biggest thing about it. They went back to uh, what my friend Blood Crow says is the original format. So, yes, things are great. So, uncommon and rare tier 4. What is it? Uh, rare tier 4 gets you 1,800 fame. Uncommon gets you somewhere around seven or 800. But the grind to farm that is still there because you're eventually going to run out of quick learning points. And what's that? what that means is you're going to be sitting there saving them for a specific reason, for a particular armor, a weapon, a piece of gear, something. And that's what matters. Literally, that's what matters. Uh, let's get our block. Let's get out here. We're going to make all this block. Craft. There we go. 208 sandstone block. Boom. All right, all right. Talk about 232 block. That's actually really, really nice to see. We are going to hit up you. Or do you require tier 4? Repair upgrade. Oh, you take tier 5 right now. Got it. Got it. Hair upgrade. Oh, you take tier four. Dag nabbit. The other thing takes tier three. Gosh. Here we go. I'm going to need to make some tier four block. Here we go, here we go, come on. Repair. Feed the need, yes, we have 201 block. We can upgrade and have those tier four tools ready. Oh, so nice, so nice. Not to mention, I think I can make some finally too. We'll, we'll see, no, I actually have to make up to that class. So it's like, grrr, they're going to get me. This is where they get me. I have to be able to craft it. So I'm going to have to go through the previous tiers till I can craft tier 4 tools. Which is more farm, more fame. Okay, so now that you can't reach higher tier... No, you can reach the higher tiers faster. Do you think this game will still have a longevity to it? Do you think that there will be enough content to keep playing further down the road? Yes. Yes. They... LZO. I'm, I'm trying to say that they made reaching those tiers faster because they kept everything at a particular scale across the board on all materials. So each tier type has its own uh, fame. You know, just like before, but it's, it's a little more fame, and then they scaled back the tiers for learning, for learning those uh, progressions, you know, for learning that next tier, they scaled back the fame a lot. So some folks went up an entire tier because they've grinded out so much. Uh, and then they scaled back, which meant they were over the total amount. So that's that's the big deal that I'm talking about. They, they scaled back the, the grind so that way you don't have to do it for so long because it would take a very very long time to get everything 
that's what I plan on doing. But uh, it's it's not going to take as long anymore to get that armor you want, to get that weapon you need. It's not going to take as long as, as what you thought. They've essentially cut everything in like half. So it's really, really nice to see that stuff. Oh, this sucks having to sit here and wait for the tier 3 stuff to drop. Okay. 21 will go in, and then we'll drop three loads of wood, upgrade this place. We'll be able to utilize that tier 4 function, but we will have to craft our butt off. And getting, getting the materials is going to be easy. When you can grab tier 5 stuff, having to craft tier 3 is going to be easy. And I'll just craft, I'll put everything I can into the marketplace. Buddy, that's right. That's right. Put it all in there. We almost have this place upgraded. Not to mention, uh, again, you know, they took out a lot of bugs. Oh no, no! I put it all in repair, not, not upgrade. Oh, that's so bad. No. Damn it. I put into repair, not upgrade. I, I fucking ruined it. Damn it, I wasted 200 block. Oh, that, that burns me so bad. It's much more friendlier to new players now that it has been scaled. Got it. Yes. How long with the way this patch changed things do you think it will take to get everything on the Destiny board? It's still going to take a very long time. You know, I put in over 70 hours last week alone. And uh, we've only progressed this far. And here's the thing. Two of six tiers for all of your tools, you know, all of them. And then you have uh, wood refinement. Oh, why didn't, uh, we are almost there. Why don't I learn this? Is our woodsman over here? Does he need, he needs, doesn't he? He needs. I need, I need, says this woodsman. There's our 30 block. Fuck! We could have put, that's the one I was looking for. We could have scaled these guys. Damn it. I did the wrong thing. And that's how little of, an, of a mistake I made that's going to cost me some time. Damn. Damn. Upgrade. There we go, and we already did that. Okay, these guys, these guys need it. I need to buy that demolition hammer to knock out that other place. However, I can go here, drop the wood, I can pick up our metal. No. I can pick up our... I can pick up our cotton. So the cotton's too heavy. Really? Come on. Come on. Here we go. 
Let's get over there. We need to go to our cotton lady. Make our our material. Come on. You said earlier there were PvP changes. Is that based off of certain damage scaling, CC duration, etc.? Or do you not dabble in the PvP? I dabble in it. I I'm I'm going to later. Um, but essentially they've been adjusting uh, weapons and stuff. So right now the cursed staff is still huge uh, to get. But it's not as powerful. It's, it was doing like a 1,000 AOE damage effect. Um, they changed that in the previous patch before this one. Um, but now they have... Uh, like great axes are extremely big on the PvP side. Also, it seems like everyone's going heavy plate of some sort or cloth only. Um, the Warbow is still huge. The Warbow has an explosive AOE on it. And it's actually ridiculous amounts of damage right now. It's, it's some of its unheard damage. Um, as Blood Crow mentioned earlier, uh, 6, 6 6.2 Warbow it is literally chunking people by like 900 health a hit. Like that's a big, big, big deal. It's ridiculously big deal. What do you need? Tier 4 stone. Damn you. Damn you and your stone needing. How much do you need? Because I know we have stone. How much do you need, lady? 150. I think we got it. Yeah, that five per upgrade item was... Oh, that was so fucking time-wasting. That was so bad. They should let us have, like, a fucking cap on it. You know, like, drop it to, like, 100 because... Or, or 200, not 30. Just sitting there waiting in increments of 30. Like, I'm the kind of guy who will stack up ridiculous amounts of resources and then wait. I will wait. And then when the time comes, oh, we don't have it. No. No. Let's see. Do you have 20 travertine? Uh... Give 20 travertine. Or 20 tier 4 block. Hoping to grab this game after Christmas. Still have uh, shopping to do for the family, so still looks great, though. Glad to see they are changing things around for the better. Oh, El LZO. Also. Uh, think about this. If you're not getting the game till after Christmas, just hold off. The rumor mill is going around that this game is coming out free to play in January. Not too sure yet. But if it's not coming out till like March or, you know, April, then yeah, don't jump on a, a Veterans Founders pack and, and come join us. Come have fun. If not, uh, if it's coming out free to play in January, we'll see you then. Um, nothing is certain, though. Nothing is certain. Thank you. Thank you, Airedale. He is checking to see if he's got that Tier 4 uh, stone. Because I absolutely, positively have to freaking have it. Drop that there, that there. Huh. Wow, if it's that soon, I'll be glad. Yeah, that's, like I said, you know, that's the rumor that's going around. We don't know if it's true or not, but we are going to keep you guys posted because I know you guys want to play with us. Some of you do not have the funds to play, and I'm sitting here waiting just as much as you guys are because when this comes out free to play... I'm going to be all over this game. I might even take a back seat from Diablo to be playing this game day in and day out because I want to build up the Crafter Society as much as freaking possible. 
my goal is to have the Crafter Society crafting gear for all guilds in Albion. I want to be able to decide, like, hey, we're working with all guilds, regardless of grudges and, and, and battles, but we are Crafter Society, a fully neutral guild, going out and having fun in Albion to craft for all. We want to take our skill and put it to good use, so that way we're the ones, we're the top guild claiming, you know, end game gear for sale because you don't see tier t6 t7 t8 armors on sale you don't see that on sale and i want to be that guy doing that i want to be that guild that's that society if you will rock Actually going for a decent little price. Mascor has hit. left the server. Uh, let's see, tier three. I'm gonna go out and craft it anyway. I'm going to go out and harvest it anyway. So. Let's see. How about tools? We'll go tier 4. Let's go sickle. Let's buy one. Let's go pickaxe. Buy... Stone hammer by skinny knife, wood axe by. What are those books in your bag for? I don't craft, so I've never seen those. Um, okay, we have the books in my bag. These are for your laborers. Okay, so when you're Let's go back to my my island home and let's give our full book to our laborer. You have like a wood laborer, a stone laborer, uh, metal and uh, fiber, I think. You have laborers in all different different fields, okay? And essentially you're like, oh, hey, dude, go take this full book because I harvested. The book is tier two. I harvested tier two plus materials. <laughs> And uh, I need to go grab my bed. And essentially, you're going to give it to him. And he's going to go out, like in WoW, and he's going to go get gather materials for you. He's going to grab a couple, you know, like 100, 150, and just go from there. It's like, whatever. Okay, so what? I need to come here to my bank. Go all the way south. Grab my bed. Uh, let's see. Materials. Grab that. Yeah, I forgot about this stuff. Wow, we got a ton of pine. Okay. All right. Okay, let's see. Can I put some other stuff on? Yes, I can. Alright, I'm moving as slow as my molasses. Uh, check party chat. 
Uh, came back, forgot tier 3 stone. Mind if I get 72 so I can make tier 4 stone? Um... Uh, uh, CG... <laughs> I need tier 3 stone also, so let's go hit up the stone uh, gathering spot on map. I know I look super slow. We came to the guild one so I could drop resources into the uh, bank. There we go. Just to make this look a little better. Tier 4 block. Tier 5 stone. Alright, now I get to go back to the guild. <laughs> Nobody maths well, Airedale. Alright, I need to go back to my island, get my journey on. Journey! Journey, journey. Ba, 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 ba. The little things we have to do to make sure we can keep at it, my friends. The little things we have to do. So essentially, this is what that book is for, easy, easy, Seuss. Alright, you'll come here, and look, my book is full. Fame. You, you fill up the book with fame for gathering at that resource tier or higher. Um, essentially, that book is going to level up with the laborer. So here's what you do. You're going to take that book and drop a journal into his thingamajig. He's not happy because I don't have a bed down. That's okay. I'm going to do this, and I'm going to drop a bed down. Place. Bill, we put our bed down. All right, his happiness is going to improve. Rao will improve after. And then you give him the book and poof, he disappears. So no worries, my friends. No worries. You're going to give your laborer, you know, bread, a uh, trophy mantle... You're going to give him a bed. You're going to keep him happy. So essentially, he's always, always going to uh, give you the most resources he can. Let's see, you need tier fours. You need tier ones. So we need a lot of tier one rock. Like that. <laughs> uh. Off to Smoky Bay. All right. Southwest, or no, southeast, then northeast. How you dig in the patch? Lumber dump, dude. Oh, the patch is so good. It's made, it has made everything ten times better. The fame for... 
the tiers is it's scale you know it's not scaled anymore to monster levels and and yourself but essentially it's set to a decent standard across the board for all stuff then the fame is dropped like half for everything so that's going to make everything we do in game worth it 10 times more not to mention you know it's like oh wood let's grab that you know, yeah, it looks low right now, but once you get into the uncommon and rare stuff, it's so good. I realize I'm not in the right spot. I meant to go around this. We're going to a stone spot, by the way. What do you, for what? What? They add on to your nail. You know, no, you know more about cosmetology than I do. Oh, there's probably an item they're showing, and they're saying add on, like, hey, you know, like when you're ordering food yeah. from Papa John's, hey, do you want to add a pep, uh, Pepsi or Coke to your order? add on and it just puts it into your shopping cart but yeah basically uh it's whoa oh you put him on fire got it i can carry a lot and then uh they also made it they made a uh, fame it's it's so nice to see it when you're getting uncommon and rare and you're just like oh yeah Oh, he was outside your little meteor thing. Sorry. I'll always take wolf hide. Why not? Yeah, that's so awesome. They, it's just... For farming purposes, it, the game has gotten easier. The PvP aspect, uh, I don't know all the changes, but I know the Warbo uh, AoE is ridiculous now. There's an explosive AoE to it. It's amazing. Amaze. I mean, you're doing so much damage. It's so good. Uh, the higher tiers of some of these weapons, though, are taking out, like, 900, 1,000 health, you know, two hits on some of these high equipped players and that's like whatever but in the end of the day you're gonna just be looking at it like this ain't so bad that ain't so bad well we could do this we could do that you kind of want those higher end weapons I guess period but you're gonna have to fight to get there However, doing what we're doing here, because we are all over that stone gathering at this point. We're almost there. I can carry quite a bit, so I'm not worried about room. I'm going to go till I'm like 150 uh, over carry weight. It'll be slow. Get that little doggy. Yeah. There we go. Thank you, Elzio, my friend. Stick around, pull up a chair, and you get to hear Jim Carrey tell you about the most annoying sound in the world. Okay. I think it's hilarious. This is the cheapest one. This is twenty-eight dollars, and then this one, wait, this one's sixty. I think twenty-eight dollars. No, eighty-nine dollars. And I don't know why I thought it hit that mark. I paid the one though. Which one? I thought I paid the uh, the high gas one. The electric. I mean gas. Or electric. Sorry, electric. No, this is the gas. You paid for the gas. This one's forty-two. From when? Because. If it's 86, it's probably from last month. Oh, 
Is it from last month? Ah. Uh. No, I didn't pay the gas at all. And I'll pay that. Oh, the electric? Yeah. Alright, I still gotta pay the internet. The internet, I have to pay soon. Okay. We don't want to be without stream, do we? That, that, sh yeah, that, we should have enough money for everything. I know I'll have enough money next month as well. Hey! Wanna hear the most annoying sound in the world? <laughs> Thank you, LZO, my friend, for the support, the follow. It is appreciated, my friend, and welcome to the arcade, where we've been doing this quite literally for a year come Friday. So I hope all of you folks come in to our one-year celebration anniversary stream. It is going to... we're going to shoot for 24 hours. Uh, we're going to be playing games with you guys anywhere from two to three hours each, and we're trying to spread the gameplay up. So that way you guys get to have fun uh, with us throughout the entire stream. We are also going to be playing maybe one or two games. One or two games. I'm hoping to get on Albion for like three hours. That follow notification. Hell yeah, man. Who doesn't like Dumb and Dumber? That shit's hilarious. I love Dumb and Dumber. Movies are too funny. Too funny. hugs. Oh, thank you for the hugs, Thorlar. How are you, man? Sorry to hear about those problems you've had the past few days. I, like, hey, things happen. Life happens, Thorlar. You know this just as much as I do, man. And it was just like, you know, my son had to go to the doctors and get his arm looked at. Turned out his, like, his forearm had pulled out a socket to his elbow, and they just held his arm, gave his forearm a little twist, like they twisted it, while keeping his, uh, upper arm in place and they basically popped it back in it wasn't a big deal they said it's super cop common nice airedale you came over from thorlar's stream well thorlar man we're we're gonna essentially build a guild off of some of the folks from your stream man we got airedale over here in crafter society so don't forget about us if you guys need any crafting done whatsoever, we're going to be here for all of your your guild's crafting needs, Thorlar. Oh my goodness. But yeah, folks. Uh, okay, there we go. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. Why my guy wasn't reacting. Um, I tried to get off my mount. Didn't seem like it did it. And then it wasn't reacting to picking up materials. So yeah. But yeah, my son got, you know, had to go to the doctor yesterday. Then at the end of the night, the wife couldn't find her phone. We thought it was stolen. We've had the update at the beginning of the stream that, no, it wasn't stolen. You know, we found it. We had tore the whole house apart. You know, I was like, dang, you know, tearing the house. We tore the house up looking for her phone and could not find it. Well, wake up today because we thought maintenance had stolen it. That's how big of a deal it was for us. I thought maintenance had stolen from my house. You know, we've been here for three years in this apartment, and we've never had this kind of an issue. Well, all things turn up. Everything's good. Phone works still and everything. Turns out it was in my son's room underneath another uh, cushion, which was then covered by toys, which was then covered by more toys, and uh, a couple pieces of clothing. He has like little boonie hats that I have uh, that I gave him. And then his grandpa gave him one too. Life does happen indeed. And I'm glad you're able to take the situation in a good mood. Sucks to have those things happen so close to Christmas too. Kind of does bum one out a bit. I'm glad the phone wasn't stolen either. Oh, definitely, man. 
And then what sucks is, uh, again, as you guys can see, I my chair broke last night on top of everything else. So I'm using my my coughing table, my coffee table here, as a uh, chair. And uh, it's just like, holy crap. Yeah, yeah, your friend definitely donated 200 bucks so I could get a new chair. Hell yeah, man. Um, I'm a, a man of simple pleasures. You know, I want a DX racer, but I can wait. I can wait for that, personally. Um, because all of my equipment, I have bought all of my streaming equipment. I've bought myself. I would love to have things faster, but that's okay. Um, we are going to get a chair before the stream is over. That's for sure. It's what, like 12.30? Let's get up here to this stone. Wait, wait, wait. Where are we? Oh, oh my god, we never went down the steps. How much do you lack for a DX racer? Um, because of my size, you know, I'm a big guy. Uh, I don't know. I think I'm getting like the extra large one because I, I'm, I'm too heavy for the irregular chairs. However, I wish we could have Twitch colored D DX racers. I was at TwitchCon. Oh, oh my God! It looks like someone took a Super Nintendo and splattered a DX racer chair with it, like a Super Nintendo controller. Not Super Famicom with the green, yellow, red, and blue button. Hell no! Super Nintendo. I loved those colors. I was like, yes, Super Nintendo. It says Twitch on it in purple. It's perfect. Uh. I think DX racers are like 600. Um, let's let's do this. I'll do this part now. You know, cause ah, uh, let's get up here. Let's get onto the path. Looking at chairs. Here we go. All right. Uh, oh my god, that sounds... So yeah, dude. Uh, Twitch DX Racer? I wonder if like I could find one on Amazon. Oh, no, 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 no. They don't have a Twitch DX racer. It's funny. I'm I'm on uh, Amazon. There we go. DX racer. Yeah, some of these are like four hundred. Um, I need to see. Like X, yeah, X large. That's what I'm looking for. X large. X large because I'm a big guy. I do like the black and red. If they had a blue and red, that'd be kind of cool too. I like I like blue. Um, I managed to get a DX racer in a Swedish store for like 300 bucks, shipping included. Same cost as their website. That was standard edition though. Yeah, I'm a big guy, and it's it's like pushing 450. What? They have DX racer like tables? I wish they had blue. Like, does it come in blue? Let's look at the DX uh, racer website. Um, DXRacer.com. There we go. Official website. Um, let's look at products. PC gaming chair. Racing series. Do they have a blue? I don't care about the zero. I want a blue. Yeah, there's a blue one. Three fifty. Really? I'm looking. I am looking, guys. Let's go. Let's go back. 
30% off. And there's a Black Ops one. Nip? What is Nip? What the hell's that? Adjustable arms, conventional tilt mechanism, aluminum base. Uh... Where, what site did you go to, Thorlar? Or are you not, like, or you're not North American, are you? You're, you're not from North America, right? You said in a Swedish store. Oh, Nip's a team. Ninjas in pajamas. Ninjas in pajamas from League. Personally, I feel like a DX racer is an economical investment since it's built to last. So it'll stay stay fresh and stable for years to come. No risk needing to buy a new one too soon. Like I said, I bought through a Swedish site since I'm Swedish, which cut down the shipping fee quite a bit. Yeah, we have something similar to that here in, apparently in my state where I'm from here in Ohio. But I know DX Racers are built to last. It's a big name. Uh, no. Console gaming chair. Is that the kind of chair I'm looking at? King Series? What? Oh, the King Series has a little, like, foot stand. Really? Oh, and I guess it comes with, like, the Glom Tom pillow... So you can like you can rest your your elbows on it, which oh my goodness that's so amazing to have a glom tom pillow. It's nice for when you're literally using a controller and you're just chilling. You can tuck it up under your arms. Yeah, they have a foot stand, dude. That's awesome. It's right there, free shipping included. It's out of stock though. Are you kidding me? For five hundred dollars, that'd be perfect. I would, like, move back my, uh, I have, like, a baby gate under my desk so my kids don't crawl under, play with wires, and, like, get into the kitchen, you know, making a break for it. Uh, I would have that footrest underneath. Like, I could, I could do this. I could, I could totally do this if I moved up my keyboard, if I still had the roll-away table underneath, which I need to put back. Um, that's, what, in the kitchen? The roll-away table here? Still in the kitchen, isn't it? Okay, because I can put that back in. Um, in a use, you oh, out of stock formula series. Um, formula blue. Are they seriously out of stock? What about wide series office chair? Wide. I could do this. Out of stock, out of stock, out of stock, out of stock. Out. They're out of stock. Oh my goodness. Am I even, am I going to be able to get a chair? I'm like, what seems to be 200 off here, roughly, plus maybe, maybe free shipping. And then if I go to Amazon, there are people are charging upwards of five hundred dollars. Oh man. Um wow. Some of their designs are temporary and some of these are out of stock since they were earmarked for free shipping. Yeah, free shipping is a big, big deal. Like, that's huge. Free shipping. Um, <sighs> office chair? Soho chair drifting series? Uh, again, everything on their site is out. Of, everything is out of stock. Are you serious? Whoa! No, this is the DX Racer website, babe. This is the site. They're always out of stock because the produce is the the produce in batches. My cousin got a DX Racer off Craigslist in relatively new condition for two twenty five. If you live near a major city, that could be an option. I don't. 
Yeah, god damn it, DX Racer. Like, oh my goodness. I I want a chair. <laughs> I want a chair. Oh my god. Um Oh my goodness. That actually that could be a good point, Thorlar. An extra lack of chairs due to Christmas. Oh my goodness. So many people are getting some badass Christmas gifts this year. Oh my goodness. Sales. That's what we'll do. We'll do sales. Or it won't let us go through sales. How about I go home? And one fingerprint, one person, one DX racer. Really? Did you know DX racer? Okay, here's chairs they do have in stock. I don't care about Call of Duty. Yellow is just Navi. I'm going to guess that's a team. That yellow is just, I don't know. It's too... Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> and green, I'm not... It's weird. Like, if my chair has a color, I wouldn't mind blue. Red's also nice. Oh, Navi. Team, duh. I'm an idiot. Insomnia, the UK's biggest gaming festival. I'm an insomniac as of last week. <laughs> Be careful to get one that is targeted for people with wide behinds. They have those bars on the right and left of the seat you'd sit on if you're too wide. I'm not super wide. I'm like 250, so I'm like, I'm above the original chair, but the bigger chair would totally, I'd be in the clear. Like, I am not that, I'm not super wide, you know what I mean? I'm not monster. You know, when I walk through, like, doorways and stuff. <laughs> uh, no offense to anyone who's a big guy. You know, I know what it's like. I am short. I just happen to be growing all my weight out. Not, you know, up. <laughs> you know, I've got this huge 100-pound tire thrown on me. You know, it's all weight and ass cheeks. It's all waist and ass cheeks, guys. That's all I am. I got nubby arms and nubby legs and I'm nothing but ass cheeks and 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 waist. <laughs> Lady has left the server. Um let's see. They have that one, but I need like I I do need the wide seat. <laughs> Pastor Pedro 99, what's up? It's protective coating for the hell, yeah, it's protective coating for the apocalypse. Dude, I don't need food. I just need water every day. I don't need food for like three weeks, man. I'm going to survive. I'm going to be like Cartman on that one episode where they hang him out in the corn cornfield. I leave for three weeks and you look like you became an alcoholic. Oh my God, Pastor Pedro. I'm not an alcoholic, man. I'm just, you know, growing out the beard for the holiday. And we're going to have a glitter beard Friday. Because I was going to dye my hair and my beard. Exactly, we'll be the survivors. Yes, Beachbone. Thorlar, we'll be survivors. Uh, why do they gotta be sold out? I'm at uh I'm I'm definitely at 220 right now. Um however I'm gonna keep that twenty dollars that was donated in the very beginning. That's giveaway money. So I'm like waiting for, you know, a really good Humble Bundle or a really good, uh, you know, games to go on sale so I can have some really good games to give away. So I have essentially got a $200 chair fund that we have thanks to the community here. Um, which, Thorlar, man, I, I did not expect any of that. I am, I'm grateful, man. Um, your community is amazing. So definitely, excuse me, definitely have my thanks. Um, and again, you know, happy holidays and Merry Christmas, everybody. Dang, why does DX Racer have to be sold out? Have you seen the Yogg's Cast Humble Bundle? Yogg's Cast. 
Is that the current Humble Bundle? I'll, I'll actually go look at it now. Um, yo. Pastor Pedro with that one dollar, my friend. Oh my goodness. Thank you, Thorlar. Thank you, guys. Let's see. Pastor Pedro. Lo enjoy your one dollar loaves. Dude, that one dollar is awesome. You know, one dollar or, you know, two hundred dollars. It all helps. And thank you so much, guys. So much. It's so appreciated. 25 bucks and you get everything from it. It's for charity. It has a lot. Yogg's cast. I'm actually on Humble Bundle right now. Um, oh, yeah. This. Okay. Whoa. They've added the games. This is that Neo Geo bundle, isn't it? Not? Wow. Wow. There's what? One. Like, look at this, guys. This is insane. Here's that humble bundle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Okay, twenty, because this is a whole bunch of soundtracks. Twenty-fifth anniversary soundtrack. Uh, and then twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Rock around, to rock around, yeah! Pastor Pedro with that $7. Nah, bruh. Here you go. Here you go. Get what I make per hour. Yeah! Thank you, my friend. Oh, my goodness. It's actually a lot of fun. Uh, you know, the music, the tunes, the fun. Uh, unfortunately, the last big charity they did, they stole money from charity, and they've, as a group, done plenty of terrible things to people, corporations, and similar. So I don't trust their intentions this year either. Whoa, 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 Thorlar, do you mean Humble Bundle, or who? American Red Cross? Like, here's the weird thing. As a charity, they have overhead. They have to be able to pay all their workers and all that stuff, so... You always assume a percentage of your own dollars goes to that charity for the good cause. Um, the last one I really spent a lot of money on was the Operation Supply Drop charity. I do a lot of work with Operation Supply Drop, and uh, I have had so much fun with those guys. All proceeds go to charity. Afterwards, they took a high percentage of the amount donated to their own... Oh! Oh! As always... So basically lying to people about where the money would go. Yeah, this would be cool. That Neo Geo Metal Slug t-shirt. Hell yeah, I'd put down on that. If this stayed to like next year, I would be buying that for the t-shirt. Uh, Metal Slug was a lot of fun. And the King of Fighters 2002 Unlimited match. Oh my god. I remember when that came out. Me and my old man were sitting in a GameStop. My stepmom. She's sitting in the car thinking we're going to take like five minutes to go get this game that I know I've got it on pre-order and everything. We're sitting in the GameStop just sitting there for like an hour and a half playing on the PlayStation console they have available. We're sitting there beating the crap out of each other. And it was just too funny because she came in pissed. She was angry. But me and my dad had a moment. That's something like I'll never forget because me and my own father sat and played video games together. Uh, you can buy 24-7 any game and 10% always goes to any charity you want to support. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in order to be a supportive charity, at least 30% has to go to the actual source, just like the uh, Coney 2012 thing. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. This is awesome, though. I'll put down on this. I mean, hell, put down a dollar and you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And yeah, three, six, seven, eight. Yeah, eight games. That's that's in itself amazing. One dollar for eight games? 
That's unheard of. For $9.41, you get all of this extra content, all of this. And then for $10 or more, you get these. Huh, 10 bucks? Yeah! I'm going to tell you right now, this is all coming out of my, this is coming out of my PayPal right now. I'm doing this. Pay what you want. I'll, I'll drop the 10. PayPal. I'm going to try and buy like two. So I can have some of those King of Fighters and the Fatal Furies. I'm a big fan of the Fatal Fury series. All right. Does this show? Okay. Doesn't show my password. Uh, pay. Authenticating your info. Uh, Contact to process a transaction requires your billing address. Pay now. I'm buying a couple of these because, you know, if I can buy two or three, sweet. Return to the main site. Um, choose your own charity. Um... Uh, Operation Supply Drop. Search. Ha-ha! Select. There we go. It's funny. I'm doing this right now, guys. Let's move around in-game so we don't uh, log right out. Log in. Again, Thorlar, I, I want, after you buy it, make sure you don't show any game codes on screen. No, I will not be showing game codes on screen. Uh, sure, I'll accept it. Oh, my God. That's some serious stuff. Sure, I'll be the mule, bro. No problem. I'll mule. Okay. Get ourselves moving, processing. Save pass. Turn to the main site. I'm going north towards the uh, stone. Like this is this is a major deal. Sandstone and all that. Uh, also, you'll get a link in your email to get codes, so keep an eye on that. I'll catch you all on the flip. All right, Pastor Pedro, thank you, my friend, for the support. It is so appreciated, my friend. Thank you so much. It's a big deal, guys. It is a big deal to me because it's something where I can save up money and buy these big giveaways for you guys. Not only that, but I also get to enjoy a couple of games out of it. I'm a big fan of the Fatal Furies, and, you know, they have Samurai Showdown 2. That's, that's phenomenal. That's actually a really good game. Let's see. Uh, I'm still going to be looking at DX Racer, because, yes, I'm, I'm in that big of a need for a chair. You know, that $20 was well spent, guys. That $20 was spent on some serious Humble Bundle action through you guys. That's, oof, that is insane. That is insane. So many games are up there. So many. Let's get up here and grab that travertine. Have a good night, bud. Catch you tomorrow. All right, CG Airedale. All right, my friend. See you tomorrow around 5 p.m. EST. Don't forget, we are still hanging out here and getting some of this stone, this beautiful, beautiful stone. This stuff is so good. Um, let's see. Um, uh, man. 
I'm I'm still looking at the DX racers like I would really really love to order one. They are out of stock. The wide series. All the wide series are out of stock. Wide. And it's such a nice blue color. Like, I want to show you guys again. That that blue. That blue looks so good. It looks real good. And so is the red. I like the red or the blue. The green is just... It's, it's, it's green. But still. Still. I would love to have me that chair um, because again it's it's built to last it's long lasting and it's gonna last me for a very long time kids or not um, well I mean I'll still have my kids I say kids or not you know because you know they'll be in this chair probably but it's going to last like a piece of furniture like my couch it's going to last for a very very long time these chairs are built to last. Um, let's see, Thorlar, do you think I'd have better luck on on Amazon? Do you think I'd probably have better luck of getting me my chair? I mean, there's a red one up there, but I don't know if it's uh, product features extra large design. Well, that's, that's what they're saying, so the downside, though, is it's Four hundred and seventy dollars. <laughs> Glad to hear you'll keep your kids even when you get a DX raise. <laughs> yes, of course I'm going to keep my kids, especially when I purchase a DX racer. Yes. Um. <laughs> oh my goodness, that sounds so bad. It sounds so bad. Oh my goodness, wow. <laughs> so much wowing. Um. <laughs> Oh man. You guys got me. You guys got me. But uh and they still have no more king in cloth. So no no DX racer for me. King? No more king. Okay, so you're going you're going to buy from DX racer for it? Yeah. Like can you order it ahead of time and just wait for it to be made? Like, that's my question. Can't you just wait for it to be made? And then eventually your order will, order will get to you? Oh, King's the more than 240 pound series? Ah. Got it. Got it. Okay, I should probably look at that series. Um... They have the wide, and then there's King series. Which, not gonna lie, that's, you know, it's all black, it has all the extra stuff, and that's 500. That's, whew, that's a 300 pound difference from what I have. So I'm like, uh, I don't know. That's, you know, in my part, that's that's a huge investment, even on somebody to help me. So, <laughs> wow. Thorlar, I think you left, bro. Um, the question I have is, kid, could I? Let's see, price. No. Global resellers. Oh, Amazon, eBay, Newegg. Okay, well, I love Newegg. I have a great standing with, with Newegg. Um... Gaming. Do they have a gaming chair? Yes, they do. Um, 
Um. Wow. Solkajito07 has connected. Let's see. I'm. Uh. DX Racer LLC, okay. I'm just a smidge away, aren't I? I'm just a smidge. Um... Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. I don't know. I don't know. I, like, if I have to, I'll wait. I'll wait. I don't know. What are you guys thinking? I mean, do you think it's worth waiting on a DX racer? Just continue using the coffee table until then? Or should I, like, try to get one through Amazon and use like an extra large chair purchase or something. Because uh, I'm it's it's like an emergency chair, but I'm on a coffee table. <laughs> I just I don't know. Like I'm I'm just curious about your guys' opinions because honestly it, it does matter. It it does mean a lot that you guys are even doing this this much for me. Um because I, I never expect it. I never ask for it. But holy crap, guys. Thank you so much. The support is just... Conman has left the server. It's... It's a Christmas holiday season, and you guys are just... Just too much. Like, you guys are amazing. It's just... It's... It's insane. I can't believe it. Uh, I need cloth. Uh, not PU leather because I sit around in shorts and have skin touching my chair. Yeah, you'd get all like sticky and sweaty. And and like it's it's like what PU is what padded leather. Or did you mean like POS leather? I, like I, I don't I don't know what PU stands for. <laughs> um, like how would I like would I just wait till like January or February to try and get a chair because they just don't have any, or or would I like chill and wait and then like get the chair from somewhere else? Like I, I don't I don't know what to do, so <laughs> And then I see every like everyone has a DX racer, so I'm like I'm looking into it like this has to be the good chair. Oh polyurethane. Fake leather, yes. Okay. I see what you meant. P U polyurethane. Got it, beach bone. My bad. Solkajito07 has left the server. I mean, the Marine Corps was all about acronyms, but I did not learn that one. <laughs> uh, let's see. Whew. Man, oh man. We are getting that stone gather on. What do we got right now? Ooh! Ooh! 
Ooh, so much tier two and tier three. Some tier four. We're working on it, guys. We are working on it. Because all of our places right now need it. Need, need that tier four uh, <laughs> block. Yeah. I need, I need tier four block. I need tier four travertine block. So in order to make that, I need tier one rough stone, which is just basic rock. Tier two limestone. Then I convert, I refine those into tier two limestone block. Add limestone or add sandstone to the limestone block to create uh, sand or lime, dang it, sandstone block, which is tier three block that we need for one place, and then we create sandstone block with travertine stone, which is tier four, to make traverse travertine stone or travertine block, which is tier four block, <sighs> which all of our other places need in the guild. So I'm essentially working on this. Man, that was a mouthful. <laughs> so much, so much. I just, I don't know, like, I don't know if I should just go and get, like, a $50 chair right now and just, like, you know, have that or buy one of those plastic ones to hang out in that you'd have in your lawn with friends. Like, I, I don't know what to do. For us, for a, for an actual like gaming chair, so I I don't know. I'm just kind of chilling out and and Thorlar man, like you guys have the point. Like I would need like 200 to I would need 200 on what DX's site, DX Racers site. See, let's put everything in one actual tab. There we go. Uh, to be honest, drop fifty dollars on a computer chair at Walmart. Save your cash for a few months until you can get a nice DX racer. Yeah, man, that actually sounds like the better idea. I could, I could probably go to Walmart and go get. The, the cheaper chair for now. Like, I could go do that tomorrow while I'm out getting the glitter for our glitter beard for Friday. We're going to glitter beard this the hell up big time. Um, I'll see about it. I'll, I'll see about it. If not, then I can probably ask another friend of mine. Um, one of our mods, your mom says, hi, I might be able to ask him to take me to Walmart. You know, it's... Five minutes away, ten minutes away, something like that. Well, that's the thing. Instead of ordering it, I could just go to the store, see what they have in stock, and buy a chair. Hell, I might even get a deal if it's, you know, on sale or a display chair. Yeah, I'd say you could find a chair that could last a couple months. A $100 chair will at least will at least last a year or two that way. Oh, Beachbone, I'm, I'm not going to get, like, a $100 chair. I'm just going to, like... I feel like I'm a minimalist when it comes to this. I would rather probably save for that DX racer. I mean, folks think I'm nuts, but you guys drop $200. Uh, $220. $220. And with, with the $20 I just got, I literally just put $20 into that Humble Bundle. That's a beautiful, like, for you guys because that's that's it, it's important it is important to me to have giveaways for you guys let's actually check my email because it's probably like yeah you have all these keys and i'm gonna be like yeah i know because i just purchased them <laughs> humble bundle uh boop boop let's move those in Let's move those into the Humble Bundle section. 
Wow. You guys are just awesome, though. Insane. Move to that one. Oh, my goodness. Uh, just... You guys are nuts. Nuts, my friends. Nuts. All right. Ah, get back on the mount. Uh, those chairs will fail within months if you're too heavy. Like I don't move a lot. Like I'm, I chill. I hang out. I don't think I'm gonna break the chair within a couple of months. I'm only in the chair, literally streaming to you guys. I don't, I don't get all wild and crazy like, oh, 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 you know, and and start break dancing and stuff in the chair, like, it, <laughs> like I just, I'm, I'm not that kind of guy. <laughs> Bye bye, Foxy. Not breaking, but the gas lift will give out. The gas lift? Oh, that thing that like lifts it. I've always like grabbed the side and lifted the chair with me. I've never, I've never like let the gas lift do its thing. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Give me that block. Give it, give it, give it to me. The gas lift will give out. Man, that's when I know I am, like, truly, like, girth. I have too much girth. I'm too big. But I'll take it in a good way. I'm too big on Twitch. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm not, I'm not... Uh, shy when it comes to my weight, uh, you know, I'll make jo I'll make jokes about it because I know I'm a big guy right now. I had one chair literally break under me. One of the spikes of the base broke off and sent me tumbling. An office chair at work <laughs> <laughs> just tumbled it away like wee, <laughs> wee. Oh man, that's got to be too fun. That is too fun. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Grabbing up all that sandstone. Mm-hmm. We'll go up top. We'll go grab that travertine. That, that's actually... <laughs> How did uh, your work take to the chair? Like, did were they like pissed off about the chair breaking, or were they like, <laughs> look out? You know what I mean? Like, you know, or or were they just like surprised? Like, man, we got crap chairs for some really good employees, so maybe we ought to up our game. I know that's what I do. I'm like, <laughs> TX racers for everyone. Within the next two years. Just just put in an order for like 4,000 chairs. You'll be good forever. Hmm. Alright, let's see. Is there anything? Ah, oh, that guy just came from up there. Must have not been anything. go here we go man he's over here gonna take my sandstone damn it damn it I need that stone I need it no my colleagues were concerned for me and as always in big companies nobody that matters was around <laughs> there we go.
That's, I mean, it's messed up that it happened. You know, not, it, it is messed up. So, I mean, you know, as long as you didn't get, like, injured, that's cool. And like you said, no one that matters was around, so no one really cared, I guess. Which, that, that bites a little bit, you know? You're like, man, I'm, I'm a big guy. I should have a chair that fits me in the workplace. DX Racer! You've got the chairs I need. Why are you always out of stock? <laughs> I would love to have one of those. Like you said, the the King series for the big pe for the big guy. And that's that's like a hell of a chair in my opinion. That's a big chair. Stay away from me. You little nasty thing, you. I want stone, and you're taking it! I'm a crafter, I need these resources. Not for the fame and tools, for all the resources. Your resource shall be mine. Mine! And there's nothing. Ooh, travertine. Be sure to drink your travertine now. And then nobody goes nobody goes out here. Travertine, sandstone, travertine, sandstone, rough stone, yay! Here we go. Come on, travertine! So what are you folks, uh, are you folks doing anything exciting for Christmas? Me, I get to hang out with my family. That's a big deal for me. So I get to hang out with my friends and family, maybe see some friends come over. I'm going to attempt to make some of uh, my famous barbecue chicken. Well, barbecue bacon wrapped chicken. It's essentially, uh, you, you use Jack Daniels whiskey. Let it all marinate, and then you bake it. Get to go home to Arizona from New York for the holidays. Ooh, that ought to be fun. From Arizona to New York. That ought to be a lot of fun. Why did I not check over here? I do not know why I did not check over here. Um, essentially, you're going to cut your, your chicken breasts into medallions. Cut them into little medallions, and then you're going to wrap them in bacon until you can't see them. So it's like one or two one or two strips of bacon, completely seal it in. Well, you're going to take that piece of chicken and let it marinate in some Jack Daniels. So essentially the alcohol is going to kill all the bacteria, but you're going to let it sit. And what's, it, what's really cool about it is it's not only going to be sitting in just the Jack Daniels. It's going to be sitting in some brown sugar and pepper. That's all I use. That's all I use. Some brown sugar. It doesn't matter if it's dark brown sugar or light brown sugar. And pepper. Then, because the bacon's got its own flavor, the chicken's going to soak up the flavor of the Jack Daniels, the bacon, and the pepper. And then you're going to, you know, you just let it sit for like five minutes. Then you take the whole thing, all of it. You put it in the oven to bake at about 350 until golden brown or in brown, or until, you know, cooked through. Um, essentially, I cut up one of the medallions and check for pink uh, in the middle of the tray because I, I stack up the whole tray. 
and I go from the very center of the tray and I cut it open and make sure that the chicken is not pink. If it's pink, the whole tray has to go back in. Um, but you essentially want like a, a glaze, a crust sitting on that bacon because it's going to be mm -mm good. And the way you know it's really done for sure and not overcooked is the chicken is going to be so tender, so light, that it's literally, because of the Jack Daniels whiskey, it's going to literally disintegrate in the tastiest chicken bits ever while you have that bite of bacon, and the bacon is going to hold it all in. It's so good. So good. Remember, though, if you want the bacon even throughout, you're going to have to flip them halfway through your own cooking process. I gave them 45 minutes to an hour because I was dealing with, like, kind of frozen pieces. And the bacon was already cold, and then it all started to get really cold again. And I was like, all right, I've got to make adjustments. And you adjust based on time, in my case. Um... So I, I gave them like an hour. And usually that pretty much settles it. And then you have like a nice, a nice like sauce. Usually. If there's any juice left, I throw more brown sugar in it. Like I try and uh, take a bowl, collect all the juices, the bacon and all that. And uh, I let it all sit in some more brown sugar to try and syrupy it, like make it thicken up. And that Jack Daniels flavor is going to come through so good. It just makes the whole thing really, really tasty. And I made it one year where the first batch was fine. There was a lot of Jack Daniels in it. The second batch I made right behind that, I blew my oven door open. It just, boom! And we freaked out. We thought someone broke in the home. Uh, this is when we were actually living in a house before her father evicted us out of it. But this was our first Christmas together and with our son. And essentially, I blew the door open. The alcohol ignited. And it, it was enough pressure in the oven to put, blow that door open. And we freaked out. I went downstairs with a ball bat in hand, looking around, looking around. And then noticed, wait, the oven door is open. That is such an odd thing. Why is the oven door open? And I was like, it clicked. It was like, oh yeah, dummy, you got alcohol as your cooking sauce. No wonder it blew open. Duh. But I, so you know, you throw foil on them. You throw foil on your entire pan. I I did it for both sides so that way there was like an overlapping middle and I let it sit because if it had it it could evaporate out through the two pieces of foil fine but eventually it was just too much and too much evaporated too fast and kind of just like blew open our uh, oven so that's what happened that's it was the best chicken ever I should probably take the whiskey and let it cook on the stove and reduce it so I can cook the alcohol out of it next time. But I made the best sauce, barbecue sauce, in my opinion, ever. My wife loved it. My family loved it. It was a good holiday treat. It was really good. So, so good. <laughs> the wife's about to eat. Sorry, babe. <laughs> I made the wife hungry by talking about the, the chicken. No, you're not. No. You shed pounds faster than I do. It's all that workout. In the bedroom! Bedroom workout! Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, let's see. Hmm. Don't forget, guys, 
definitely drop a follow. It is appreciated, and you get to be notified when I go live. Plus, you get to hear Jim Carrey's Dumb and Dumber tell you guys about the most annoying sound in the world. Who doesn't want to hear that? <laughs> also, have fun with our community here. They're always on at some point throughout the day. Not to mention our Game Key Game Steam group and our, uh, you know, check me out on Twitter, check me out on YouTube, and our CGN Gaming Collection Gaming Network family. Those guys are freaking awesome, just like you, Thorlar. CGN is a gaming community built around streamers. Uh, or with streamers in mind, from Twitch to Hitbox to YouTube Gaming. Um, they have technically free promotion for everyone, and it's something I hope you all check out and get into, because the more you guys do on the website, the more you get back in return. It's actually a really good thing. One of my friends, uh, Ice Prime, just got partnered, and he's been working with uh, the website for... Uh, almost a year now, I think. I think it's been a year, maybe. I'd have to ask him. Really cool guy. Really cool guy. You know, I, I essentially didn't have, uh, the H1Z1 community as Ice Prime did. Ice Prime is probably one of the biggest crews roaming around H1Z1 that I've ever seen. Those guys compete in every single BR they can. Even when Ice Prime's offline, like he's in BRs for H1Z1 like crazy. So seeing that guy work is like watching, you know, perfection <laughs> at times. That that community is just on point with each other. They play a lot together. Um, I'd like this community to get that way through Albion. I'd love to I'd love to squad up with you guys and do dungeon runs. Um, I'll gladly put down my craft, you know, my hammer and my pick to go and do dungeon runs with you guys. That is not a problem at all. Because Crafter Society is all about the crafters and any level of crafting. If you're an expert in crafting swords or you're an expert in crafting, uh, you know, materials, refining, harvesting, all of that. I've got no problem with you guys. I'd love for everyone to be a part of it. Let's see, we're going to go back to Smoky Bay here. So we're going to go southwest, northwest. So let's get to it, my friends. we got to get back to town. Come on, Fido. Why are you attacking me? Why are you attacking me, Fido? Did I not give you enough loving? Did I not throw you a dog bone today? Did I not throw you a dog bone today? There we go. I'm going to leave that hide there because I'm essentially grabbing all the stone I can to take back. We what 280, huh? Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Grab that limestone. Yeah. Let's see. Um, is there anything you folks would like to know about me? Like to know about the arcade? And also, are, do you guys have any questions about Albion currently? I know the new patch makes a lot of things so much easier, so much better for all of us. Uh, yeah, I'll fight you here. Fine. I'll fight you right here, Fido. 
Didn't your mommy hunt with you enough before you became an adult pup? There we go. And as I mentioned, there is the link for Collection Gaming Network, my friends. Holy cow. So much limestone right here as we get ready to go back to town. This is beautiful. got this grabbing all of that stone all right we are a little heavy wow apparently we can hold a whole crap ton wow there we go Let's get through these trees. Like, I kind of want to go get that boar hide, but I don't know if it's uh, rare or uncommon because it is dead. But we are pretty weighted down. So I don't want to grab anything but rough stone on the way back, really. Because I know we'll get limestone anywhere. All right. Uh, there we go. Come on, rough stone. We are going to make it. We're going to make it. Oh, come on. Just that smidge out of the way. Just that smidge. Oh. That range should be a little bit longer. Just, just. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Mm -mm -mm. Just a little bit. All right, I'm going to stop singing. I am not the greatest vocalist in the world. No, sir. <laughs> but that's okay. We try. We try. Yeah? Mm, buddy. Nope. Let us move this way. Moo. Moo, 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 moo. Also, folks, we are fans of Diablo, and the new season is going live. Fido, stop it. I will fight for that boar alone. That boar is going to be so worth skinning. It's, un it's uh, rare. So let's go for it. Yo, Miss Yop, Miss Biggie, Miss Biggie. Hello, come here. Why does Miss Biggie so angry? Well, let's ask him. Yep, sounds angry. Ah, four boar hides. Twenty-four hundred. Oh my. Goodness, that's a lot of boar hide, and that's a lot of fame from boar hide. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> yes, sir, I'll take it. That's so good. So, so good. The steps are this way. Here we go. We're going to skip that limestone because I am so full. We have another map to get through, and I am not going to grab anything the rest of this map in order to not make us, like, snail crawling the heavy. So we're, we're making good progress, good time. 
we have so much stone on us, so much. It, it was actually very, very worth it. We're like almost a third of our way there into our next quarrying tier, which is fine by me. We needed this stone, especially of all four tiers for now, uh, because, well, we need tier four travertine block. We also need tier three uh, sandstone block. We need the sandstone block for our woodworker and our tanner back at our guild hall. Then we need the next tier, a travertine block, tier four, for all of our buildings on our guild island. And we are working towards that. We are working for that, my friends. Holy cow. Our, our tier five ox here definitely, definitely can be our pal. <laughs> Got the wife laughing in the background. She's watching Roseanne. So she streams, you know, I stream from my living room. You guys hear everything that is said. Everything. And I apologize if you guys are unhappy with any of it. I'll take that random rock. Huh? Hummus? Uh, nah. Oh wait, that's right. I gotta get around. I gotta get around this. Before I start going left. That's right. There we go. Not to mention, I'm never gonna run out of copper for copper bars. Because there's so much copper everywhere. This game wants you to have copper. There's just so much of it lying around. Come on, we can make it. We are almost in town. We are a third of the way there. Don't let this ox fall too short. We will make a feast out of this animal. We will make a feast out of him. Thor, Lauren, folks, what time is it over there? And uh, like, how far ahead are you guys, uh, Thor, Lauren? Because I don't know how many hours ahead you guys are. It's uh, 1.31 a.m. here. Just out of curiosity. You can just hear the wife laughing. It's always good times. Good, good times. Let us get back to town. Holy cow. We're almost there, guys. We're over half. We're over halfway there on this map, and it's like just over this ridge. There we are. We're gonna do a lot of crafting. We have a lot of crafting to do, and we can do it back at our guild at no cost. It's so nice. There we go. I wonder if I should try and build a spot and then undercut everyone with a 2% building. A 2% building. Just be like, hey guys, nope, just use my spot. 2%. <laughs> or like 5%. 5% period. Oh, we're almost there, guys. I promise you. We are so close. I'm too loud, is it? Bruce Willis when he was young? Oh, come on. We're going to try and do some dungeon running. I do need the silver, guys. That is the plan here. I do need the silver. Ah, so Guzin is Cat Dragon. We'll drop all the extra resources here. Because, I mean, I don't need 
this, this, those, or that. Oh, we're a lot faster. What is that exclamation mark in the middle of the map? The exclamation mark is the, like, requests for missions. Essentially, you can go to them, set up, and start doing a mission to, you know, craft three novices' swords. And you'll get a little silver, but you'll have to craft them. And then you get to keep them. And you're like, well, then I have three swords. Why? But you'll do the little missions that the game has available through the NPCs. It's not, not too bad. Here we go, 358. Craft. That's not so bad. We got 358 rough stone while we were out. It is actually really, really good. Oh. Wow, we have seriously, seriously gone way past what we normally planned to today but that's okay let's turn that on bam here uh, we go but I want to let you folks know that yes a chair is indeed on its way at some point soon I might be going to Walmart to take care of the chair needs tomorrow for a smaller one. So we'll uh, we'll work on that. I promise you guys we'll have some kind of chair here within the next few, you know, week or so at the worst. Uh, soon could be tomorrow. <laughs> we'll see what happens, guys. Uh, wait, wrong one. And we don't want to make all of it right now. All right, let's run an end of stream giveaway. Who is here for the giveaway? Please verify that you want to enter in on this giveaway with a one. So that way I can see if at least three people are here and that we can start the giveaway process, my friends. Pair, upgrade. Yeah. What's really nice that the today's patch implements dropping thirty every time. It's so so nice. It's so good. It's so good. Yeah, it's it's Friday next week, babe. That's when Christmas is. Yeah, did you check the card? Oh, wait, you can't do that until Friday. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be there. Okay. Come on, we've got, what, two more drops? Here we go. Get this guy set. Huh? What is the traditional kind of meat to have for Christmas? Isn't it pork or something like that, or brisket? No clue. I know, I know, of course, Thanksgiving is turkey or ham. And they don't think they're not Thanksgiving. Uh, Easter is. I don't know, leftovers from Thanksgiving? <laughs> we don't have any. <laughs> we got to throw out those two things of ham that we have. Because I, I, I thought I should, I probably should have just went with a half of a thing of ham when I bought it. Yeah, I could have just bought one turkey. Upgrade. Get this guy going. And we'll upgrade our place from, you know, this crappy looking leather top to a better one. Just takes a minute, guys. Just takes a minute. I 
don't know what the hell's going on with Twitch. I just have this like play sign on my uh, on my Twitch. Is that like a thing? Is that something bad? I don't know. All right, we've got what three more drops of thirty. This one and two more after that. And then we'll have unlocked uh, more for our tanner to do. I'm glad that our stuff doesn't cost silver. I would be in a world of hurt if that were the case. It would suck. Um... Ah, darn it, wrist. I've been at this for seven and a half hours, guys. Let me know if you guys would like to participate in a giveaway by pressing one in, in chat. Let me know, guys. Type a one in chat if you guys would like to participate in a giveaway. I need to know, guys. One! I forgot to upgrade these guys, didn't I? Alright guys, we are going to have a raffle. I think there's enough people. It's going to be a five minute raffle. Oh, wow, that's cool. What? TF Team Fortress 2 items? $25 or more to charity and get all of these? Wow, there's some serious games on here. There's a lot of good games. For all of this stuff, wow, they even have uh, Guild Wars 2 Heroic Edition, Wildstar Fateful Fortune Starter Bundle Add-on, Total War Arena Yogg's Cast Shield, more games are coming, what, one month premium to Total War Arena? So Star Wars, just got banned from three Twitch streams for spoiling it. Oh, oh god, Hangover Hamster, oh god. Uh, no need to worry about it here because I'm not going to see it. Unfortunately, I'm not going to see the new Star Wars. I would rather wait for it to be available in my living room on DVD or something of that point. Um, wow, Chivalry, Medieval Warfare, DEF CON, Medieval 2, Total War... Block and Load, Platinum Pack DLC, Ace of Spades Battle Builder, Chronicle RuneScape Legends Closed Beta Key, Chronicle, Chronicle RuneScape Legends, so what is RuneScape Legends, hashtag grim, at the end the good guys win, <laughs> Oh my goodness. Ronan Dex has left the server. Uh bop 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 bop. What was I gonna do? Oh yeah. Um here we go. Open link in new tab. Woo! Let's go hide redeemed keys. Let's go alphabetical. You know what? You 
control C. I'm going to give away one of my favorites. Copy. Here we go. Start. It is a five minute raffle, guys. Mooch Maker RuneScape Legends equals Hearthstone. Oh, so it's our Hearthstone with RuneScape stuff. I always cited with the Empire. I mean, security, stable economy, can't stump the Trump. Just. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Exclamation ticket space. One. Get those tickets in. Get those tickets in. This is for the King of Fighters 2002 Unlimited Match. This is a Steam key, guys. So I am going to be tossing you a whisper to the winner, folks. So get in on the giveaway. Get in on the giveaway. It's a lot of fun to see this stuff happening. It is a lot of fun to even be playing these games with you guys. So get in on those Steam keys. Yeah, I upgraded. I up okay, I can make tier three. Great. You want tier three block. Got it. And you, sir, want tier three block. How do you know how many tickets you have? Exclamation GC. It is all based on your GC. It's one ticket. Costs one Soul GC. Digito zero seven so has exclamation GC to see your game cartridges. GC is for short. If you guys want to get in on the giveaway, look at that. And also, you guys are gaining five game cartridges every minute we are live. Five game cartridges every minute we are live. Soul That's Digito a big deal, zero guys. Seven has left the server. Big deal. Okay, 128 blocks. Uh, we'll go to our our weaver and get her going. Let's craft. Okay. We'll get her going first. Come over here, because we have a lot of fiber for her, but we need to unlock the ability to use or to use that tier four. Oh, I'm just short. I'm just short. I think I have it back in the thingamajig over there. I think I have like 260. <sighs> uh, it's only uh, one ticket per GC with a max of a one ticket entry. Uh, currently, this is uh, tomorrow will be the craziness of the GC, guys. We were, are going to have raffles. Not. To, I'm sorry. Not tomorrow. I'm thinking today is Thursday. Friday. We are going to have the craziness of raffles every hour on the hour for 24 hours, guys. We are going to be gaming with you folks for 24 hours straight. Can't flim flam the zim zam. That is so right, hangover hamster. Can't flim flam that zim zam. No, sir. Giveaways, my friends. Exclamation ticket space one. Get those entries in. Get those entries in. Hey, thanks again for the World of Warships key, GC. Uh, it was fun to play in closed beta. Aw, oh, dude. Moochmaker, you were one of the folks who got one of the closed beta keys. It's awesome, dude. Congratulations. I was glad I was able to give those out back in the beginning of the year when I could. That was awesome. Hey, Moochmaker uh, and friends here in the arcade, if you could, please let everyone know Friday is our one-year Twitch anniversary, and everyone is invited, anyone and everyone. Please come back, have a good time with us, and definitely hang out for the 24-hour party. We are going out with games, prizes, giveaways. Uh, we're doing so much stuff, guys. So much. You know, besides playing game, changing games either two to three hours, 
uh, and playing only multiplayer games with you guys, we are going to be basically hanging out for 24 hours in celebration of being on Twitch for one year. That's a big deal. Not many people stay for that one year, guys. And this is what I love doing. I love being here on Twitch. I love streaming to you guys. I love hanging out. You know, I can come to Twitch and stream games and have the worst day ever and be cool and chill with you guys in the community in a matter of five to ten minutes. No problem. Oh my goodness, we had people enter. Who has won in the, the giveaway? Let us see. Hangover hamster, my friend. Say something in chat. You have two minutes. Say anything in chat to claim. You just have to type something in chat. Noise, noise, noise on the giveaway, my friend. Nice. You've got two minutes before we re-roll, Hangover Hamster. <laughs> Is he going to claim? What do I type? Pressure. <laughs> Congratulations, my friend. Congratulations. Let's send you that key. Controls. <laughs> There you go, Hangover Hamster, my friend. There you go. You, sir. Congratulations. Congratulations, my friend. And what did he win? He won the King of Fighters 2002 Unlimited Match on Steam. So congratulations. Aye. That is one hell of a giveaway, too. I'm a fan of the King of Fighters games. Not a problem, Hangover Hamster. You won it fair and square amongst everyone who had entered in the raffle. So congratulations, my friend. Congratulations. Let's see. We have all sorts of hide. We have lots of rock. Let's go there. Now let's bring out all of this. Oh, there's all that stone. Oops. Drop that there. Drop that there. Drop that one there. <laughs> oh my goodness. And we'll take this and put it right there. We're going to have a lot more of that by the end of that. A sweet, going to punch some people up. Albion Online Beta Key, you said... What? Albion Online? No. Say, oh, sinner. I did not say Albion Online beta key. I said, King of Fighters 2002 Unlimited match, my friend. Also, have you seen Squad, the, the game? Squad. Uh, no, I don't think I have. Do I not have this one? I don't think I do. All right. Oh, we don't have neat cloth. We don't have. Why did I not grab the other cloth? Fail! 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 I forgot the other cloth back here in our treasure chest. Um, it's right there and there. Let's just make a stack of ninety-nine. Or I could just make a stack. Oh my goodness. I heard you were giving away Train Simulator with all the DLC. <laughs> okay. Really, guys? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. You guys are crazy. Train Simulator. Pfft. Train Simulator? I think I would play something better than Train Simulator. If you ask me. Wow, they really did speed up crafting. 825 at one time would really take a long time. Would really, re oh! oh! It's like $3,500 for 
3,500 pounds for all, oh my god, wow. Is that like the serious, like, that's as real as it gets train simulator? Because that's, holy shit. Like, can you play North America and South America, Europe, Asia, Japan? Like, can you go anywhere in the world in that train simulator? I would, I would expect it to go to every single continent and back. <laughs> oh my goodness! Wow, that is that is a lot of money for Train Simulator DLC. That is a lot of money. We'll max out our crafting there. Come on, come on. Hey, Airedale's back. Oh, no! No! Oh! Oh! Some block, huh? I'll accept. I'll accept on that block. Woo, buddy. Let's do this. Get that cloth going. Uh, it's all, it has most of the train lines in the UK and some in California. My cousin has like $5,000 worth of in real life train sets, but he's retarded. Wait, you mean like he's like mentally handicapped in real life? Or like you think he's an idiot for spending 5,000 pounds uh, in train? Like 5,000 pounds is a lot of money in American dollars. That's like what? Like over $10,000? Because that's uh, a lot. That's a lot of... That's serious money, guys. Elder Adventurer! Yes! Master Adventure Avatar unlocked! Hell yeah! Elder mounts! Tier 8 or Tier 7 usable. Elder accessories usable. What? Oh my goodness. Elder buildings buildable. Elder's Demolition Hammer. Usable. Wow. Oh my goodness. Uh, craft. 5,000 British pounds equals $7,478.25 US dollars. Oh man, that is seriously. Congrats. Like actually Down Syndrome, so my grandparents bought him at all. Ah, 5K could have got me, like, a car or an investment in something. Um, I could have literally invested, like, a lot. Like, 5,000 is, like, hmm, I'm going to go buy a house. I'm going to go, like, put down on a house and live comfortably, guys. Um, <laughs> see you later. You know what I mean? Like, wow. That's, uh, wow. <laughs> That's all I've got to say about that is just Wow. Come on, craft the uncommon fine cloth. Craft it, craft it. Come on. Yay! Hmm. Well, we dropped some weight. Thank you, Airedale, my friend. Thank you. Wow, that is like a lot. Hell yeah, we can put that to good use here in the guild. We can put all of that stone and cloth to good use. Thank you, Airedale, my friend. It is freaking appreciated. Woo! Go up here, tier two. 
We'll just drop all of that right back there. Let's see, tier four block will take. Tier four stone, drop. Tier three stone, drop. Um. that we can't use this yet crap I don't think we can use that either shoot all right we'll come over here and start crafting whoa we had a minor glitch there uh, we can make a ridiculous amount of birch this is actually really nice regardless of how much you're putting in there's actually a set point for the high end, there's an. It seems like there's a set cap, because at 999, I could literally go use the restroom, go get me something to eat and drink, come back, sit down, eat and drink in front of you guys, talk some more, and still not be done yet. Um, I seem to like this a lot faster. This is this is an improvement in the patch. This is a huge improvement. Uh, except their party invited you to their party. Um, in a second, Airedale, we're almost there. All right. Differences between gold and silver coins. Um, Hangover Hamster, the difference is, like, right now, gold seems to be on a trade market. Like, it's, a, it's, it's currency that you can use to transfer back into silver. But you can buy when it's low, invest your silver into gold, and essentially when you die in a yellow red, when you die in a red or black zone, that that does not drop off of your person. So you essentially make a smart investment that will not fall off of you at any given time. But then you can invest back into silver when the trade value is high, in order to rake in mass mass amounts of gold as much as possible. I like it in general too, but it's too fast for below 300 numbers. Oh yeah, yeah, for below 300, yeah. It's ridiculously fast. Let's see, 844. Let's craft it. Let's see what we're going to get. Um also while I'm talking here, it's, it, wow, it's like 2 in the morning. So can you actually use gold for anything uh, other than turning it into silver? Silver is the in-game currency. You trade, uh, when you buy items, you do everything with silver. You buy in the marketplaces in town. You buy in your guild marketplace. You buy, and you do it when you go to other people's uh, crafting stations. You use your silver to craft. Um you know, essentially, it's it's kind of expensive. Have I played with the auction house? What are you talking about, Sayo Center? In game, the in game auction house with the guild mark or with the marketplace? Yes, I've actually been selling high end materials and trying to reap the rewards by stocking up on silver. You know, the materials we can make but don't need yet. Pine planks. Craftable pine planks. Not craftable here yet. Not craftable here yet. Oh, banners, snowballs, etc. Um, I haven't bought the craftable stuff yet. Premium status, 210,000. 
360, 1.5 million. Woo! That's a lot. Additional benefits, plus 765 crafting focus per day, double crop yield from farming, double farm animal growth rate, half market tax. Wow, really? Did not know that. A one year, 360 day premium. 1.5 million. That's that's actually doable in this game. That is doable. Let's see, premium benefits, 20 learning points per day. 20. So in a week, you'll build up 140. Plus 50% Destiny Board Fame. That's good. Plus 50% Gather and Giggle. That's, that's questionable. You know, it's like 50% each time you use craft or harvest here. Drop that there. Let's see, go here and drop that there. Um hmm. See, how much is that? 20? I could wait. I could wait. I can go to the fiber farm and make that. What I really want to save on is this when it's tier 4 and it costs 101. Oh, where do I buy the vanity items? Is that the gold market? Buy gold from AlbionOnline.com. Buy gold from other players. Sell your gold to other players. Let's see. The buy gold market. Whoa. 80 silver per one gold. It's 82 silver right now. Let's see, premium, I can buy three, uh, 360 days of premium. That's going to be easily doable. Just save up all your silver. Trade on the market. Bam! And there you go. You'll be able to just bink, 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 bink. Guy between the island guy and the market. Oh! I know who you're talking about now. Also, what are these ones? Stone cutters journal. All right, we filled up the stone cutter. Let's go to the stone cutter here. And give you a journal. Oh, I see. I need things in here. Did you play any Fallout 4 this week? I played like two hours of Fallout Sayo Center. Is the market player drip uh, is the marketplace player driven because my friends and I in World of War uh, World of Warcraft could easily fix the market. They need beds and a table. Yep, yep, need beds and a table. Working on that right now. Go back to Smoky Bay. Um basically, guys. Or no, I can go back to my guild island. What am I doing? Um, each town is has its own marketplace. Not across all towns. Each town has their own economy. So you go to the marketplace and you buy based on that town. Some towns have more wood. Some towns have more tools. Other towns are known for their armor and weapons. Um, essentially, that's just how it's working right now. It's kind of cool to see that kind of stuff. We need to come over here to our accessory guy. Yes, our accessory guy. And get that stuff. Furniture. Let's see. Oh, I have that. I have that. I have that. 
Okay, let's bring all of that over. So what, 30, 40, well, 40 and 50, 60, 10, and 50. Tier 3 claw. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. So I'll do like a hundred of each. Or I can just go that. That. And that. That works too. They need beds and a table. Beds and a table. See? Beds and a table. See? Furniture. We're going to craft two beds. All right, all right. Look at us making that fame. Does this contribute to anything? Nope. One table. We'll put that table in the corner. We'll put two of our beds. We'll line them up on the wall. And we'll make one treasure chest. 879,000 kilogram limit. Beds and a table. I am on it, my friends. I'm making two so I can take this second one back to my place. <laughs> Ah, place. A house cannot contain furniture of a tier higher than itself. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, I have no clue what you said, my friend. Vizard, ick. My friend, please use English. I, I can't understand. Um, upgrade. I can do this right now. I can do that right now, I think. Shoot. I, I, I goofed a little bit. I made tier 3 everything, and I shouldn't have. Shoot. Um, oh, hello. Hello, Vizard Ick, or Vizard IQ. Let's see. Oh, we don't have Tier 1 stone. We do have this. And we do have... We do not have Tier 3 block. But we do have Tier 3 wood. We'll take the bigger one, just in case. Crap, man. I don't want to just be like, oh, well, uh, shoot. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't want to... No, 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 no. Go back, go back. Upgrade. I have this. Yeah, we need tier one really, really bad. Shoot.
I, I'm I feel like an idiot. Um shoot, because we want to give our stone guy the book, and right now he's only gonna get one. But we need to upgrade our guild hall. Oh man. It's one of those things. It's a little it's a little upsetting when you're like, yeah, all right. And then you're like, ah, oh, shoot. I got excited. I thought I was going to be able to do this. But don't worry, guys. We'll have this set up tomorrow. We'll have our guild hall ready to go tomorrow. Easily. We can make tier 2 stuff as well. And thank you for the follow, the support, Vizard IQ. Thank you, my friend. The support is extremely appreciated. Thank you so much. Hey, want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love Jim Carrey in Dumb and Dumber. For providing us with that amazing sound. The best sound heard worldwide. Hey, want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Good times right there. Good times. Let's see. At least this is so much faster. Instead of increments of five, ugh, at least this is so much faster, guys. Um, tomorrow we will be here at 5 p.m. EST. If you want to know what we are doing, then definitely hit us up, my friends, uh, by clicking that follow button and sliding for that notifier. Thank you guys for being here. Thank you guys for having so much fun with us. Thank you guys. I love, love the support. I love the hosts. Thank you, Thorlar, Leia Justice, and the Big Bad Buddha for the, for the hosting support, guys. They are awesome streamers. Yeah, great stream tonight. Thank you, Lumber Dump. Thank you, my friend. We have we've notoriously been streaming every day. Last week, Albion Online was our big game, and we went for like 20 hours of almost every day. It was insane. Um, I didn't expect to be putting in like 24 hours and 20s, 20s, 20s back to back with this game, but it has been so much fun. Uh, we will be getting a chair by Friday. By Friday, I will tweet it out. I will let you guys know what's going on. Thorlar, my friend, thank you for the crazy supportive community and all of the fun times so far. Uh, if you guys want to know what I'm doing off stream, hit us up on Twitter. Follow us on Facebook. Follow us on our YouTube channel. Um, I have all of the links down below in our Twitch panels. Not to mention, we have revamped our Patreon. We now have like an actual Patreon that looks uh, like a thing. Would Dota players... What now? What about Dota players? Would Dota players such... Sorry for Google Translator. Yeah. Have a good night, bud. We'll be getting some materials for the island. Thank you, Airedale, my friend. Thank you. Alright, guys. This has been an amazing night, and thank you guys for participating in the end of stream giveaways. Thank you so much for that. It has been amazing here playing with you guys. So I hope you all have an amazing night full of good times. Just like I have had an amazing stream full of great new friends, great new fond memories, and all around just having fun playing with you guys. It's, it's been a blast, and I can't wait to do it again tomorrow. I wish I didn't need sleep. I'd just keep streaming, but I do need sleep. <laughs> Silver fox beard. Yes, yes. We are going to be glitter bearding, guys. We're going to glitter beard in order to save this beard. 
I had the hair dye all set up, and then I realized I need to save this. So, raid? Yeah, we could definitely do a raid. We could definitely do a raid. Let me see our friends. Let's see. It is like 2 in the morning. Yeah. We could definitely do a raid. Uh... <laughs> There's so many cool folks on right now. Um, let's see. We haven't done a raid in a while, guys. We have not done a raid in a while. Are you guys ready for a raid? Because we are going to go do one. We are looking. We are looking. Hmm. We have not seen a raid in quite some time. If you guys also like action, we have another fun uh, streamer. He has a blast in Borderlands 2. Someone playing Albion Online? Okay, do you guys want us to showcase another Albion Online streamer? Or do you guys want to see something else? That's a question for you guys. Because I'm leaving you guys in the hands of another streamer. I would love to hear your guys' feedback on that one. Um, it is important to me because I would like to leave you guys with somebody fun. You know, someone you, who's going to entertain you guys. And anyone I point you guys into that I know. <laughs> raid me! Raid me! <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's see. Uh... We could raid another Albion Online streamer. We could do that. Uh, let's see. Let's go hit up Guzin. I want to go check him out right now. Um, hmm. They're not really talking at all. Uh, D. Shoot. <laughs> I'm I'm really really trying here. I'm looking. Um, one guy's got literally a chick washing a car. I really don't care for that. Whoa. The person I was looking at is not even playing anymore. Um, <laughs> holy cow. Um, let me show you guys off to a good friend of mine. I would like you guys to, to take in some good times. Vitas equals Vitas seventh element. Ah, I'll have to check that out after the stream, my friend. Let's let's go do a raid though. Let's go do a raid. Essentially, this is how raids work. We're gonna go in. I will give you the signal. The arcade is now open, and then you guys will spam game raid. In the screen, if you guys have emotes, throw them up. If you guys have uh, anything else you want to say besides Game Raid, hold off on that part. Just, just Game Raid, some emotes, and have a blast. Because I'm always going to leave you guys with one of our friends, somebody who's a good player and good listener. I love watching this guy. He brings me lots of joy.
when I come to his channel, and I love hanging out with him. Wait, why did it do that? It should it should have just gone to his channel. I don't know why it clicked the game itself. So we are going to go hit up our good friend. Uh, again, wait for the signal that the, the arcade is now open. Wait for the signal. We are going to raid this man. So get in there, get into his channel, and wait for the signal. Right now, I regret that the school badly taught English. Oh my goodness. You guys are going to wait for my signal. Just get over there into his channel and wait. He is an awesome Borderlands 2 streamer and has quite literally done everything in Borderlands 2. If you guys have questions about how to fight bosses, how to get gear, where to, where to farm for gear, how to do tricks, this guy has definitely got the skills. He is definitely has connected. a good guy. Definitely check out Finn and wait for the signal, guys. Wait for the signal. So get on over into Finn's channel and then hang out. All right, guys. Empress has left the server. Empress has connected.